Real Tart to Lini. I think we have to wait, Tart. I think we have to wait like 20 minutes or something. It's actually fake taxi, not real taxi. Hello, wie geht's? Welcome to the ESL Meisterschaft. Guten Abend. We are 10 out of 10 in the lobby, though. We're waiting for production. Let's wait. <laughs> All right, guys, here's what I know. Here's what I know. The game is scheduled to start at 3 p.m. my time. It is currently 17 minutes to go. However, there are 10 out of 10 in the lobby. They're doing, um, I think it's some kind of a winner interview, perhaps, with QP Dota. And then we will get into the match. You never left. Oh, sorry, Tart. He was here the whole time. Like his Dota 2 guides. Alright, Tortellini. If you are the real Tortellini, how many of Tortellini's guides include divine rapier as a situational item well 
Like all is extension and it's two. I wish I knew what that meant. Let me have a look. Okay, I can look at your guides here, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. There must be one tortellini guide at the top, near the top. <sighs> what the hell? Oh, right at the top. Here we go. <laughs> oh, you always put them in a box called extension. I see what you mean. I see what you mean. Okay. Yep, 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 yep. Covered by Steel Series. Yeah, man, that's a big, it's such a big chunk to the, the, the hero. I could say... I don't know, maybe ultra late game sniper. Maybe ultra late game sniper, I would go rapier on. Like almost always. But I don't think any game really gets to that point. Wait, are we loading? Are we loading? Are we loading? I think we're loading, guys. Wait, was my timer real all along? No. We are loading, guys. We are loading. What did my timer say? Oh, that's actually not bad. Not bad. Mm, probably need to add a couple minutes, but not bad. Not bad for a guess, guys. Not bad for a guess. Yeah. No, I no. I think it's fair. I think it's fair, given the range of people who are using your builds. Like, I think pretty much everybody who starts is like totally do totally new builds. So, yeah, they're not going to be situationally aware as to when Divine Rapier is the boy to use. If it's more of a, look, it's Tortellini, he knows that Divine Rapier is only an extension, not, um, uh, yeah. That was a question I knew you, only the real Tortellini would be able to answer. You see, the answer you gave was irrelevant. The depth and so forth was enough to clarify who you were. So. Hello, Adam Pave here. Right, okay, we are loading and this is the semi-finals. After this, we're gonna do the grand finals. This is IV versus Brain. Brain from DPC. Yeah, that Brain. And this is called the ESL. Hang on, I've got it here. Someone has explained it to me. Where's my Discord on? Here. It is the ESL Meast Rob Shifter. Okay.
Oh. Excellent. Ah, have two minutes of your life back, gentlemen. You are welcome. Most welcome. All righty, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, get in here for the ESL Meister Shaft Spring 2021 Ivy versus Bream. I am General Jeevikus, and holy moly, that draft, the pan goes out, get rid of Earth Spirit, you. No more AA, no more Timberstone. Hello, Tusk. And with a granny, yep, yep, yep. All right, well, I mean, wow, wow. These are, uh, these are some thick and fast picks, boys. Hey, Freddy, what's up, my dude? Yeah, we need to uh, we need to bash this one out. This uh, see this this one out to end the month, I think. Shentor War Runner, strong in the off lane, gentlemen. A big beefy strength core. He has a what does he do, Jeeves? He stomps. Yes, he has double edge. Yes, he has uh, shit. What's it called? Retaliate, and then stampede. Medu, sir. All right, guys. Here's the choice: Snapfire as a young Snapfire, or Medusa pre-transformation, but knowing that by being with her, she transforms into Medusa. The lion gets banned out, get rid of the anti-mage. No more morphling. Do we have game sounds? No, no game sounds. Into what, gentlemen? They'll be along shortly. Puck kick to the curb. Okay, okay. Does anyone know anything about either of these teams? Like, in regards to what they like? I mean, what I'm seeing from Brame so far, very solid. What I'm seeing from Ivy, super good. They've got a save. They've got the Medusa ult, which is really difficult to fight into. You know, it's fine. But imagine Snapfire eats the centaur and then just launches him at you. You know? Have you ever been hit in the face with like a 750 pound centaur? Oh, dire team ban. All right, all right, take out the aisle. Take out the aisle. No badges for these teams, guys, but the bets are open. The bets are open. Remember, if you're following for the first time, you get bonus 250 Jeep coins. Oh, you show the match. Mars. Mars, man. So you go for the clockwork, right? This is kind of highly favored, I'd say, in Europe right now. Seconds to pick your hero, you moron. The solution for the Dusa, geez. I mean, did the troll work the other day? I like the Elder Titan, but they set up with the Elder Titan before, right? Mm -hmm. Did the troll work? I can't remember. Honestly, the snack is such a pain in the ass these days. Soon, gentlemen, soon. Oh, dire team, pick them up, pick them 
Winter Wyvern. Winter Wyvern. PKB piercing disable, so they got a they got two saves. Um one of them which makes you completely immune. They've got BKB piercing disable, two of them, jeez, two BKB piercing disables. Yeah, there's five seconds left now. I don't know, Cold Embrace feels a little bit meh late game against Elder Titan, actually. If he's standing nearby and he whips out the aura, you're like, holy moly. What do we think, Jeeves? Why is it so quiet? Can you hear any desktop audio, man? This is game one, big, big bet. We're going to be covering this series and the finals. So uh, stick around. The Drow Ranger. Oh no, what have you done to your animations, Jeeves? Let me show you guys. If you do this. You can fix your animations. Very good, very good. Much skills. Uh, ten seconds to pick your hero, you moron. I mean, it will eventually correct itself if you leave it to its own device. Action! Okay. Okay, so they have the double armor fuck you with the Elder Titan Dry Ranger. I took out the TA because that would just add some sauce. So Shadow Fiend's still a potential pick for Brain. What's uh, w Wish is the mid, right, for Brain? Does he play the Shadow Fiend? Uh. Storm Spirit, get rid of Lena. All right, the Void Spirit also kicked to the curb. Oops. Maybe they want them to pick the Shadow Fiend, right? Tiny coming in. Okay, I like this. It's good for getting onto the Dry Ranger. It gives them even more control. They've got two BKB piercing disables. They've got the snowball save. They've got the cold embrace. They've got the tiny toss. What's it gonna be? A What? Tinker. 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 All right. We got ourselves a draft, guys. We got ourselves a draft. Game one. Is this, is this a meme or is it real life? Um. Okay, so over on Ivy, we have Y50 on our task. We've got Hawk on the Medusa, Natu RL on Winter Wyvern, the Bloody Sky on Axe, and Copy on the Tiny. Oh, brave. Middle School P on the Snapfire, Kaito on the Center War Runner, Luft on the Elder Titan, Focus Drow Ranger, and Wish on the Tinker. I am General Jurgis. Let's get our Dota 2 on! Hmm. 
It's Gauti. Thanks for the follow, my dude. Speak friend and enter. Keep it clean, keep it positive. No live odds and no spoilerinos. Who do you think is going to win, Jeeves? Well, I think Brave have got something here. The Ivy... Are Ivy good? If Ivy are better than Brame, then... Well, I mean, if Ivy are as good as Brame, I think they win the game. I don't know about this Tinker, man. That's what's throwing me off. Is Tinker even good? Is Tinker even good? Question mark. Alright, 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 everyone in high spirits, good to see you, good to see you as we come into the semi-finals here, what does the robot think, Jeeves, ooh, only two points draft advantage to Ivy, where's that coming from, Jeeves, is it mango flavoured, mm -mm -mm. no mangoes, Ice Frog gonna be rolling about mad, no one believes in the frog's prophecy, Graham has three stand-ins, uh, well, this guy, Luff, does he have stand -in? Very aggressive opening here, but they're not going to find anything for it. Maybe they secure, what, two runes off the back of this? Definitely some pings coming through. He's like, hey, if everyone's down here... All right, Morty, the game's about to start. You'll be able to secure elsewhere. Very aggressive. If I center, I just run straight at this one, honestly. And he already has the tree grab, so... A lot of shenanigans for not much uh, results is what I'm going to put this one down to. Wait, wait, why 50? Maybe they want to get a little bit aggressive with it. Negatory, sir. So 50-50 uh, on the bounty runes despite all that manoeuvring. Rise on ski. How's it going, dude? Yeah, what's the story with the, uh, the stand-ins in this game? Does anyone know? Uh... Right, well, that was not very helpful. Still nothing skilled up on task here. All right. Look at this lane as well already for Kaito. I mean, already falling back behind the line. Nice, nice. Boots down a little bit of uh, stomp action. Okay, okay. Up top, what's the situation? We've got the Dry Ranger focus and laugh. The Elder Titan, the Dry Ranger versus the Bloody Sky Axe and Naturel on the Winter Wyvern. And copy six and one versus the Tinkers, two and zero. How does one even Tinker versus Tiny in the mid lane, guys? That feels like such a rough matchup. I mean. I can't really take advantage of the fact. Do you not just go... No. Because Tiny has no armor, right? So you want to abuse that. But you can't really abuse that as Tinker. Maybe in the olden days you could. Laser, I guess. Knock him off his game. 6 and 1 versus 5 and 0. Pretty even on this bottom lane for now. Shard stack, nice, nice. He still got plenty of regen to work with here, save for Centaur. I mean, it's, this bro's got two salves. Damn, practically a medic. No. A little bit of damage, fires off the rockets. It's two minutes time to do the old uh, trader route, refilling the bottle. Both. Other balls. This is pretty even to start off with, I have to say. Hmm. Mm, a little bit of battle hunger. Give him the ice arrows, Jeeves. Give him the ice arrows. Boots for Winter Wyvern. Not on China Duel. I know, guys. I know. I don't know if these guys are good, though, you know? I know one team is in the DPC or something. 
But they're not like winning the DPC, right? I think they went like three and four, maybe. But the, apparently they've got a load of stand-ins, so now I'm like, did they not take this tournament seriously? Uh, why are why are there stand-ins? And is it to do with the fact that they're not German? Or do all the players have to be German? I don't know. I don't know. Talk about this mid lane, geez. 18 and five versus 13 and one. Wish is not having a fun time. Yay, missiles. Now, I guess he kind of knows you have wards, bro. He definitely knows your wards now. Three gold. You don't care, man. 21 and 5? Alright, alright, alright. A little bit of Arctic burn here. He's slowed up. D ward with a sentry off the stomping. Now, what's he get damage by 30? 20, yeah, that'll really, that'll really sock it to him. He's he's gonna feel the pain here. Ooh boy. Ooh boy, oh boy, ooh boy. Yeah, 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 yeah. Axe a little bit late to respond there, I think. If he goes over a little bit earlier. Um does he have call though? That's the big question. He doesn't have call, so I mean it doesn't matter. Like if the guy is gonna panic, he's gonna TP, right? Denied on the rune, by the way. You keep late. Oh man, I was watching the game last game. Was it last game? I was watching the end of it and Wraith King, he died and then he dropped it to Divine Rapier and Faceless Void leapt forward to pick it up but Wraith King bought back and ran forward and the two of them were right there. But Faceless Void needed to move something in his backpack. So Wraith King was able to pick the Rapier up. Seen a lot from Ivy, they've got potential. Yeah, I mean, that's what I'm seeing here right now because I expect, even with a few substitutes, right, Brame should be... You know, they should be they should be clapping on them right now. But Ivy are in a pretty a pretty pretty good position, you know, less than 1k net worth difference, but it's in their favor. And this is a bit a little bit frisky. Those ice arrows gonna tickle on the way out, not gonna lie. Did he have barrage available? He did, he didn't use it. Hmm. It's level two as well. I maybe underestimated the Point of damage you would do there to the yachts. Oh, the Ava, the toss. It's not enough to deck him though. Um, Tinker, once he gets level six, he's gonna be quite frustrating for copy. That's when he can actually start to do stuff in the lane. Well, I mean, he ain't just gonna be doing stuff in that lane, Jesus, is he? No, true. Laughed, are you gonna die? Is this the first blood? No. Holding up butterflies again, Jeeves. I know, I know, I know, guys, I know, I know. It is six minutes into the game, though. Honestly, I think since I started casting EU games, I moved to League of Legends. Oh, that was good, though. Pew, pew, he's level six. Choo, 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 choo. He did not level. All right, whatever, man. He just wants to dominate the lane for a bit. Okay, that's cool. Forget everything I said about Tinker coming online at level six, guys. He's gonna he's gonna go for missiles and rockets, and that's fine. He knows what he's doing. The trick is to do more damage with less button pushes, Jeeves. Yes, so you don't get done in by the uh, spam block, right? Ooh, Kaito. It burns, it burns. Ooh, okay, nice, nice. I mean, you are a centaur. 24 and 6. Remember when he was super far ahead? Yeah. Pepperidge Farm remembers. I wish. Tell me more, tell me more. When do you skill? Oh, oh, there's a fight. We see it. The first blood Kaito to fall. Oh, beautiful. 100% of the kills, 100% of the time. Jeeves do a TV experience. First blood! Copy with the avatar. Nice! Second blood! Double? No. Not quite. Double blood doesn't sound the same. Don't got the same ring, boys. Don't got the same ring. All right, focus. What's he got going for himself? He's got the power treads. All right, all right. He just goes for the cheeky stick, by the way. He hasn't finished up that wand yet. 
So that's single Wraith Band. Uh, Vanguard done for Axe. Wasn't sure whether or not he would go for Vanguard or... Um, like the Hood first, but, you know, it makes sense. It makes sense. Vanguard for both of them. I mean, literally everyone just builds this item juice, because then you can just go do Ancient Stacks, right? It's pretty good here as well, versus Tinker. This is physical, right? Oh, it's magical. Oh, forget what I said, though. It's magical now? Yeah, stream for the last 17 patches, you moron. Yes, Bloody Sky doing so much damage there. The three of them, enough in the end to bring down the mighty axe. You know, Helix is a terrible drug. Hell of a drug, hell of a drug. Oh, oh, one hit. Nice, 30 gold, very tasty. Gets a stack as well. Oh, I mean, obviously. It's a, the respawn juice. Yeah, not really a stack, is it? No. Good point. Good point. Don't need to be so pedantic. Yo, gonna jack this bounty root? Mm. Hey, Tiny, you've got a ball, bro. You wanna fill up? Yeah. Okay. I love that when you put the sentry down after I mean when you put the orbs down after the sentry's been up for a little while so they don't see you putting it down and they assume that because there's a sentry there they don't have vision like a jubeid play bloody sky slowed up here QP look at the angle oh no the counter play the avatars bam the dunkening and then from the side natural he's ready to get into the fight here a little cookie play forward stomping to hold them in place wishes here neither rockets neither march of the machines there will be lasers you're gonna survive with a whisker of hp left running through there giving him the old ham shank the copy's ready for it with the avatars of the counter play brings them down Damn, damn, nice, nice from Ivy. It looked like they were going to be in a pretty bad spot. And uh, they turn it into two kills. Nice. Ivy are, pre are pretty solid, guys. Ivy are pretty solid. Rain perhaps regretting the... Uh... Let's just send the subs. Play. I don't know, does anyone have details? Does anyone know if it's like an if you have to be German to play in the league? Is that like a thing? Okay, Avatars. They get themselves focused again. QP, not quite close enough to help a bro out. You do see this big stack of uh, ancients as well. They need their axe though. Where is axe? Yo, axe is doing a big stack of ancients already, Jeeves. Oh, if I was Axe, I'd be like, let's go, and I'd be straight over there. Yo, Avatos there, and underneath the march of the machines, but it's very low level march, right? It's actually, no, jeez, it's level four now. Oh, he stopped Rocket at two, huh? I thought he was maxing these two first. Okay. Arch him, Avatos back into the call. Nice, the dunk. There we go, very nicely played. Bloody Sky. Plus copy. A little tag team combo there with a the Dunkaroo. Loving it, loving it. Off downtown. First to 10 kills. Looking pretty easy for Ivy at the moment. What item progressions are we looking for here? The Blink Dagger in the center of Warner. He's going back for a value cloak. Wait, what is this? No, not again. Love the snowball in the Chardoning. Is it there? He doesn't need a Jeeves. He's going to punch him to next week. All right, cool. Who's coming in? QP. He's looking for the angle. 8 to 2. 5k net worth at 12 minutes into the game. Jeez. We talked about it. 5 minutes. There was literally no difference between the teams. 7 minutes later. Now, now we're here. Oh, okay. There was a little bit of a mystery to the situation from Kaito there. And missiles go through. Copy setting up some jungle cams. They're going to back this off. They did get some TPs, though. They did force some rotations. Making space on the map. And, uh, oh. Nah, I won't do a Mystic Snake through that. No, 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 no. 
Pai Long, as far as I understand it, it's only like they've got three stand-ins or something on break. Nice, nice. And look at this bloody sky. He's over here. He's with Hawk. You make this an event now. Stealing your, t and, you know, taking your stocks, stealing the enemy stocks. It's like going for bounty runes in the old meta, right? You go as a squad, you get it done. It's juicy. It's real juicy. Alright, he's, uh, he's almost got his man out of that. Mr. Blink Dagger Axe is ready to go, bloody sky. Bobby with a blink dagger of his own, going back for his power treads, feels good man. You know, stiffen him up a bit, thicken him up a bit. Why do you want Graham to disband, man? That makes no sense. Why would they? They're in a the DPC. Now that's like league money. You're always gonna get something from your sponsors for being on screen. Nice jump, nice call, the snowball in, bye, easy take down of the Elder Titan, there's a clear there, the dunk, ah, the only problem with that is it puts your dunk on cooldown, it looks cool, it does look cool, but, now you can't dunk Cupid, you know, feels sad, he's got to wait 60 seconds to dunk again, it, it looks cool, geez. it does look cool, it does look cool, okay, Kaito, his Blink Dagger nearly done. They're playing from behind. Remember, 6k down. First 10 kills wa was secured by Ivy. Oh, Kaito's here. Was he Invis? Invis from the Invis rune, okay. Hmm, first item Dragonlance. Gives him a bit of beef. Wishes TPing in here. They know where he is. They got Blink Dagger, the call. Pull him back in a little bit. There's a laser. That's a lot of damage. That's a lot of damage. Remember, no magic. Resistance. Well, next to uh, the ghosty. Yo, Source Barhawk, thanks for the follow, my dude. Speak friend and enter. Keep it clean, keep it positive. No live odds. odds. No spoiler minos. Avatos. Oof, love the cookie play. Oh no, once again, swerve. Now the snowball back in. They'll actually take him for a ride downtown. Looking for Kipe here. He's got a punch, but the TP forward from Wish gets a little bit spooky. Now the laser, they start dropping bombs down town. The cold embrace, gonna save some ass. Now Y50, he's running through Nam right now. Look at them coming through. Oh no, now the arrows as well. The follow up from Wish with the laser, not like this. Nah, no, kind of play. Bloody Sky's there on top of the dry. This time the cookie's decent. They do bring down that dry ranger though. It's 50-50, it's two kills each. It'd be the trade. I think they come out on top though on Ivy again, right? I mean, any kills are probably going to frame right now. He's got the dunk. He does not have the dunk, Jesus. Ooh, double the damage on the river here. Could you transition into a Roche? 16 minutes into the game. Yeah. They don't have like a. I mean, I guess Axe could tank it, right? Dry Ranger AFK? No. He's building. What is she building? BKB? Fuck. <laughs> uh, I mean, first item. First prop, right? BKB. Alright. Okay, okay. I mean, Axe is in here, in behind the tower. Poppy's in position, in position as well. Yep, Y50. Okay, okay. He's got some information. He goes for the Shardening. The tag team's been put in at action. Now, Poppy arrives on the scene. Avatar's back to the stomp. But then, looking for the stampede away. But guess what, Bloody Sky's there. With the Dunkaroo. Oh, a little bit of missile fire coming back the other way. It doesn't feel good. How are they hitting him way down here? I don't know. They don't even have... Hmm. Okay. Tower's down, though. Situation bottom. Tier 1 bottom. Still pretty frisky, I have to say, for Ivy. Barely a scratch upon it. Radiant spot of tower is under 
But tis but a scratch, Jeeves. Tis but a scratch. Okay, Hawk with the Manta building into Acceptor. Yep. Nothing bullshit about that. A little bit of scouting, 18 minutes into the game, the tier 1 bottom finally gonna fall. I mean, it's only, what, a minute behind the tier 1 top? Jeeps, I guess, I guess. Get the Roche bit, 18 and a half minutes, 8k net worth, ages for grabs, accept or done on Medusa. Alpha Jackson and Domino Prod 420. Thank you, boys, for the follow. Speak friend and enter. Keep it clean, keep it positive. No live odds, no spoiler alerts. Welcome. I'm liking Ivy, guys. I'm liking them. Let's go. What's the Ags on Tinker these days? Oh, the tiny shrink ray laser. Okay, I'm down, I'm down. Oh, wait, 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 wish he sticks around. He's like, wait a minute. Oh, he just, he's just gonna cut behind her, fair enough. This is great though, this is great. Because of this, what he's done here, like there's literally nothing they can do now. Like, the idea was to just take Aegis, go top, apply pressure to the tower, right? But backdoor protection, it's going to make it very difficult to push into. Down town, he's applying some pressure of his own. Wait, the Winter's Curse on the backside onto Coupe here, not Truel. I don't know if you want to come in too close here, bro. All right, they are actually all here. Wish with a blink away. You got any missiles? He's looking for the TP. Bye, Coupe. Oh! Right in front of their noses, but guess what? Wish, he's right on top of Hawk up top here. All right, all right, all right. Thank you for clearing the creep. I mean, I guess the laser, he's getting the laser for the funsies. Right, we got Echo Saber, Blink Dagger up on Tiny, looking for Silver Edge for the Centaur, right? Yeah, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. Four stuff coming out for Elder Titan. Blink Stomp, nice. Another Stomp on top. The Cold Embrace is there. They ain't got no magical damage, Lieutenant Dang. Fourteen to five, nine k net worth. What is Tinker, ladies and gentlemen? Okay, they got the call, the blade mail, nice touch. Gonna pull him away from the fight a little bit. Copy goes through that back line, looking for focus. Cookie play away. This time is decent. Now the stomp into the gust, into the centaur stomp. The cold embrace on the back line, actually enough to bring down Drow. Hilarious, it's fine. Don't worry about it. A little punch name for Kaito. Now wishes here. The laser's flying forward. Axeman for that back line. He's paying for it though, as he will be brought down. Copy. He's ready for Wish. The Avatos in. That's a lot of damage with the Stampede. Will it help? Wish is safe right now. Another blink, another laser, another cold embrace. Now the scream, got to back it out. Gonna blink up to the high ground, keeps himself safe. Not so much for Luffs as he gets chased through the trees here. The stop. Oh! Now what? He digs, he digs. Oh, he got a creep. It's okay. Give me a bounty rune. All right, I mean, that was decent for Brim, right? They was, took one for three Gs. Well, it, well, it wasn't the worst. It wasn't the worst, honestly. That was super good. That was a freebie. Well, I tried. Well, I tried. See, look at that one. Mm, yeah, baby. 900 XP, 500 gold. Is it time? Is it time for the comeback play? Right, they take down the illusions. Easy peasy. Wish continuing the blinks and the blinks and the blinks and the blinks. Where are you going, though, bro? 
anything, right? Oh, I like this. Oh, Medusa thinks she's going to be part of the party here. Okay. Oh. Well, that wasn't much of a party, honestly. She, uh, she dominates waves, huh? Jesus. 24, Scotty. Uh, hello? Okay, Winter's Curse on the back line. Nobody's nearby him. Neither they are. Jeeves is trying to get in on top on the stream. Wish the Chardonnay. They've got a defensive matrix up. He will fall. Those Centaur trying to finish off everyone. He's dead now as well. The Blade Mill popping through and Ivy having none of it. And down to Bloody Sky. Wants to die. He goes in and, I mean, he succeeds. Good job. They will take QP for it. You deserve nothing. I mean... Yep. Me. There's too many darn wizards. <laughs> too many darn wizards. Um. Axe? I don't know about that one, Chief. Alright, there's a double damage on the river. Toy, toy, Roach is not up for 2 minutes and 46. Do you have a bottle available? Can you have a bottle available? He gives zero fucks for the bottle plan, jeez. Okay, it's fine. Copy down down. He's got the blink dagger. He's got the shadow blade. He's got the shadow blade. He's got the imp claw. Building into BKB of his own. Laughed, my man. He's building his four stuff, so. Haha, <laughs> Alliance lost to this. New, uh, new nickname, I see, Joven. Yep, three stand-ins. Is this gonna, <clears throat> is it gonna be like this for all the games? I don't know if that's a smart play, honestly. Can someone explain? Is it German-only players? Is that why there's so many stand-ins, or...? Okay, Tinker straight into the trees, that defensive matrix already up. Wait, can you just keep casting that shit? Yeah, you can, Jesus. Alright, well that's not broken in any way. What does it do, Jeeves? I don't know, but it looks cool. I know, boys, I know, I know. The regular crew ain't, are not here, though. It's just me and you guys. This is a small, intimate, like a like a small bar, you know? It's like a bar cast. We're all in here together. We've got the Dota on the big screen. We're, we're in our cups, and I'm, uh, I'm doing the play-by-play, -play, right? Very German, jeez. Indeed, indeed. Here, the Mr. Rope. Ro the Robster, Mr. Robster, yeah, Mr. Robster. All right, the Scotty is almost done for Medusa. Is this go time, Jeeves? No, when Roche is up, it's kind of go time, honestly. It doesn't really matter about the item timings, I think, for Ivy right now. Snapfire is going to get himself an axe. That's pretty big. That's pretty big, actually. We talked about the potential of launching the meat, the centaur, not the enemy. Um, it doesn't seem as scary, honestly. I'd rather throw an axe, if I'm honest. This axe, in you know, in particular. He's got blade mail and stuff. That's That sounds spooky. Alright, here we go. The smoke, he goes for the leap forward. What's he found? An elder titan. Okay, not great to fall on to, but it's gonna hold him in place. The missiles are coming through now. The bomb's dropping down time from QP. Starting to melt some peoples. Yep, Y50 at least gonna get dealt a deadly blow. Focus is down, though. Yikes, copy, moving around that backside. Kaito looking for a way out. The call on the high ground, a little bit weird. But this guy, more enthusiastic than uh, precise there. Not cold embrace though. Triple stun with a cookie. I've never seen that in the entire history of Dota 2, if I'm honest. Could be gonna die for it though. It was cool, it was cool. I'll give you that. I'll give you that. Who can kill Medusa? Um, like, if you get the whole team on her? Is the Ags up for Tinker? Where's this laser? Where's this... this um, 
want to see the uh, shrink ray. Right, 23 to 11, 9k net worth. Ivy in this pole position for what feels like the last, what, 10, 15 minutes at least. Medusa never really threatened. She's 5, 0, and 3 with a Mantisile, Scotty, Ag, Scepter, and a Shard, by the way. Like, he doesn't care. This is give no Fs, Medusa. QP Ags, QP Ags. Okay. Focus is getting Satanic, then Scotty. Items are kind of a little bit awkward, honestly. Don't you want, like, the Manta style for when she does the snack thing? I don't know, I don't know. I, well, I guess as well, though, the status resistance is super good, right? Do you really a snack for 0. 0.75 seven, seconds? Yeah, yeah, so bad, so. Alright, they're railing through this though. It's Aegis, it's Cheese, it's Aghanim Shard. Who gets the Shard? Axe, baby. Where's Spartan and Skylark? They're on holiday. I don't know, maybe they felt like they. Uh... Do you know Fort Twits? If it's. You've got to be a German player playing this league. Is that what it is? Or German to international for it. Radiance bottom tower is under attack. Yeah, I thought it was gonna be the full brain as well. They're not kicked, they're not kicked. These are standings. They were not kicked. Don't listen to him. He's full of shit. I think it's because this is a German league, man. I'm kind of disappointed. But the finals is going to be good, right? Alright, the bloody sky. He's got himself Lotus Orb. He's got himself Blink. He's got Blade Mill. He's got a cheese. He's building into Manta style. He got the shard from Rose Jeeves. He sure did. Yeah, I thought it was going to be proper brain, man. I didn't know. We got a nice blink call, a little accenting though. Now they turn it around with a curse. That's a lot of damage. That is a lot of that is that is a lot of damage, Juice. That's that's a monster kill. That's unstoppable on the Medusa. That is game one. Just kinda getting very difficult now. Getting very difficult. The blade mill and bloody sky, run into this, my friend. Run into it. You've got a cheese. Do it, do it. Just running all that damage. Take it, pain. Murder the, the tinker. Alright, the slapping happening. Doing a little bit of ancients there. 32 minutes into the game. 26 to 11. 14k net worth. And the chokehold is pretty good. It's pretty good. Needs a little bit tightening up on the top lane here. Bottom lane is actually out of hand. They're cutting it right there just now. Mid lane's in a decent position. Ah, uh, this should be fine. As long as nobody TPs. Do they have travels or whatever? I think so, right? Yeah, yeah. No, no, they have Tinker Chiefs. Oh, shit. Yeah, they definitely have travels. Ignore me. Alright, alright. Tinker needs to get on this like right now, though. Alright, so they alleviate the pressure back to here, and then Copy now cleaning out this wave. It means that Tinker, like if Tinker TP's down here and pushes that out in the meantime, um, maybe he can do something, I don't know. Hmm. 
He is TPing in here and pushing here. Like, geez. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, they go for a little bit of a play. Is it good? Not really. Kaito, cookie play downtime. This is too much though. They're all BKB'd up. They're all very chunky boys. We need the laser. Hawk is starting to show more laser action. Now focus, focusing, doing some damage. They drop it. What was that, a creep? I don't know. If I heard a creep at Medusa. Defense matrix are up. How long does that shit last? 10 seconds? Fifty percent stop. Oh, fifty percent status resistance, guys. Wait a minute. He built a Sanjin Yasha. Wait a minute. Wait. There's something here. There's there like a secret plan, guys. There's a secret plan. Okay. 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 I get it. I get it. Okay. So the dry is gonna kill the Medusa. Because you can only stone her for 0.25 seconds. That's the plan. All right. We just need to see it in action, Jeeves. We just need to see it in action. <laughs> I know, right? He wants a Scotty, man. It's 14k net worth. He's 10k behind the Dry Ranger. He's trying, man. He's trying. They need the plan. They need... I, um, Tinker, you have to be here. The plan only works if you're here. Oh, no. The high ground. The penetration. Okay. I mean, Kaito gets absolutely splattered here before the cookie play can even happen. They catch the Dry in the back line with a call. The blade mail. The snowball. The punching. I, I, I have no idea. He's on the high ground. though. He's throwing down some arrows. It's working. It's working. They take down one. They lose another, though. The granny will fall. Granny and... Ta uh, granny and Centaur for Tusk. The laser, though, was starting to do some work there. Look at this. Look, look, look. This is game one. This is game one. We're just getting warmed up, guys. We're just getting warmed up. All right, Bloody Sky. The Manta style, boys. The 30... 37 minute Manta style. What's on downtown, Jeeves? Wait, what are they up to here? I don't know, I don't know. They're coming back in for the fight, though. Dry Ranger, those ice arrows, coffees. Getting kind of handled here. He waits for the BKB, turns it around with the Lotus Sword. Bloody Sky goes deep as well. That call into the dunk on his way out. Very nicely done. Wish now, ready to try and throw back some power. No lasers, he says. Oh, nah, not true. Well, up a little bit hot and a little bit tight. Oh, god damn, the cold embrace left almost falling in the process. But overall, we trade the Winter Wyvern for the Centaur? Yeah. I mean, Centaur brought back as well. I mean, that's got to be a good deal for them, even with the buyback, right? Yeah. Even with the buyback, it's a good deal. Why did he buy by? They thought he thought they were going to press. Because it's just the Winter Wyvern, right? And they still have, uh... Oh, what is this? Paladin Sword and Mindbreaker on Medusa. Split shots use modifiers. Oh my god. Get me out. Hey guys, you got a BKB or you can't fight? What? You got a BKB? What? No, bloody sky looks for the angle. Focus. The ping actually comes out. Wait, no, the call doesn't quite connect. Oh my god, the laser's coming through the BKB. A little cookie away. Focus. He's going through it through with the satanic. He's still alive. The snowball flew from Y50. Those satanics still working out though. Trying to fall back a little bit more. Those ice arrows. Holy shit, brain. What is you doing? Wishes in here. They're turning this shit around, jeez. What? I don't know. Here comes the help from Granny. It's only Hawk who's in here. Copy, can you help a bro out the stomping and catches them on the edge of it? Copy. You've got cheese, mate. Help him out. Oh, nah, it's fine, it's fine. They back up, they back up. They don't have the follow-up, guys. They, <laughs> they don't have tier ones. <laughs> what a fucking fight, though. Three for free. It's a casual 3,500 gold, guys. I'm mean, technically 4k gold.
Yeah, let's get Roach's H's, his cheese, his hogs set. Who gets the hogs? It's gonna be for uh, Kaito, right? Yeah, 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 I think so. Oh, 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 Y15. He's in there. What did he get? What did he get? I don't know. He's dead, though. He is dead. Nice play, though. They're all going to commit for this. That's a lot of damage. Hawk now in amongst all of it. They're dropping bodies left, right, and center. Damn. Centaur has the Aegis Chiefs. Uh oh. Okay. That's got the odds. All right. Yeah, Bramer playing with standards. All right, take her with a buyback. They do have many buybacks to use here. Satanic on the Medusa. Fixer's cloak. The laser popping off one time. Doesn't want to get lasered back the other way. Nice stomping. Remember, he's got the Aegis. He can make these moves. Copy super low just from those laser blasts. It's pure damage, Jeeves. Sure is. Now the call. Icy Frosty Arrows. Y50 giving him the old puncheroo now as well. He's got the kick. I don't know. He goes for the snowball play. Remember, he has the Aegis. Could keep a wave. They can keep him alive a little while longer. They can use it twice. He's still alive, Jeez. He's still alive. Gonna get his ass out of there. They do take down the rocks. The cell's still flying through. Bloody sky super low. The counter play though. Cobby's right on top of Wish. Wish with a blink away. Fence Matrix out. Some beast used. They still have the ages. Lost this mid rocks, guys. Other than that, though, I think it was pretty well held. Damage on the river, ping that shit out. Dusa coming down town for it. Oh, oh no, they give it to Tiny. Okay, okay. Bobby will be the initiation. Oh, Elder Titan sniped. Easy kill. 45 seconds on the sideline. Does have a buyback, guys. They go looking for more. It's Coupe. Coupe, do you have a buyback, sir? You pay no buyback. The blinking eggs they're chasing after him. He's trying to get out there. There, copies there. Throw over. Ah, oh, my toss. Jesus, old guy. He thought he was going to live. What sauce me, he says. He gets mangled. A little bit of a buyback now from Elder Titan. The auto's coming through. That stream on the back line doing so much work to get the call on top of Wish. Wish is down. 125 seconds. And that is going to be all she wrote, ladies and gentlemen, for game one. As Ivy. Show them how it's done. 42 minutes into the game, 38 to 17, 30k network. Well, I like the idea of the defense matrix of the Sanj and Yasha. Uh, so the idea was to buff the drought, and it kind of works if they're together, but at the same time, it's your mid hero, and you've still got to do tinker things, you know. Still going to take your things. All right, guys. All right. That was just game one, though. This is a best of three. This is a semi-finals. After this, the grand finals of this ESL Meisterschaft game. MVP for me. I mean, it's got to be Bloody Sky. <sighs> copy was insanely good. No, let's give it to Copy. Let's give it to Tiny. Very cool. Very cool. Boom. So yeah, Ivy taking game one there. Uh, Brain. Without the Greeks, the, the Germans without the Greeks, not as strong. Not as strong by far, it seems. What's the sitch with the lobby, Jeeves? Well, it's up, it's 10 out of 10. We'll give them a few minutes to get ready. A few minutes in, I believe. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. All right, all right, all right. No, it's not, no. Dude, will you chill? You chill for eight hours. Not even the full Brahm squad. He's like, I hope they'll disband. It's like, dude, not even the full squad. Right, I'm going to make a cup of tea, guys. I'll be right back. Oh, pay the bets, Chiefs, pay the bets.
You'll die laughing if I do a hot tub stream? That's the point. That is the point, sir. Bets are open, remember, if you're following for the first time, it's uh, 250 Jeep coins you've got. You can use that to bet. It's zero for IV, one for brain. No, I set it at a thousand subs, chill bro, so that we don't get it. I don't want to be in a hot tub, are you serious? I'm an old man. Nobody needs to see that shit. Been for production, guys. You know how it'd be. You know how it'd be. Ten out of ten in the lobby, though.
the thing for the buttons and stuff. Oh, I just can't be bothered with them. I just feel like it adds even more clutter to uh, the stream. Like, I hate when I go on a Twitch stream and there's like those little bits of boxes and shit that just pop up on the screen and stuff. You know, overlay boxes. I hate that one. It's a real principal Skinner thing, though, right? You know, where it's like, no, it's the children that are wrong. Am I out of touch? No, it's the children that are wrong. But I like that show, bro. I mean, I would put it on if we were doing it a lot more. Uh, like, if I had a co-caster and an analyst that I was talking to a lot more, um, I'd put it on. But I actually like when chat are like, yo, what is the hero I am? I like that. It's like a chat interaction, you know? It's like a butler service version of it. Is that the original van? Real van? Ten, 10 in the lobby. We are still waiting, gents. We're still waiting. I read it August yesterday. For some reason, not on my friends list. What? Does August stream? Oh yeah, he's not on my friends list either. I know, I, yeah, I know what you mean. Like, so one time we were, we were like talking about um, calibration. And I, and I don't, I can't remember what it was, but I was like, oh no, the calibration limit for X amount of years was whatever, at whatever limit. And then you could, then they changed it so you could calibrate, I, you know, run with a fresh account or whatever. And he's like, no. And I'm like, dude, totally, here's evidence and everything. And he's like, no, you're wrong. And he just argued with me for like an hour and a half over the levels of calibration that weren't even relevant anymore because obviously we moved on to a new level. And I was just like, I just don't need this in my life. Be negative, dude. You don't know what you're talking about, Jeeves. Okay. Okay. I don't know what I'm talking about. Fine, it's fine. I only have 10,000 hours in Dota 2. I don't know what I'm talking about. I don't know what I'm talking about, man. It's true. It's true. How many hours left approximately for the finals? By the final is coming. The finals is coming. The finals are coming. The finals are coming. Uh, after this series. Oh, couple. We are loading, guys. We are loading. I'm not sure if that's a real taxi or a fake taxi. We'll go with real taxi. Okay. 
Real toxic. Um, I think Brame have to pick it up. They have to draft around this, right? No, I never actually cast the Moxie. We just did, uh, what did we do? So there was like a grand finals first, because she used to run a league um, way back in the day. And we did, um, I cast the grand finals games. If it was going to go a game four, I think Moxie was going to come. We never, like, she was on the show, but we didn't cast together. Like, because we had, there was like a, there was like a panel and, you know. Yeah, I think I cast, definitely cast your games. Definitely cast a few of your games. I think I cast a lot of your games throughout that, throughout that tournament though as well, I think. I don't get invited to cast those little tournaments anymore. Well, I guess uh, that one we did in South Africa, the Ventac one we did in South Africa last weekend, I guess that's kind of all that sort of same sort of idea. Well, they had cat. Mm, I, did you guys play for money? Yeah, honestly, the change, because, like, I obviously ran a load of tournaments when I first started casting, right? Now, if I could have got tickets, if I could have got tickets at that time as easily as tickets are got now, that would have made a huge difference. Like, but by the time they changed it, I was already way past that. I was like, whatever, man. Get me out, Valve. Get me out. This is such a quiet stream. I thought it would be, I thought it'd be quiet. I didn't think it was gonna be this quiet. If I'm honest, maybe the finals will pick up a bit. Two thousand sixteen, I think, was Murray Cup on. Who was on Ivy? Um, Chad, Chad the Slayer, uh, Chad the Second, Chad the Great, and Chad Almighty. From the game we just watched, that's my uh, understanding of who's on Ivy. Uh, no, but for reals, it's Hawk, Copy, The Bloody Sky, Natural, and Y50. That's their play, their positions one through five. And Brame have Focus, QP, Kaito, Luft, and apparently Spartan. And they've got Wish. No, Wish is British, my. He's British. No, he's from Georgia. Oh, well, I mean, he's been British. Lots of values. That is similar. All right, all right, all right. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, we are back into the zero. Oh, dire team banned. <sighs> yeah, 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 I think that's probably a bit of what's happening. Anyway, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome back to the ESL, Mr. Rofter Schiefter, Spring 2021. It's Brame versus Ivy. Yes, get rid of the ancient apparition, no more Medusa, no Pango, no Esperito. Look at the clockwork though, guys. All right, I was promised a lot of clock. PPD, he reached out to me in a dream last night and he said, geez, clockwork will be big at the major. Wait, geez, I think he might just be watching the stream. Yeah, 
Either way, that's what PPD said. We have seen a lot of clock downtown in uh, in China. So I'm curious to see how much uh, EU is going to be taking from it. The all keen lineup? No. All right, they go for the Timber Miranda. All right, is this to head off on a potential egg pick? We'll never know. Ten seconds left. Five seconds, Morty. It'll be fine. You will never know, G. Ever. All right, all right, all right. What do we fancy here? You've got the Mirana, you've got the Timber Saw. It's Bloodseeker, right? You want to get that Bloodseeker in there. Get it nice and early, show them who's boss, get that position 3 Bloodseeker. That's what I'm talking about, boys. Do Ivy play Bloodseeker, Jeeves? I have no idea, honestly. They're going to go for the Batman. I like this, I like this. They're going to need an active save, so the Oracle, Abaddon, and the Legion Commander all seem kind of okay, but then they already have Timbershaw. Hmm. All right, the monkey kink. No, I think there's a German cast as well, but the German cast is listed as the English cast, so people probably just don't know that there is an actual English cast. I'm thinking that's probably the same. Maybe nobody can tell the difference, Jeeves. Well. All right, they banned the Oracle, Jeeves, because you did say that was the most uh, critical one to do so. They get rid of the Vengeful Spirit as well. If you can't, can't banish it, if you can't break it, you could just swap them back, right? I feel like a ban is just straight up amazing, though. Really a it bared on. Like TA. Okay. Radiant team band. The question is, is it copies Bat or the Bloody Sky? The Bloody Sky sounds like somebody who'd play Batman to me. If I'm honest. Shadow Demon? For which team? Uh ten seconds to pick your hair. Ivy? Brain. It's because of the bubble, right? You can either actively bubble you the guy that's getting lassoed, or you can get the poison itself, though. Mm, the purge. Yeah, you're right, actually. It's a classic combo with a Miranda. You could go for Bane with an Aether Lens as well. He's kind of squishy versus Clock, though. Radiant team pick. Grimstroke. I mean, Grimstroke Shard is pretty good these days, but you still got to wait 20 minutes to get it. Do you think we'll see Shards getting moved to 15 minutes, guys? No question. Uh, thoughts on Viking GG versus Spirit Juice. What is that? Much of a power spike. The game's later, lol. What region is? What is it? 
Viking versus Spirit. Was this Pinnacle? Pinnacle, Pinnacle. Hmm. Um. They pick the abandoned trees. They're watching the stream. Smart guys. Very smart. Honestly, Viking have been looking real shaky recently. I would, uh, I'd probably look for Spirit to be the dark horses there. I wouldn't even be surprised if it was too old Spirit. Sorry, uh, Immoral. You, you, you pick your hero. Five seconds. Is this tourney really called Meister? It's called Mister. Hang on, I got the translation here. I got the correct pronunciation for me. It's called Meist Rob Shifter. Meist Rob Shifter. Nah, details if, um, what? I don't know. Uh, so, if Viking are, are down to be, um, the ESL Championship Spring, that seems fine. What's wrong with that? Sorry, what was I saying? Detail 7. Um, if Vikings are listed as the underdogs by the, uh, like the betting companies or whatever, yeah, I would totally, I would totally understand. Given their recent performance, they're totally off killer. Something's not right. The Viking at the moment. All right, we got the puck. Um, Ivy's lineup is kind of a little bit confusing right now. Hopefully, it coalesces by the next two picks. I think it's the master ship, right? It's the master ship. Gyro and Io, I never would have predicted that, Jeeves. You didn't even mention it. I know, I thought it was obvious. I thought, hey, guys, no point in saying it, you know. Get rid of the Ember, get rid of the Morphling. Mishka, Big Shishka. 1996, thank you for the follow. Speak friend and enter. Keep it clean, keep it positive. No live odds. No spoilerinos. Aston Martini, or Aston Martin 1, I guess. The same to you, friendo. Yeah, kick to the curve, the tiny not coming in. That's fine. What's up, boy? I am 41 years old, sir. How old are you, boy? That's uh, why I thought, boy. Alright, Jeeves. What's it gonna be now. for Ivy? They need Lee mid, right? You're 14? Yeah, you are the boy, sir. Also, bad news, Aston Martini. Are you sure you're 14? I give you 10 minutes to think about it. Radiant team pick. Alina. Well, this is an 18 plus stream as well, Derpy Doki. So, uh, if you ain't got your fake IDs ready, I mean, make sure you're above 18 if you're watching. Um, you, you, you better pick your hero. Five seconds. Oh, no, they picked a leaner. This is decent. It does mean it's off lane, bad rider. Right, huh? Need a core here. Ace is void. They have a decent amount of chrono damage. It's pretty good for catching Io and Gyro, but you don't really do much early. Well, you make best situation out of no situation. 
Will Brain be able to make the best situation out of no situation? Let's find out. Let's break it down for game two, best of three in the ESL Meisterschaft, a spring 2021. Will Brain, it is Kaito on the Timbersaw Coupe on the Miranda, Luft on the Abandoned, Wish on the Puck, and Focus on the Faceless Void. Over on Ivy, it's Y50 in the Clockwork, the Bloody Sky on the Bat Rider, Natural on the Io, Hawk Gyrocopter, and Copy Lina Mid. I am um, General Chibicus. Let's get our Dota 2 on. Can't find this match on okay. any, any side, Chibs. What? No, I think he meant um, options or something. I don't know. I don't know what he meant. Betting options or something. I don't know why I wouldn't say there was anything even remotely unlikely about game one like it all played as expected there was no like there were no real surprises I would say meow meow indeed what does the robot say geez eight points draft advantage to brain we got all of the mangoes on the dire side this time around they know they know give it up to ice frog Look at this as well, the early smoking ink. Oh, 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 okay, okay. They want to come over here, they know what's what. Look at this, they read the situation, they're like, hey. Wait a minute. Love this clockwork set, man. The brain in the jar. Thirty seconds till Jit goes ham in the. There's brain the in the jar, row. That's good, man. That's hot. Okay, they are going to get a little bit fishy with it. Focus, going to get blasted back here. Oh, giving them the old right clicking. Oh, arrow from downtime. Won't connect. Manages to get back in there. Does he get the bounty ring? Negatory. Loft going to scoop it up from underneath his nose. Um, 50 50, right? Oh, they got three over on Brain Jeeves. Oh, nice. Shit, the bets are still open. Did I not close them? Betting has stopped. You can no longer bet, Sam Roberts. Good effort. Yo, been able to bet ten thousand chief coins in this series. It's a bit of a, it's a bit of a joke, Chiefs. Surely. No, it's a semi-final. Run final coming up next after this, guys. Winner of the series versus. Uh... Who won the first series, guys? It was two teams. I think it was. Um... I want to say they were called like AFK or something. No. Hee hee gaming. Hee <laughs> hee. Oh, I'm looking forward to that. I am looking forward to that. All right, bloody sky. Looking for the TP to the top lane. Bye. He says, I don't want to be in lane versus Abaddon. That's a suck lane for me. Oofed. The TP follow up. Yeah, hee <laughs> hee. United. Answer. I'm gonna drink my tea. Don't die. Did he die? No. Okay, cool. I like this. I like this. He's like, I'm gonna block your pool. It's actually a decent... What is he doing? He's trying to stack. Oh, no. Oh, look at this. Look, he's like, no, look, I, I'm totally here blocking it. I totally did that. I totally walked in there. It wasn't a ward, bro. It wasn't a ward. Hashtag not a ward, bro. 
We need to battery assault. A little knocking and him over. Remember, he doesn't have the aphotic shield just yet. Two seconds. Six steps. Six stick charges, though. I mean, at that point, it's almost sad to use them, honestly. I'd rather wait for my wand. Lane 12 and 1 versus 11 and 3. So pretty even, Stevens, in that mid lane for now. The activity kind of up top. Can they even murder Kaito after a certain point here? I mean, they do have a lot of magic damage, right? You got a lot into that. Yeah, 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 yeah. Pooped his pants a little bit there. He wore his brown shorts today, guys. It's fine. Pew. Pew, pew, pew. This is bullying, guys. Internet bullying. I don't want to catch you guys doing this in your games. He's like, I've got one more leap and an arrow. Oh, come on, dude. Wait. Are you going right now? No, oh, it's just it's four. Yeah. My dinner. We're worrying about my dinner, guys. Alright. He's got himself the stick. Okay. Easy peasy. Juicing up the bottle. Doesn't follow through. Back to League of Legends. What am I getting today? I'm getting fish and chips from the from the chip shop, guys. I'm getting fish and chips from the chip shop. Alright, I mean, there was a whole lot of stuff for not much action, let me tell you what, maybe Y50 to die, oh! Alright, 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 wait, why did he run towards that tower though? Bread and tartar sauce to accompany, I'll probably, I've got some soft white rolls. I'll probably make a couple of chip butties. Um... My tartar sauce, though, that I had is off, so I, unless you get tartar sauce, probably no tartar sauce. But I think it's off. I opened it and then I didn't finish it, so. It's like a jar, as opposed to, like, you know. Side of curry sauce with chips and uh, chips and fish? Nah. I just get curry sauce with chips if I'm having that. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's what it was, Joey Papas. He's like, uh, he also managed to secure it so it was the tower that got the hit. Miranda didn't quite get the CS there, so she, like, nobody gets the gold or whatever. Oh, hang on. Alright, I mean, he's flying around here. I thought something was happening on the back line that someone was going to die, but the real death is here. Oh, yes. Bloody sky. Ooh. He's still alive, Jesus. I know. Not anymore. Got killed by a neutral creep. Feels good, man. The deny. The deny, boys. Sorry. I was distracted by my incredibly attractive girlfriend. Yo, are you okay? He is not okay. Confirm. Mario Solo. Alright, I mean that's uh, that's a manly play there, right there. I mean manly play, Jeeves. I don't know if you'd say manly. A beast A bold play. Yeah, let's go with that. A bold play. You're going either way. This is uh, not a similar situation though. Bloody sky getting picked apart here, the missile for QP. It's a decent amount of damage. No stick for him, huh? Let's have a fairy fire, jeez. It's just all over the place right now. They're all 
over the place, jeez. All over the place. Here we go. We got Hawk and Naturel. They're coming in, looking for Laugh. They fire down a little bit of that flat cannon action, jeez. Yep, he's going for it now with a rocket barrage. He's making that play, but the Aphonic Shield absorbs so much damage. It looks like this gyrocopter is going to die. Fuck. We died? Bloody sky. I mean, you can only watch one fight at a time. You know, there's... I mean, was there much to even see there? No. I'm an O2's boy. Yeah, that's what I thought, dude. That's what I thought, right? That's what I thought. Coming in here, trying to fake your age, trying to pretend you're an underager. Open up, it's the FBI. No, but all uh, all things, all jokes aside, this is an 18 plus stream, guys. So um, if you are not over 18, I'm afraid, uh, please get parental guidance. Is that light? I don't know. I don't think so. I think you probably just have to leave. Okay. Dodge. Okay, okay, they're gonna get him, are they? I don't know, I don't know, he's uh, he's gonna survive actually. They actually even, they cancelled the TP, that was supposed to be his backup. They've got Hawk and Natural coming in though. Decent, pops off the salve, he's got, he's got Tranquil Boots as well. No, don't go, no, 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 let those Tranquils heal you a little bit first bro. Under the tower, yeah, yeah, yeah. Chibate them in, get them in nice and deep, nice and juicy, that's what I'm talking about. Get ready for the Gyrocopter, get ready for the Io. I mean, he does have Chrono and the Mask of Madness. What's happening? They're fighting mid. Okay, never mind that. They're going in. They drop down the coil. In from the side, Natural. But the TP across from Focus. He. Oh, four man Chrono. I mean, it was technically a three man Chrono, but Gyro walked in here for some reason. Here's the reason why the missile going to connect. We uh, realize when kids are born in 02 or 19. Yeah, bro. Yeah, bro. Six to one for Brain this time around. Expected. I mean, given the draft, yeah, absolutely. You have uh, some pretty good answers, and it takes a little while for uh, Viper, Viper for um, Ivy to get online enough that they're um, that they're in a position. Hey, oh, shout out to Ukraine, my dudes. Oh, uh, this. Uh, oh, I, I went, I went, I went, I went. How many? What? Do you mind if I, I'm just gonna replay this one, guys? Because I'm not sure how this works. You must have like ten stacks or something. There's no. Yeah, 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 yeah. So he has three stacks here before he starts. Then he's in with four. Goes for the last soul. Only four stacks. Five stacks. Hmm. Okay. I mean that makes sense. That's kind of on him, though, right? Once he gets a lower star, that doesn't really happen anymore. Kind of place there. Should get the easy kill. Nice. Goes the way of wish. Use the mid hero. From Georgia, important stuff. I'll be throwing them hands, bringing that tower down. Y50, running interference. Patient, this is fine though. They can still take it. They can still take it. Kaito getting ready for the deny the arrow from downtown. Oh, block! Nice, la. I mean, he probably gets the CS though if you let it hit the catapult. Right, wait, what were we? Just to do something, guys. Oh, yeah, right, sorry. I know, I know. Uh, this stream today brought to you in part by NordVPN. Remember, promo code JeevesDotaTV, 68% discount, one month free. All right, oh, I need to write the time of that time. 153, nice. I'm gonna, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna write this down and then I'm good. I'm just writing my Roche timer down, guys. There we go. Perfect. Oh. I got it, guys. I got it. Uh, 
Right, we're getting a Lotus Orb on the Timber Saw. Jeeves, indeed, indeed, listening to the stream. That's what I like to see. Travels are already up on Lena. Yo, Wish is getting a little bit close for comfort here. Let's have the coil available. Witchblade is done. That's a lot of damage. Damn, 5.4k net worth. Yo. Cheeky Aro, not sure. Surprise, it's it's your pals. Doesn't seem very friendly. The uh, Crone on the back line, they will finish off Copy. They get two here. The first to 10 kills coming in pretty uh, pretty quickly here for Brim. Oh, was... But quite nicely coordinated, I have to say. I like this play though. Bloody the sky is down here. He's cutting the creep wave in behind. I mean, it's a tier one tower, right? They're gonna take it anyway. There's no, uh, there's no backdoor protection. Applying some pressure here. The arrow gonna connect up on Gyro. The TP are crossed. They've got a coil now as well. Wish with the play. The rocket barrage doing some serious work here. Focus should have a little bit of an action in a second. But his mask of madness actually stopping him from doing that time walk. Get the majority of his HP back. But very swift response from Brame. 11 to 2, 3k net worth. First to 10 kills secured in the bag. And over here. Did they buy anything? No, are they just looking for more kills? I mean, they've got Ancients here. Might as well get in on the action if you can. A little buzzsaw. Arrow down time. Not going to connect. Copy. He's still way by left right now, and they'll finish up this Ancient. But not getting the full interception that time round. Do 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 do. All right, we got Tronicle boots here. It's the Mango and Tronicle boots are the Venom. Focus. He's got the Maelstrom. He's got Mask of Madness. We like Maelstrom here. We do. It's pretty good. Like everyone's kind of squishy. So if you get like a multiple man Chrono, you're uh, you're gonna do work with your Maelstrom, right? Take down the tier one tower mid. Opens up the space, so the map looks a lot more like this now. Very cool. Great position to be in at 15 minutes. What is this? Bloody Sky coming through the back line though. Coupe, an easy target. He goes for the lasso. Wish ready with a coil. Hold him in place. Light Striker Ray as well as Laguna finishing the job. But hey, Batman. Are you okay, bro? Oh no, I don't think you chrono for this though. Mm, he's getting away. Not really. Are right, you going to catch him out? There's the Chakra. Wham bam. Thank you, ma'am. In the back lines, we got Chrono on top of Lina. Oh, Lazio always getting away. Nice dodge of the Light Striker, right? A little jaunt forward here. He needs a little help from the Chakram boys, and they'll find it. My 50 comes in to try and help Bro out, but he's just a fraction of a second too late. Doesn't get punished for it though. Every cloud has its silver lining. Oh, I think I gave my girlfriend cash, but they only take card <laughs> because of the pandemic shit. Is that an insult, source bar? So oh, I hope not. I hope you are genuinely talking about hugging dogs because that'd be great. I'd love that. I'd love that, man. Everyone around the world just hugging each other's dogs. Where am I from? I'm from Scotland. Alright, 4k net worth. 13 to 3 right now. 13 to 3, 16 minutes in. It's not It's not the deadest game we've had. Well, I mean, deadest by the number of bodies, Jeeves, or the lack of bodies. Oh, I see what you did there.
Oh, because you said hello from my... Yeah, Satan is your dog. I see, I see, I see. I see. I get it now. I get it now. Our Ivy done for already? It looks pretty grim. It does look pretty grim. What are the comeback opportunities and options here? Well, I mean, our Scepter up on Gyrocopter will be a big a big start, right? It's going to accelerate his farm. It's going to allow him to fight better team fights, especially in Chrono, right? Once you've got Ags up, you're still shooting. Even when you're chrono, your side gunner is still pop, 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 pop in the way. So this is helpful. Um, it's just they're behind on items, right? It's only 17 minutes in a game. We're going to get a second batch of neutral items coming through now. Um, it's expected, right? It's very similar to what happened in game one. The, where one team is uh, hitting their timings and doing very well in the lanes, right? I would love to see a game three though. I am down for that. I'm down for that. I got a juicy. Uh, I got a juicy. Jerry sent me. Um, um, he he was like, "Why are you always? Why are you always talking shit about me on the Jeeves Tour TV experience?" So he sent me something. So I I want I want to show it to you guys at some point. I I, I will wait until there's a few more a few more people. All right, there's a double damage. There's a double damage on the river here. It's gonna get scouted out by Y50. We won't set the gyrocopter. Mm -hmm. We're doing some agents here. Oh, hello, what is this? A little tete a tete in the forest. A little puck snapping, happening, bye. All right, all right. We got uh, we got an Aegis attempt here. 18 minutes in. You got Kaito to tank. You got a little bashing happening. You got some life steal. That's good. It's doable, right? I mean, it would be nice if they had a medallion or something. Any kind of minus armor at all, actually. But you know what? They're plucky and they're doing it. They know they're doing it, Jeeves. They're TPing in here. He's like, they have no minus armor. He calculates it out. I can get it almost in time. Almost, guys. Almost. A whisker. Whisker. Alright, my bloody skies along the spark line. Focus has Chrono and Aegis. He knows where he is. Oh, no. He saw him, right? He's like, nah, 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 nah. What is this? Okay, okay. I mean, Luft, you're kind of exposed here. You're a little bit out of position. I'm, I'm scared for you, buddy. If I'm honest, there's a bit of fear. There's a bit of fear. They don't believe he's alone though. There's like, there's no fucking way. A bloody sky, just farming where he can. Goes for the TP back to the base. They're closing in up top here. I told getting a bit of information on Clockwork's potential position. The mid lane left. He is so deep in there. You know, they know exactly where Clockwork is. Geez. Yeah, they sure do. It's like, stop, love, what are you doing? Oh, 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 oh. Oh, oh, oh. All right, all right, the hook shot through. Now the Lotus Sword Laguna went back the way he caught me. Took a hell of a damage from that. Kaito goes zipping through, but here comes Gyrocopter and Io. They, they call down. Significant. There's a lot of damage being done, Jeeves, but not that many people dying. What's the counterplay here? Where did he lose the puck? Was that it? Just puck. Still have Aegis. Still have Chrono. Ivy, please. Oh, I, game 3 is cool. Man. I'm down for Game 3. I am down for Game 3, gentlemen. Mm, lasso situation, 80 seconds on cooldown. No fear there. Hook shot. What's the proposition? 10 seconds. 10 seconds up top. They've got a Yule start up into an arrow combo for Lena. Copy. He's in a pickle here. you got a leap forward. Coupe. A few more damages. More damages. One more leaps. They've got an IO wheel getting in on top of the situation here. That might be a little bit unfortunate if you happen to be Miranda. Missile coming through. But he will not actually fire it back. It's going to expire before it connects. Yikes. He's fine. He will survive. And everyone had a nice cup of tea and went home. Oh. 
Oh no, Focus is here. They need to get the Ayo as well, or just kill the Jyro straight up. Now they kill the Jyro straight up. Now they go forward and get the Ayo as well. The Silence is on top of them. A little leap, skip and jump forward. Wham! Hearts are broken. Arrow from downtown. Connecting in nicely there. Love pops off the ult. Takes the damage up from that Light Striker raid. Now through with the Dragon Slave. He gets forced back. Wait, here comes Focus. Jumps in there. Gets stunned up. Clockwork was ready for him. The hook shot saving his Lena's life. The BKB up from Blood Sky now. Ooh, ooh, Focus. That's a double damage. Blood Sky as well. But he can't literally do anything. Ivy run into a buzzsaw this game. Alright, Bloody Sky is downtown here. He's trying to cut creep waves. He's trying to make sure no extra pressure can be applied. The fortification forcing them back. Buying time, but wishes on top of him, Jeeves. Uh oh. Roto Shaggy. Roto Shaggy into the base. What the hell? He's out. He's out. Off for the buyback and as you take I mean ah, I don't know man I want to see you actually what happens here for this fight because look the um right here we go here we go this is what was happening at the same time right but this is this is way more significant all right the Laguna blade the counter play not quite there in time focus falls they do go through with a battery the rocket barrage Reincarnation, and he gets him out. Okay, okay, because that's gonna break the temple, right? Like you can't push as hard anymore. Dyer's top tower is under attack. Dyer's top tower is falling. All right. Alright, they got the 6k net worth advantage. Yo, there's an illusion in here. Bloody Sky gonna scoop that one up. Deny it to Wish in his bottle. He doesn't have a bottle. Oh, he does. Thanks. God. Oh no. Alright, we just need to follow someone while I do this. Hang on. Sorry, guys. You gotta do the pep run, you know? Jump in there, jump in there, I need to see. Close enough, close enough. All right, here comes Chrono Boy. He's in on top of it. The slapping, happening, a little movement away from Y50. He's on the back side, but the Chrono goes through and it does come down on top of the Bat Rider. He dodges out from the White Striker. In. He's still alive. I will juicing him up throughout that whole process. He does go down, Jesus. Now they go looking for Eye on the back side. He's out of there. He's done, so he's toast, though. Gyro gonna TP out. They get the they get the what they get the they get the Batman they get the IO for free here eight k net worth lead. They only have Timber Saw's stuff left though. Let's go back in copy. I don't know about this one. He's trying to buy some time. Twenty seconds no IO. Twenty set two seconds no. Uh, Okay, laugh, laugh, the buyback's coming through, Batman committing for this, trying to finish it off with their bad, and he will make it happen, they take down one. Are they running out of options here? I don't know, Focus, he gets a good bash, locked down on Hawk, he takes him out of the action, 43 seconds on the sideline, Bloody Sky to fall next. Oh, it's a dieback, 75 seconds for him. And they can easily take the tier two in the mid tower. God damn. It was a, it was a pepper grinder, guys, it was a pepper grinder. Now, that's signs of the ketchups. Signs of the ketchups. The chips. Alright, perfect timing from my boys, Brame here. Shutting through here. Take out these rocks. You can go top after this as well, boys. It's 40 seconds. They've got no gyro. You've got an advantage here. Come on. They have to back. They have to back. Do they though? Wish is like, do we though? And everyone's like, we have to back. And they're like, but do we? I think we should back. No, we can take more. Um, but can ya? But can ya?
I mean, Rush is up hella soon. It's ready to go very soon. I'm gonna eat a chip, no mm -hmm. guy. Thinking about going on left here. They've got plenty of bodies. The missiles are away. Well, knock back the Moonlight Shadow. The Lotus Sorb and I, they've got a missile of their own. Imagine you could just fire back missiles backwards and forwards all the time. No, the stand-ins were always on the team, bro. They signed up with the standards, my friend. Nice, Duke shot from downtown. There, there, nice. Not bad. IV 50. Now they go forward a little bit more. Hawk shielding up. Hawk's got his BKB. BR focus. He's looking for the angle here. Right clicking. Nice, Chrono. I was here to help a bro out, though. The coil will stop from getting out. Turn it around. This should be the GG, right? More or less. We can catch coffee here. Can eat my dinner. I'll move to the final. Uh, the final game of the series. No, finish the game. No, my dinner. He's got a flamethrower, man. Very cool. All right, Brain. They don't want to. They don't want to overcook it, right? They're like, you know what? Let's just play it professionally. Play it by the numbers. Go back, get Roche. It's ages. It's cheese. It's shard. Push tier one, uh, tier two bomb in. Make sure we finish the game. You know. So this is. Um, no, no, no. This is this is only two of Brame's um, team, basically. Oh, for God's sake! Oh my God. Okay, they're fighting. There's going to be a low assault play with the BKB. Copy's getting kind of low. Back lines. There's a good shot in. It's going to keep left away from the fight. It's doing work. But focus. He's going to blast through here. Take down one. Now take down two. Nice. Goodbye, bloody sky. Yay, GG is called. Let's go, game three, boys. 30 to 6. Damn. This goes to show you that you can get really out drafted in punk. Or Medusa's broken. You pick. Alright, 30 to 6, 8, 0, and 15. 11, 1, and 11 on Wish. QP 6 1 and 16. Holy moly. Those are some scores, all right. Damn, son. 27k damage. I give it to Wish, then. I give it to Wish, boys. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Medusa's pretty broken right now. Pretty broken right now. This is great, though. This is great. I, I, I'm loving it. I'm loving it. I was a little bit down on Brahm in game one, so uh, they're coming back into it, guys. Coming back into it. Gonna. Hey, old one all now. What does the robot think, Chiefs? What does the robot. What's the lobby say, even? Um, hmm. Lobby's up. 10 out of 10 there. I imagine probably it's still gonna be 10 minutes, though, right? <laughs> I'm afraid so, gentlemen. While you are waiting, though, how about we. And I eat my dinner. Excellent, excellent.
All right, everyone, look, Brett, Brett on Brame have been rewarded. Oh, there's an air one. You bet after uh, the bet's closed, I think, Sam.
distribuir. All right, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, and welcome back to the ESL Meisterschaft Spring 2021, the semi-finals. Jeeves Brim versus Ivy. I am General Jeeves. The Bams, goodbye, ancient apparition, no more Medusa, problem in game one, problem no more, that's what you call problem solved. Get rid of the Pangle, get rid of the Earth Spiritu. Get the Timber, get the Miranda, the Tusk for Ivy. Which team comes out on top here? Both teams, by the way, one game apiece. If you are following, by the way, thank you very much. Remember, speak friend and enter. Keep it clean, keep it positive. No live odds and no spoilers. Uh, yo, I'm out of the phone. How's it going, dude? Right, the potential. They uh, they ban out the fastless void, Jeeves. The minky kink, minky kink, minky kink. What's the task? It's pretty good actually, right? The uh, tag team combo. Minky kink can hit surprisingly hard when they combo up early on. Winter wyvern. Lots of BKP piercing disabled taken away. Timber so of course difficult to lock down under normal circumstances. Yo, does Winter's Curse reflect? Guys, we you know. The Lotus Orb. Ah, get rid of the Tree of Protector, a mainstay. These days of this uh, push to 20 minute meta. 20 minute, yeah, you want to keep your laning phase alive as long as possible. Well, of course, disrupting the enemy laning phase. Yes, yes, I mean, that's a main requirement for sure. Storm Spirit Eoneo. Okay, so let's talk about what the heroes, what heroes they have already. Timbersaw's pretty good versus Monkey King, right? If you're leaping in and you get chakrams, you're gonna have a bad day, right? Whirling death, whirling, uh, you know, the, the whirling thing. Similar situation, right? Miranda, Moonlight Shadow, it's a good setup. So they've got good setup for initiation and escape here, right? Tusky comes with an impenetrable save in the form of a snowball. And uh, some good physical damage, physical deeps. All right, the Mars. All right, I need a core who does magic damage. Luna, meh. You could go for like the Juggernaut. Like a Maelstrom Diffusal build. Just go for someone... You need an offlaner that's going to be able to lane versus the Monkey King as well, right? Or is this four Monkey? Nah, four Tusk, come on. Right, they go for the Phoenix. I mean, Granny would be the ideal... But minus armor for the build now as well, so it's pretty good versus Timber Saw. It's gonna scale well with Tusk, but then it's gonna be a Granny Five or a Granny Mint, right? Is it in their wheelhouse? 
Ahí se quita. I'm going for hard mode with no stuns. We saw this yesterday where one team took absolutely no stuns, I think it was, and they <laughs> annihilated them. It was pretty funky. Pretty funky. Oh, Dark Willow, the wee fairy. In, I don't want to be the guy, that guy, but I'm going to be that guy. So Arrow is a stun, technically. Also, Phoenix Egg is a pretty good stun. This is the third game therapy. This is the decider. Loser goes home. Winner goes to the final, the grand final. They'll play versus hee <laughs> hee. Pugni. Yeah, Boss Baby, he's on the field, boys. Boss Baby is on the field, I repeat. Boss Baby on the field. Morphling! Mighty Morphling Power Ranger! Is the final, is the grand final, guys, is it best of three or is it best of five? Do we know? Do we even know? I'm looking right now. It's best of three. Oh, Sarge. Remember guys, if you're following for the first time, it's a bonus 250 Jeev coins, which you can use to bet on the series immediately. Exclamation mark bet space zero for Ivy, space one for uh, Brame, then an amount of Jeev coins. Also guys, I was thinking last night, and I'm just gonna float this by you guys, cause it's a small crowd, so we're gonna get a, a, a reasonable response, right? Um. How about this? How about if we did um, betting Jeev coins for results on channel points for first to 10 kills? How degenerate, how degenerate do we want to get? All right, hang on, we kicked out the Venom Monster, got rid of the Axe, no more Wrath King, no more Andy Mage, hmm. Hmm, what really ties the room together here? And Joker mm, versus Pugna doesn't feel good. Dragon Knight, boring. Get me something better than Dragon Knight. Um, wait, wait. They already have Monkey King to use. I need an offlaner. Oh, um, well, literally anything. What's bad? Axe Mars. What do they get? The Centaur. Centaur. Yeah, that's decent. Response, Jeeves. Well, so Life Stealer Ursa Slardar. Slardar Carriages. I'm telling you, boys, it's really good against Morphling. 
Ricky. I want a mana drain. What about PL? Is PL there? <clears throat> but PL into Centaur is a bit grim, right? How is PL not banned? Do they not play it? Ursa Warrior. Um, what about... Oh yeah, I forgot. We, we, did anyone... Was anyone down for that? No. No one was down for the bets on the first 10 kills. Okay. What about if you want to offer accumulator bets for more interest in the future? Now, honestly, Golden Donkey, you get like 50-50 regardless of the odds, right? So it's already... You're already getting way better than any of their betting. You know what I mean? Anyway, let's break it down, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, for game three. Which team will ascend to the final? Which team will go home? Let's find out for Brame. It's Kaito and the Timbers are QP Miranda. Luft on the Phoenix. Wish on the Pugna mid and focus on the Ursa. Focus, everyone, on the Ursa. Focus, focus, focus on the Ursa. All right, okay, over on Ivy. And it is uh, Y50, Tusk, Hawk, Monkey King, Natural on the Dark Willow, Copy on the Morphling, and the Bloody Sky, Centaur Warrunner. They're both from Germany, Eulis. This is a German final. Grand semi-final and grand final. All right, let's get our... Let's spiel some Dota. Spiel a little Dota. Do -do 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 -do. No, uh, so this Brame is only some of the Brame from EU West. Only some of the Brames. They have got German players in the positions or something. I don't know. I don't know. Two points draft advantage to Brame coming in, though. Let's have a look and see. Ooh. Only a mango sacrifice being made by the Dire. Will Ice Frog reward them? find out we'll find out what we're here to see all right symbols boys focus what's up my dude nice okay No game sound, you're correct. It was a test. It was a test. Well done, you passed. Well done. It was a test. Oh, look at this game. It just started, baby. All right, so EU West was Brame um, for the whole team. They played in the DPC, right? Ivy unknown squad. Well, not so necessarily unknown. They're pretty known within the ESL Meister Shift. Which draft do you like? Um, I like Brain's draft, honestly. Like this Morphling mid. I don't know how good copy. The problem is I don't know how good of a Morphling copy is. And I think this game could be ultra risky for a Morphling. You've got a can opener in the form of the Ursa, so he's going to be able to eat through both the Centaur and um, the Monkey King. And guess what? The most recent build for uh, Ursa is now Diffusal focused. So guess what? He's going to be good versus Ursa as well. I mean, assuming he doesn't just die three times in lane, gee, it's true. Yeah, so that's my thoughts on the draft. Now, it's all about execution. Um, Brain were a little bit squiffy in game one. Um, could have just been down to that Morphling pick, though. It, it was a little bit back and forth for it. Maybe, maybe. But surely, even if they win this game, they have to be going into the final as a little bit of an underdog. Yo, Hawk, are you okay? Hawk is not okay. So they picked the Monkey King into the Timber Saw. Did they change what cuts trees? Did this no longer cut trees? Trees, maybe. Destroys trees. 
Alright. Now this destroys trees, right? Here. A little bit. Alright, they're getting, uh, they're having a little tete-a-tete -tete here, the right clicking. He's got so much regen though, he's happy, he's got three tangles and a salve, he's running one tango already. Sills from KGZ, thank you for the follow, my dude, everyone else as well. Speak friend and enter, keep it clean, keep it positive, no live odds, no spoilers. These are simple rules that any man or woman or person or entity or nth dimensional being can follow. Other than that, good luck, have fun. Ooh, ow. Ooh, 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 ooh. Monkey noises, monkey noises. Oh, okay, he's dead. And so is the left, actually. Unlucky. <gasps> did you just save him with the caster's curse, Jeeves? I sure did. You like that, left? You're welcome. You know where to send the money, bro. Monkey. Wait, 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 Santa, are you okay, bro? It was Monkey King, right? It was Monkey King when I was making the monkey noises. That's why it's fine, you know. Okay, it's fine, guys, it's fine. It was very lowbrow. I know you guys are all wrecks. I should have, I should have upped the tempo a little bit, you know? Should have done some Planet of the Apes quotes or something, you know? It was Ursa Jeeves, he's not a monkey. I mean, shut up. Discord. Back to team speak, guys. Why? You know what would be great? If someone brought out um, an app that was called, like, This Works. And it was basically just like the very first or second version of Discord. And it stripped out all the bullshit that's in Discord and just put the good stuff in. And they just call it Dis Works. And then everyone switches from Discord to Dis Works. You're welcome. You're welcome. I uh, I will accept a small donation um, when you have made uh, billions of dollars. Kaito getting chased here, the arrow coming the other way, though all of a sudden it's uh, some Benny Hill shit as they start running the other way. Nice, nice. You brought a knife to a gunfight. Ranged versus melee, guys. Ranged versus melee. A little tilt. We talked about the con opener potential here. Remember, he's got nothing in overpower yet. The stun, laugh. This is going to be a yikes for him. Bloody Sky closing in. Gives him the double edge. Ooh, spicy. It's like chicken's back on the menu, boys. Yo, I love it when the uh, characters in the game laugh. When I say stuff. It's hilarious. They're the only ones, Jeeves. I know, I know, I know. Right, anyway, Wish, what's he got going on? He's got the brown boots, he's got his bottle finished up, copy. A wand and a bottle as well, the sucking thing. It's level six on six action, that's a lot of suck though, a little knockback. He says negatory, sir. You can suck off, that's what he said. Yo, Mr. Coupe, try to come in here. Catch us if you can. And uh, wait, they're not done, they're still chasing. All right, he's out of there, he's out of there. Good times, good times. Oh, the patented, uh, the patented range creep catapult pool, jeez. Yeah, yeah, you don't see that one very often. What's with the tail on the centaur model? I don't know, dude, everyone's about to die somewhere. Let's check it out. Bloody sky, about to die, maybe. Boom, there it is. Oh, it's, yeah, it's, it's because it's heavily plated and armored, right? There's no flexibility in it. But he was, uh, he was championship at, uh, at the horse fair, you know, and, uh, 
he wins it every year, so he's very careful about keeping it safe and and controlled. That's so it doesn't get chopped off at battle, you know? Which is chasing. Looking for Natural here. Oh, 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 Y50 on Morphling. Copy, he's coming in hot. I mean, doesn't have a haste dream. Very speedy young man. Wishes out of there though. He says, get wrecked. I'm back to the mid lane and a whole creep wave. Wow. Whole creep wave, actually only three creeps. Still 100 gold. Worth it for the TP. I mean, that's kind of your worst nightmare, right? Hasted Morphling. I mean, she's hasted to anything. It's pretty scary. I'm not gonna lie. A little leap forward, a little stunning. Okay, now the sun ray. Turn it around. He's got overpower. He's level five. Jeez, he doesn't have overpower. He's getting snowballed on. So what he's getting done. Bloody sky will die. Ooh, but first focus will fall. Double edge too much for both of them, unfortunately. Wait, does he have orb of venom? No. Does this do damage over time? Does horse tail grow like hair or are they born with it? So like at the very end of the horse's tail, there's like a there's like a bit of meat. Right? It's like an actual tail tail. And then that bit grows as they get longer, but not by that much. And then on top of that, um all the hair starts coming out, right? Like so imagine it's got like a like a I don't know, like the size of your forearm. Or whatever sometimes right and then the rest of it's just hair coming out of it right. like it's not just all hair mm, has he got the alt now geez nope still level five the stunning it's rough he does have a ring he's got a wand with eight charges qp takes down copy elsewhere whoa the qp takes down copy I really want to go into a replay, but I kind of want to see what's going to happen here. I mean, I don't think anything's going to happen here. He literally takes down Quality. Hi, Kai. Oh, is this one of those sick fucking arrow plays where you just insta-kill him? Yeah. That's literally... <laughs> literally one of those sick insta-kill arrow plays where you just kill him. Cool. That is one of the funnest aspects of Morphling and uh, Mirana plays. Yo, nice shards, bro. Nice shards. Hawk gonna die elsewhere. We don't care, though. It's Timbersaw killing a Monkey King. This is gonna be the exciting thing here. The dive forward. Three versus two. Manly, manly, manliness. Nice. They enrage. He goes, pops off the one. Cube page rotated in. They'll take down one. I mean, they kind of need to get another one to catch up. If they get this Morphling, though, that's pretty good. Oh my god, the Jukes, he tries to get through here, the Mighty Morphing Strength back over, the Mighty Morphing Agility, I'm not sure what he's thinking here, back in at Mighty Morphing Strength, here we go, TP in, a little help from the Monkey King, bro, he's level 7, he doesn't have Wukong's Command, the Suckening, the Blasting, neither push away, he's on top of him, Juice. Wanna see what net worth looks like? This is what net worth looks like, boys. Oh my god, seven to three, three K net worth, but it feels like it feels like this is a ship that Ivy can capsize at any moment. Igor Igor Beast, thanks for the follow my dude. Speak friend and enter. Keep it clean, keep it positive. No live odds, no spoiler units. Thanking you. So the early huge yar, yar. Makes sense, makes sense. this mask what is this QP okay unfortunate run all right it should be called Juke, not QP huh oh no the Bramble maze was still there wait they want that they want that all right that was on me guys that was on me I was too busy looking at the leap away and the space being created I don't think anyone really cares, right? Nope. Okay, moving on. That was kind of good, though. It was kind of good. They did get that QP kill. Why was he so deep? Was he going for wards? What was he doing? Who's down here? Who will pay the price of the Reaper? Oh, no, which I mean. He's got a snowball, though, right? He's got a snowball. 
does have a snowball, he will use it, pull it back in, TPM from Centaurs, things started to get a little bit scary, the blast was prepared but it wasn't quite there, neither just uh, left with a dive away, anytime you're ready bro, he's gonna get you. Oh, you should have caught the egg. Actually, this is not bad. I don't think they can splatter the egg in time. Okay, decent. Not too bad, not too bad. No way they got plus one here. No way, no way. Oh, that is the saddest death of all time. They evaporated them, boys. They evaporated them. Pugna's just getting a steam a steam facial there while it's happening, you know? Phoenix is like and Pugna's like, ah yes, yes, better sinuses, clear my sinuses, yes. I bet I bet Morphling is menthol flavored. I got a real menthol flavored vibe by a Morphling. Uh, roll. Oh, with a dive, he goes for some more flaming action. Is he gonna? Yeah, I mean, he is now. I think it's all over, James. I mean, it is now. It is now. All right, the bloody sky. He's got himself a hood. Got the wind lace locked up on his boots as well. Doesn't want to get them tranquil booties, boys. Negatory, negatory. This bro is building yules. Coupe on the Miranda. For well, those of you listening on the radio only, uh, Wish on the Pagna has got a double damage bottled up as well as an Aether Lens. He's got himself just a little urn. We saw 100% of the kills, 100% of the time. By the way, it's first to 10 kills secured by Brave quite some time ago, Jeez. Yes. I'm just letting you know. From listening on the radio, you know? What about if people are blind and listening? Jeez, true. Maybe just listening to the monitor. Not the monitor, the uh, speakers. You're saying, in a technical term, you monitor your audio using your monitor, you see? But actually, your monitor is, is your headphones. Sound, guys, sound. Hello! Oh no, that's uh, if you go down to the woods today, you'll, you'll not have a good time type scenario there. Very good. He's over here, the Monkey King. Mm, almost has a Diffusal, Jeeves. Right, okay, that gives him some kite ability, right? We were thinking Diffusal for Ursa, but he's, got, he's having such a good game. He's like, you know what, I'm building a Battle Fury. I don't care. Four, two, and four. I thought the Pugna was going to be bad. I mean, they can definitely itemize around it. Like, definitely, once they have BKBs and stuff, they can... And the E-Blade on copy is going to be a big problem. He ain't building no E-Blade on copy, geez. Oh. He wants Willow Willow for the machine gun uh, right clicks. Fair enough. Possess Mask, Ursa with a Battle Fury Power Treads full on wand at level 14 and a half minutes. He's in here, he's raking up, and he's going to give the Aegis. They do give the Aegis. They give him some of the XP as well, actually. Y50, shadowing on the high ground here. Gets the Courier, very nice, very nice. It was empty, right? I don't know about this though, I don't know about this. The Morphling, um, Wish is in a bit of a pickle, they go in on top of him, the cars cry, E blading himself, I mean, Ghost, I mean, like, what's it called? I don't know, Cathedral Shrike? I don't know what it's called, actually. It's called. He crapified Jeeves, yeah, he crapified himself. You got there in the end, Jeeves, I sure did. <laughs> Yo, copy, have you got an escape? Yes, down in low ground, Y50, maybe not so lucky, they go back around the other way. Decrapified, Jeeves, decrapified. That's okay, only 10,000 hours of door, guys. I'll get there, I'll get there. Beamed! I mean, it's not the greatest trade the world has ever seen, but it's something. It's something. It's a little bit of pride back, you know? You lost your Pugna in unfortunate circumstances. He, he got, uh, what happened to Dark Willow happened to him, but on a slightly smaller scale, but more effectively. 
I do say more effectively, Jeeves. Well, he was a more important hero, and uh, they used less heroes to do it, so. Yes, efficiency was very high for uh, the Ivy kill there. Wish is back, though. He wants to get some... Uh, he wants to get some payback. Wants to prove that he's still the murder number one. Wish. Yeah, no problemo, he says. Level 13. Level 25 plus Pugnut. Sunray doing some work. The back line, the punch room coming through. It's on top of a timber saw. Trying to open him up with that can opener. That's what Monkey King's here to do. And uh, can't quite get the job done. That's a fall back. Laughs. What's your place, sir? He's got Veil of Discord as well as Tranquil Booties. Loving it. Miranda has the duels for the auto setup. It's decent enough. It's pretty good here as well. Versus the Monkey King. Oh, they go looking for Y50. The arrow's going to give them a little bit of information. There's a dive forward. Focus. He rips past that tower like it ain't even there. Little Hop's giving a jump forward. The snowball says no, though. It's just coming back in on top. And Hop looking for the angle. Natural with a fear. Doing some decent work here. They haven't got ages, though. That little Jinx trying to do the work. It's not quite working. Oh, okay, Hop. He does get the Wukong's command down, but he's out of there already. They're not going to be able to use this to fight on. A little bit of earn action on the backside on Copy, keeping him away from the fight. Can't regenerate up successfully. Centaur kill behind his tier threes. While the tier two is still up. Damn. You have to be careful when they make these kind of moves, though, on Brain, right? Yes, it's great that you're taking kills and stuff, but it's all about objectives at this point. You don't care. If you can't take tier threes, there's no point in diving tier threes, guys. Right? You push them back. Congratulations, they survived. Okay, you've now bought enough time to take down the tower and continue your pressure. But Jeeves, it'll look less cool on the replays. I Well, I mean, what looks cooler? Winning TI? Winning prize money or whatever? Or, uh, or uh, I, I don't know, a triple kill and you die. I mean, I mean, it's pretty badass if you do kill three people with that chance. Badass for the enemy team, there was only two of them that brought you down, easy. Oh, Alright, blasting through, here we go. Now we can get outpost control, we can ensure Roshan. Aegis is only going to last for 58 more seconds, so... It's, <laughs> it's barely 19 minutes into the game. So much pressure being applied right now. 26 kills. I think Team Spirit should uh, be the uh, upper... They should be the upper... They should be the, the favourite for the Viking game, if that's what you're asking. Alright, Morphling tries to come in here. Remember, focus. He still has that Aegis. Not for long, though. Jeez, 20 seconds left on it. Timber chaining up to the high ground. The old Luke King. I mean, focus is super deep now. 15 seconds or so. And the tower is still banging away there. Tier 2 still up. Just finish that one off. Get set up for the next Aegis, guys. Don't need to uh, overcook the goose. Alright, an overcooking the goose moment now as the Aegis expires, gonna heal him up. Now it's time to back off. The urn is ticking. Oh, sniped by the arrow before he can get away. It's all right, boys. He went to the Prometheus school of running away from things. Finally caught up with him. Double damage downstairs, though. Jeez. Nice. Who's got a bottle? What's the timing? Yeah, okay. They have time to scoop it. Pugna had a bottle? No. Pugna has a bottle, Jeeves. Right. So they get the double damage. They take a super quick Roche. Never mind all of that. Forget that theory to crafting. We go back. We uh, we pick up a timber saw. Making him an incredible 200 damage right click, guys. But this guy is here as well. This is a little bit frisky. A little bit risky for the Radiant. 
There's some big guns though. They do got nice stomp cuts. This uh, scare bear on the side. The egg has popped before they can do shiznits. Now the chase down the snowball forward. We're focus no edges right now. The fear comes through. Kaito's there with his double damage. Focus is turning back into this. I don't know about that one, Chief. Just, just leave. Wish. Which says no, I'm gonna kill everyone, apparently, somehow, some way. Now the Timber Saw coming back in to help a bro out because Wish is still in amongst all the trouble. They get the Monkey King, do they? He is dead, sir. Loft as well, bought back for this. The Moonlight Shadow can't save him though. Morphling and. Wait, Morphling and Will are the only survivors. This is huge though, I think, for Ivy. Like, they got 1,500 gold and uh, 4,500 XP. I mean, now they lose this on top, jeez. I mean, it's not that much, honestly. Like, I think if you've got any kind of incredible lead like that, I mean, the Morphling death at the end was pretty unfortunate, let's face it. Outside of that, outside of that, if you get any kind of a lead like that, it's super good. I mean, even then, Morphling was alive for the majority of it, so, you know, XP, gold, coming his way. What does he want? He wants Axe so he can be Willow Willow. Illusion. For four staff on Tusk. Miki King, looking for BKB, already has Diffusal. Scare Bear for Sanjin Yasha into Satanic. Sanjin Yasha extra resist. This gives resist, right? Yeah, so stupid. Okay, Roche is up in 37 seconds, so this is a perfect time to make this play. They get all smoked up, ready to go for fishing here. What do they find? A Phoenix, very tasty. He's dead, remember he bought back, so uh, he's on die back right now, is that right? Yeah, 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 he bought back, so perfect time. He's down for 40 seconds, barely gonna be respawning. Oh, no, 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 they catch copy, that's unfortunate. No, 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 he's getting out, he's getting out. Is he though, is he, is he? He doesn't have a blink, jeez, doesn't have a blink. Going forward, opening up with the yields, Curse Crown, the setup is there, unfortunate though. Alright, alright, I mean, Phoenix is up in 19 seconds, Roche has spawned. And Focus, he doesn't need any help to do this. I like this play from Y50 though, he secures the outpost. They have good vision, so they knew that Roche was going to be happening. Yeah, you're, yeah, Phoenix we're talking about? Yeah, 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 it was his dieback. I mean, he'd already dieback once before then. <laughs> it was more relevant than the fact that you couldn't buy back for the Roche to the Roche fight, right? So we're about to start things off. Morthlin catching up. Monkey King as well with the Wukong's command on top. Slapping is happening. The egg gonna go off. Negatory, sir. It gets popped. He's down. Suckling, nice, copy, pops off the BKB, Kaito trying to body block him up, the Dark Willow's trying to make some space here for her Morphling. Some amount of fear as well, gonna save him, gonna make that space. Will pulls in on Tusk, what's he got left in the tank, Jeeves Snowball, gonna get used up, now the Suckening, he's toast. He will go back for the Roche and all it cost him was the Phoenix. Twice. Aegis Cheese and Shard. Shard is so lovely on Ursa. Like, who thought that was a good idea? That's another one of those ones courtesy of Ice Frog's Garden Shed, you know? Show all the shards on all the heroes, sure. There's nothing on Timber Saw, but his is the flamethrower, it's pretty good. Uh, Miranda shard is the leap, gives you the extra charge, right? Yo, wait, oh, no, never mind that. What's Agnes? Life drain. Oh, apparently you suck extra units or something? I don't know. 
Siege is happening though, tier 3, they're knocking on the door pretty heavily right now, they're trying to force them back, ain't working though, that's an angry, that's an angry bear, I'm an Aegis. Can Ivy come back from this? Well, maybe, like 5% of a chance, 2% of a chance according to the robot views, well, I give them 5%. Be generous here. Nice auto connection. Wham bam, thank you, mom. Goodbye. Goodbye, Tasca. Alright, cool. I'm gonna drink my tea while he uh, gets unstuck and takes down his rocks. Yo, that's one malformed bramble maze, guys. It's a probably no, yeah, but let's uh, let's not take all of the fun out of it, guys. They've got uh, they've got the cursed crown on top of the Zer, so he actually stuns up the timber saw for them, so it sets them up for this. Did literally nothing. Book of flames, Sarge. He's like, give me paladin sword. Alright, they catch him with the auto, the leap in is there, snowball safe, chakra, I'm gonna pull him back into the cursed, uh, the cursed, uh, the bloody the cursed man there as well, what's it called? The fucking bramble Yeah, wait, alright, the egg pops off, what a strange noise, what is this weird bramble maze? Is there like a bonus that comes on the top of it or something? Yeah, I think so, I think so. Oh, is that the shot? Is that the shard, is it? Ah, okay, okay, okay. The shard does curse time as well. Ah, uh, yeah, the shard does Bramble Maze after curse time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The siege continues, the tower, the, I mean, they're just slow sieging it, backline, bloody sky goes for it, oh, copy, now rolling in, wish, he's about to prop some action on himself, over the backside, don't worry about that, who's dead though, I don't know, focus for the first time, yeah, they'll take the ages, but down goes copy for 65 seconds, a little bit too invested perhaps, as to go looking for bloody sky now as well, where is Ursa during all this, I don't know, he's running through other people, I think, jeez. And that's it, GG. Let's go. Grand finals for Bram. Is it GG Jeeves? It should be. Let's just hit. No, just. Guys. 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 You have a Pugna. Guys. Okay. Let's let's play it slow. Let's play it safe. Let's. let's uh, that's fine. That's whatever, man. Let's go for Magas. Maybe to fortify Jeeves. Sure. Right, they're ready to fight. They're ready to fight. One last fight from Ivy. Can they turn us around? Can they turn this entire series around? The back of this fight. Let's find out. Okay, Kaito. He's going to get Bramble mazed up. He's stuck in there a little bit. Now Bloody Sky leaps forward. Looks for the Ursa. The Yules is there, but on top of it. Here comes Monkey King. The snowball playing amongst all of this. Focus is falling back just a little bit, turns back into it, the Wukong's command is running out, the Abyssal play on top of the Centaur. There's some magic and stuff, the Timber Saw ripping through Bloody Sky, now they go looking for him, he's getting another Bramble Maze for his uh, troubles. Machine Gun copy, is he ready? He does have the Axe, he can go full Dark Willow. Focus trying to close the distance here, he's going to get Bramble Maze as well, so many Brambles you can't even Bramble the Brambles. Yep, 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 they're somehow still alive though. Focus does not seem to care too much. He's trying to run down Copy. Now the timber saw forward. Kaito tries for the burst damage. It's not enough. Guess what? More Bramble Maze. Guess what? More Bramble Maze. Cool. Okay, there, there will be more Bramble Maze, he's on top of it, he's stunned though, he leaps in, he does a little bit more action, the tower is starting to fall, finally, the GG's, is, are they going to come out? No. 
Wait for the sucking. No, he's gonna survive, but the GG will come out. Well played by Ivy. Game one especially was particularly sick. Particularly sick, guys. Right, so I imagine the grand final starts at in 15 minutes, guys. Let me, uh, let me have a look and see. Let me have a look and see. Look and see. Look and see. Let me have a look and see. Look at this badass. 8 0 and 16. Are you for real right now? Damn. Boom. Right, so 2-1 for Brahma. Next up, it's Tihi versus, um, what is the story about? Let me check, let me check the schedule. I think it's gonna be I think it's going to be in 15 minutes, but it's not supposed to be for another hour. Oh, it is, it's, no, it's literally in 15 minutes. Okay, so in order to compensate for this, we need to go... And we need to find Hee he United, and we need to find their badge. Hee he. Yes, they have a proper team thing. Excellent. Excellent. Okay, okay. Right. Let's go. I need to... I need to... I need to... Did you run the ads? I don't think I run the ads, guys. Can you watch these ads, thanks? Love yous. There's no list for it yet. Yeah, okay. okay, um, I need to update the stream title. I know I don't have the badges, yeah.
All right, gang, what did I miss? Well, I was making a cup of tea. Come on, bugger off. I mean, uh, more suitable things to do. Oh, I think I did a mistake there. Uh, seven out of 10 in the lobby. So we look good for our timer. That looks like a pretty good uh, start time there. Um, are we live on Gosu? We are not live on unfortunate. Unfortunate. It's fine, it's fine. Get some WD-40 guys for my uh, my chair. Or, you know, if you got, happen to be a chair person, chair person, I don't think chair people do that, Jake. Oh. Right, I was just thinking like, if you actually made chairs, you'd, uh, you, you could send me one. We could, we could, a deal. Yeah, Medusa slaughtered them in game one, so they uh, banned the Medusa in game two and game three, and uh, easy.
Moving for production, guys. It's 10 out of 10 in the lobby. It's probably gonna be another five minutes or so, though. By the time the game loads, you know. It's fine. How many minutes before the game starts? How long is a piece of string? Um, let's have a look. All right, there's some kind of a 1v1 mid battle going on right now. It's uh, Dawnbreaker versus Dawnbreaker. Um, it's a caster, I think, versus a panelist. I don't know why we're killing time. For content, Jeeves, for content. Oh, all right. Um, okay, cool. Hello, daughter. Have you completed your studies? Are you ready finally to join the family business? I have three husbands lined up for you already. How's it going? It's alright, we're just doing a little charity stream here for uh for this, uh, I don't know, was it tier four door, tier tier five door? I mean, it's got brain, but it's got I don't know, what, two two fifths of brain. What, what, what? What? Which of the what's was the what's? There's a lot of what's to be whatted in there. We have exams next month. Oh, cancel the weddings. Cancel the weddings. When will the game start, Jeeves? Tell us, please. Uh, we're just waiting on production. 10 out of 10 in the lobby. Imminently. You're doing a fundraiser thing? Okay, that's awesome. Craft incoming, not quite, not quite. Yeah, a few minutes, a few minutes, guys. Who are these three people you have prepared, Father? Well, they are all Chinese businessmen. 
And one of them, one of them is only 38. You will have a very happy life. I don't know, one of them's like 64, right? And I know that sounds gross, but maybe you could play the heart attack angle. Take over his company, establish some kind of a triad stronghold. You could get like a cool superhero mask, you know? So fussy, so fussy. Let's have a little dance. Here we go. More Fuzzy Mocha. The music wasn't playing, guys. The music wasn't playing. Again. All right, let's go. This is a best of three, guys. A best of three, apparently. Cringe? Cringe? You think this is cringe? Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Ready, you ready? Here we go. Here we go. The guns, the finger guns, guys. The finger guns. Why are we waiting? Three times debating. Brain versus he, he. My Michael Jackson. Guys, I know what you're saying. I know what you're saying. But on Liquipedia, it says best of three. So I don't know if I can trust you. I don't know if I can trust you, gentlemen. I will know. I will know. Let me tell you. I will know if it is best of five or best of three. I will know. It is best of five. Okay. There you go. It is best of five. Yes, yes. It appears that it could be best of five, gentlemen. God damn it. I did think it was a little bit weird that it was only best of three. Once again, you have disappointed us. Liquipedia. Oh well, no wonder we've got all the hype and set up beforehand then. Anyone remember the best of seven final what where they went off and had lunch and came back and four three'd them? Hilarious. That one? Will you stop, little pimp? Why is ESL not broadcasting this event? Jeez, they are, but in German. The Germans are covering it. 
So I was gonna be all like, Auf Wiedersehen, welcoming, welcoming to ESL Meisterschaft uh, tournament. Yeah, yeah, Brahme versus uh, he, he United. Spiel mit Dota 2. Yeah, this is gonna be uh, this is gonna be the clincher, guys. This is gonna be the clincher. Probably pick order is the. Uh... Uh, Brahma has three stand-ins, I think. Do you think these Nazis are covering these events? No, the Nazis. I don't know if there are many Nazis in Germany anymore. They have those neo-Nazis, but I don't know if that's still such a big issue. Night, night, daughter. Do not have nightmares about your proposed husbands. You only have to select one of them. Unless you go for the old one, and then you could do two. Let me know, though. Wait, are they actually pushing it back till seven? What? Oh, for God's sake. Hang on, I'm looking, boys, I'm looking. Little, little Dora, ba da da dee 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 dee. What are you doing? What are you doing? No, they're doing some sort of video stuff. Um, Brame has three stand-ins. Have you ever- Yeah, I literally spoke about the best of three already. What the hell? Jesus. Listen. Jeeves, those were not in the rules that you listed earlier. Penis stuck in blender. Instructions unclear. Are you ready? Are you ready? The grand finals. 10 out of 10 in the lobby. Five versus five on the field. Brame versus he he united. An earth shattering, country shaking Germany final. There is a chance for he -tee to win this game. Absolutely. Absolutely. I think he he smashed their game as well. Like they went 2 0, I think. They were the ones who've been faltering. Inky and the brain, Inky and the brain, one genius, the others. Oh wow, that's uh, unfortunate. Actually, that's a tragedy, that's not even unfortunate, that's gone beyond unfortunate into tragedy status. The Chinese were doing some ultra marathoning in the Chinese mountains, and 21 of them died.
Can we use Jeeves coins for predictions? Yeah, predictions are opens, I think. Yes, uh, zero for Hee Hee United, one for Brain. The, uh, the recent question was whether or not Freak Storm temperature plummet or something. Yeah, 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 they were not prepared. They were not prepared. Uh, the recent discussion was whether or not we were going to start doing first to 10 kills predictions using fake prestige. You didn't remember there was like a... Was it this? No. There was like a thing you could type. Was it just commands? Oh, I don't think it was. Silence. Oh, no, I don't think so. Maybe not. How did I get the information about who's playing and who's not? Because we literally just watched the game and we could see who was playing and who was not. And also, you can check Liquipedia and it'll tell you their roster. When will they start? Well, Seven at the latest. Even I'm gonna do a hot tub stream. No, dude, that's like a thousand sub goal. I am not doing a hot tub stream. Don't worry about it. I feel like a bit of a douche because I was like, it's starting, but it's not actually starting. So, cool. There's that girl. There's a lot of girls who do hot dub streamers. I think the one you're thinking of is Amaranth, though. Yeah. She's noble in that her advertising revenue was stopped because of her hot tub streaming and she wasn't told or something. I don't know. Basically, it was a... It was a thing, guys. It was a thing. It was a meme on Twitter for a few days. Yo, one of my... Uh, one of the guys, you know Shaw, who comes in here? Shaw? The Chinese... Uh encyclopedia um he did a sleep stream and he got an extra 40 followers or something kind of creepy i can't sleep with uh with a light on i think so i wouldn't be able to do it jeeves is actually missing chinese there's no chinese i am not missing chinese games right now there were Chinese games to cover, bro. I would be covering it. Well, there's the Asian showdown, but it's Moon Cup, so I'm assuming it's a 15-minute delay. And the Pinnacle Cup, they actually spoil your game while you're watching it, so it's like, whatever, I'm not doing that. The Sazka E-League? What is that? Czech Republic, Slovakia. See... Yeah, Pinnacle Cup. Here's the feed, the clean feed. This is not a clean feed, sir. There's odds and shit all over it. Look, you're spoiling the results for people before. <laughs> when start? Unknown. 
It's 10 out of 10 in the lobby, guys. Yeah, it's like, what's the point? I mean, if I knew how often they did it, I could uh, I could have a little graphic that pops up and goes, eh -er, and just pops over it, you know? A little, on a timer. You know, when it comes up with the IV thing on the side with the live odds, and it just comes up with a thing over the top, it just says, how about you don't? <laughs> but also, instead of giving me the clean feed of just the games, they also have like all the English stuff on there as well. So in between games, you have to like change. It's just a nightmare, man. You get the super low res of the draft and stuff. Yeah, I get rid of uh, live odds and spoilers. Like, I'm never going to get them all. That's not the point, guys. I'm never going to get them all. But I just want people just not to do it here. Like, if you spoil elsewhere, that's fine. If I catch you spoiling elsewhere, I'll ban you from the channel. I like the idea. I like the idea of the clean feed, but instead of giving us the actual clean feed, they gave us this, you know, altered feed. Yeah, absolutely, absolutely. Although, given what people have been saying that casters are getting paid, like what they're what rates they're charging, I'm like, no wonder, Jesus. No wonder BTS is like, yo, get me, uh, get me fucking ET and uh, Kmart, you know. I'm like, holy shit. I mean, on one hand, it makes sense. On the other hand, it doesn't. Like, Jeeves, if you had to go for six weeks, like, at this point, I mean, yeah, I mean, you're talking about insane amount of money. I'm not going to name names, but let's just say the average seems to be at least 250 to 300 per best of three. Per tier one and 1.5. I know, right? My rate is like, uh, for a best of three, it's like 30 buck. And for a best of five, it's like 50 buck. So I'm like, yo, Jeeves, maybe you need to increase your rates. Not even, not even. A best of three can be two matches. You can be done a best of three in an hour. Well, maybe an hour and 15 minutes. But it's definitely matured a lot since I started, because I've not really ever changed my prices. Well, I maybe went up by $10 or something. Yeah, it's decent, man, it's decent. I don't understand why Moxie gets to cast tier one games. Well, she's re really good with her um, her diction. Like you can always tell what words she's trying to say. I mean, unless she's really, really into the team fight and then she's super hyped or whatever. Um, but then we're all like that sometimes. You know, we all are like, yeah, you know. Um, she's a trained opera singer as well, so she's able to have a full range. Um. Her Dota knowledge is good enough as a play-by-play -play caster, I'd say. Moxie's voice annoying? Um, no. Um, sometimes the balance is wrong. When, when she goes to events, the balance isn't quite right on the mic sometimes. It's unfortunate. She just keeps talking. That's literally her job, man. She's the play-by-play -play caster. You need to understand that whenever there's a cast going on, generally, 99% of the time, it's a play-by-play -play caster who just talks shit ramps up what's happening in the game, puts a bit of excitement on the stuff that's actually happening literally right now. The other guy, you are game is starting. 
The other guy, the analyst, he's going to give you information that's going to give you overall excitement, right? It's going to it's going to hype you up for stuff that's going to happen in the next two or three minutes. It's going to give you detailed analysis. Well, I actually one of uh, I used, Moxie did a tournament. I'd cast for her before. I cast for her tournament. She doesn't let purge happen at all. Dude, sometimes games, there's no time for the analyst to talk. Sometimes you're like, holy shit, I didn't stop talking for 24 minutes. Literally, it's been 60 kills. There's never been a time where we've been able to stop and be like, other than, oh god, they're smoking, or they're going roche or something. Do you know what I mean? Sometimes it's just like that. As a play-by-play -play caster, you just have to... Also, you're a bit on the big stage, you're excited, it's a big game, you know? It's a purge as well is a little bit um passive. You know, there is a yeah. There's a balance, but that's a, that's something she can improve on. It's not something she's terrible at. I like to see is Moxie after a really good game, right? You see Moxie, and she's like, you know, if it's under the lights or if, but you can see that she has been fully engaged in the game. You know that she is actually she's passionate. And I think that's important. I think that's especially important when it comes to play-by-play -play casters. We're not supposed to get it right every time. That's what the analyst is there for. The analyst is there to shit all over the play-by-play -play 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 caster and be like, well, actually, no, Moxie. You can see with the raindrops there, he knew he wasn't going to take the damage. So all along, it was a trap that they'd prepared, you see. Um, that's, the, that's what the analyst's job is there to do, but after the fight. After the fight, or maybe during the fight, you can call out some cool little details that weren't noticed, like, oh my god, the Glimmer Cape usage totally saved his ass, or whatever. I remember when BSJ was with OD, OD was the one who never got to talk. Yeah, but I mean, it's one of BSJ hasn't done a lot of casting, so OD definitely would be taking the back seat in that, in that environment just to give uh, BSJ time to find his feet and flourish. It's a totally different situation. Moxie and Purge have cast together, I think, hundreds of times at this point. I honestly think I will get to a TI invite anyway. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think so. Like, Valve are screaming out legitimately for TI winning um, analysts. Do you know what I mean? Like, literally, especially someone who's able to comfortably present themselves to the audience and on a panel, um, as well as casting, of course, but on a panel specifically. Valve, uh, like, the only one that really comes to mind is, like, PPD, right? He's pretty good on the panel. I mean, you could argue that um, Cinderin is also a really good player on the panel, but remember, Cinderin is uh, not a TI winner. Is Kmart good or bad? I've never actually watched his stuff, so I don't know. I'm sure he's. I'm sure he's good. I'm sure he can learn from. You know, uh, he can. Yeah, I'm sure he'll develop into a good guy if he's not super good already. Practice makes perfect, and talking of practice, gentlemen, the time has finally come. After all the waiting, we are here for the ESL Meisterschaft Spring 2021 Grand Final. Hee <laughs> hee, United versus Brahme. I am General Jivikas. Here come the bands. Ooh, goodbye, Medusa. Goodbye, Lena. 
on Eos to the Elder Titan. I uh, like Tgov's analysis on drafts, usually on point. I mean, it's really easy for Tgov to look good versus the people he's paneling with normally, though, right? Ancient apparition. Like, just give some relevant analysis to the game. And you're winning. Onlys, what are you doing? Why are you just spamming fuck America, fuck Russia, fuck Germany? What are, what are you on? I see you started some in Russian, and then now you're kind of getting into the English. He was in 2021? Ah, nah, I don't think so, boys. I don't think so. Maybe he's a panelist. I, I could be a kick-ass panelist. Jim Marshall! What insight would you give to Dota 2 as a panelist, Jeeves? I would give the old man insight. Crowd interviewer? Could I do skits with slacks all day? I probably could. I probably could. But, you know, there is no interview. For the, there is no crowd. Bit. They could still invite me. Oh, that would be such a meme. All right, Jeeves, go and interview the audience. Okay. No. Oh. It's me alone in the Globe Stadium. Nix, 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 nix. All right, only FQQ. Although I appreciate every sentiment so far, I am worried that soon you're going to insult something that I actually give a shit about. So have an eight hour time out while you think about what you did. How often do you get gamblers who start shit with opposite betters? I'd say once every four or five streams. It depends on the mods, honestly. The mods tend to pick up on it a little bit quicker. I don't really pay attention to that shit. Mars? Ooh. ooh. Miranda, you think? Whoever picks Wraith King wins? Yeah, I need uh, I need to play some games. I've not played Wraith King in a proper game since uh, since the patch. It feels pretty much the same. I played a couple of bot matches with my girlfriend. It feels the same. I think I played one with my girlfriend and one without. But yeah, it feels the same. Like, I thought the critical strike early CS, the early, because I, I use it as a crutch for CSing in lane, right? So I thought, like, the 5.5 seconds was going to be a pain in the ass, but it works out pretty much for CSing. Said before. Yeah, I panicked a little bit because so much was changed and the Sanjay and Yasha got nerfed as well. I don't know, sometimes I wish I could choose the prioritization of skeletons, whether they go lane or jungle. Sometimes the war your team wards will screw your skeleton push sometimes. Alright, we get the Pangalier here. It's pretty sexy, right? You can roll straight through that Mars Arena. Next Assassin, not going to cause you too much trouble. Uh, I ended up playing um, Mars offlane one game, guys. And then my safe lane Kari, who picked last, picked Pudge, and I was like, we are ruined. This game is over. Man, we fucking destroyed them. It was hilarious. Safe lane Pudge, boys. Safe lane Pudge. Like, they had, like, PA and stuff. Like, it wasn't fair on them. Do you know what I mean? It was just like, we're coming at you with crits. We're coming at you with instant damage. Oh, yeah, and our Pudge has got BKB piercing disable. And he can eat one of us. Uh, do, yeah, they do target the. They do prioritize the target. You wraith fire blast. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But you know when you push out and you're doing it right, and you you dump the skeletons in the lane, and they start killing the creep wave or whatever, and then you kill out the jungle or whatever. 
And then they run all the way across to the Ancients, or where the Ancients are, because you've got a ward there. And they can see stuff to kill, but they don't see the next creep wave just yet. You can speak Spanish? Sure, man, but remember, if you do a spoiler in Spanish, I, it is still a ban, sir. It is still a ban. We get rid of the Enchantress, very strong hero right now, get Scare Bear to the curb. Scare Bear? Well, I guess the big stash resistance versus Spangler's Disarm, the chances of being disarmed for too long are not that great, right? Puck was already kicked to the curb, they got rid of the Viper, the Queen of Pain, final Bane, Jeeves. Do I remember there was a hero in Dota called the Gambler? Yes! Um... I made, uh, I made an, I made, I sent Ice Frog hero suggestions from time to time, and I sent him a rework of the Gambler, um, but I've never heard anything since. The idea was, you know, when you play, um, you know when you play, what's it called? Do you know when you play Ability Draft? So the new gambler, the idea was that he'd have a skill called nudge, hold, and he could, uh, for gold or whatever, he could he could spin his spells. So like he presses uh, spin, so nudge, hold, and spin. He hits spin, and it gives him like like two or three abilities, right, from all of the Dota two heroes. And then when he when he gets ultimate ability, he can get alts. That that was my idea for a new for a new gambler. It's pretty difficult to do though. But you can only use the ability once. You can only use the ability once. When you get it, you can only use it once. Uh Grimstroke Gyrocopter. What about IO Jeeves? Hmm. The 20 spells invoker, yeah, yeah, yeah. But imagine you're in there with your Ag Scepter and your Shard, which means you can just keep re-rolling, and you're just like fucking Echo Slam, um, I don't know, Black Hole, <laughs> just bang, 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 spells that aren't even in the game. Uh, juggernaut. Okay. Not too concerned by the missile. Pangolier's still gonna dick on you. Timber's all gonna chase you down. Omni Slash, dodgeable by Pango and Timber. Double Omni with a stroke. Hmm. Oh, Spartan is in this one. Wait, I thought Wish was playing. Nani? Nani? I don't know about League of Legends, honestly. A lot of the ideas I had for Mars and Dawnbreaker came from the hero Pantheon, though. Um, Phantom Lanshaw. The Queen of Pen. Yes, 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 yes. Grim Alti gives double Omni Slash. Battle, battle does not work, sir. Also, it says exclamation mark bet space one space then the number of Jeeve coins you want to bet if you want to bet on Brain. All right, Granny kick to the curb. Okay, they still need a mid hero for he he. I want Lena. You want Lena Jeeves? I want Shadow Fiend. You want Shadow Fiend? I want Templar Assassin Jeeves. I want Templar Assassin. I want. 
The Shrak. Just give me something that's good in mid, boys. What do we want here on Brame? What do we want? Tell me what we want. I mean, we need a mid here as well, right? Sure, I'm down. The Shrak and Lena. Those are the two for me. Doom? For who? For Hee Hee? Vipers banned. Enigma. 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 Ba -dum -bum, ba -dum -bum. They take out the Phoenix. They take out the Phoenix. They take out. Wait, does Brain play Pangolier mid? Oh, shit. Um. This is gyrocopter. This is gyrocopter. Wait, what? Are, what are these heroes? And what? EA mid. I like that. I like that. I play gyro five a lot. Yeah, I know it's a thing. So is timber saw though. Timber saw five is also a th oh, timber four is a thing. Clockwork. Free kings on a team. Brain, we're gonna get ya. They could have got sniper as well, Jeeves. They could have, right? So, he he united. They need. He doesn't mind getting it. Um... Dragon Knight? Invoker's pretty squishy. They do have the clockwork of the BKB bursting initiation, Pangolier, Timber. So, he's gonna have them up his ass. No, I don't want a joker. I want a beefy boy. I want the beefiest boy who ever beefed. Is that DK? Is DK enough? PA or Shadow Fiend? They have a juggernaut, friend. Juggernaut can't go anywhere else. Mars could be mid. That is not beef, Jeeves. That is not the beefiest boy who ever lived. That is the squishiest chicken who ever flapped. That's what that is. That's, uh, oof. That is not the beef, gentlemen. That is not the beef. All right, let's break it down. Let's shake it down for game one of this best of five. Oh, boy. This is just game one draft. Okay. Over on Brame, we have Kaito on the Timbersaw, QP on the Panglier, Spartan Gyrocopter, Focus on the Faceless Void, and Laughed on the Clockwork. Is this Gyro mid? Over on he -he United, it's Alex on the uh, Nyx Assassin, Davai Lama on the Mars, JM Vincento on the Grimstroke, Yuma on the Juggernaut, and HWA on the Skywrath Mage. I am generally wrong. Let's get our Dota 2 on! J draw for brain, okay. I agree. I feel like I feel like they've got answers for what he he United have brought to the table, but they don't actually have much on their own table. If you see what I'm saying. Only one that scales is Void. No, I mean Gyro scales. Gyro Uber scales, my friend. Is it good here? Not really. A lot of his damage is magical when you're uh, when you're up close and personable to him. Um, and you know Juggernaut is not going to be affected by that. Yeah, I know exactly why they took the. Uh, nobody made any bets. Okay. Who? Cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The SF is definitely to play into the Chronosphere. They can dump so much damage on top of it. My main concern as well when I was looking at Brain's draft was a lack of potential Chrono damage. That doesn't get you a little bit too close for comfort. And look at this, look at this, look at it. They play through here, the wards here and here. These guys play through here, they drop, drop their wards here and here.
All right, okay, what's the voice line situation here? All right, we only have two spammers, so that should be... Should be all right, guys, should be all right. Get a couple of spammers on the go. All right, we'll be 50-50 on the bounty runes, it seems. Davai Lama, though, he's right. He's ready to deny some... Uh, some rune snatcheroo action here. Sees three, he's like, maybe not, maybe not. Can't quite get to gyro, will be 50-50. And the crowd goes wild, Jeeves, absolutely wild. They took two down bottom from the radiant side and two up top from the dire side. That was, uh, that was quite something. A little bit of pan pantomime there beforehand. Oh, Jeeves, you can't identify all chat spammers? Yeah, of course. Of course. I mean, all chat spammers of the new, of the new voice lines. I normally I normally block them out, but I feel like maybe I'm I'm robbing some um psychological warfare, you know, from the viewers. The door two, it's a sick mental game, guys. Talking of sick mental games, Kayato, he goes for the fairy fire play, keeps himself alive. Very nice, very nice. Coming back into it, the battery assault laughed. Indeed, indeed, this mess, that mess, everyone's mess, it's all Jeeves' fault for sure. Where even is Pango? He's in the mid lane, Jeeves. Pango versus Skywrath Mage. Called it in the draft. Yo, Shocker, I'm afraid this is, uh, I don't speak the, uh, I, acrylics. Acrylics, that's not right. Um, shit. Yeah, sorry, I don't speak the Cyrillic. I'm sorry, bro. I'm sorry. Angolando. Alright, that's actually quite spicy. Has he got Null Talisman already? No, only three Ironwood branches. I mean, I guess it's almost a Null Talisman's worth, right? I guess so. Yeah, um... Oh no, Davai Lama. How did he... How did he... What did he... A did he... What now? I, why is he so close? Why is he under the tower? Uh, I mean, he's dead as well. No, no, no. Come on, Davai Lama. A little bit of ping issue, sir. Can you change the blind colors? I have. Look, they're all on the map. Look. The only difference is blue and red for the rest of the stuff, which is fine. Zip zap, through we go. Okay, 19 and 2, by the way, Pangalia right now versus 8 and 0 on the Skywrath Mage. Not having the finest time. Why no game signs? I don't know, guys. Why no game signs? Big questions, big questions. Where were you during the draft, friend? No Rick and Morty? Alright, level 4 versus level 4. Give him the old shield crush to start up. Halfway there, jeez. Slight advantage, because Pango went for a little wander. Alright. I don't know what he's saying, guys. Okay, I like this, I like this. He goes for the Band of Elven skin just to get a little bit more right-click damage. Something that kind of... I mean, 75 damage with that, Jeeves. I mean, he's got two Ironwood branches as well. There's a missile coming through, Davai Lama. Gonna absorb it, face first. Oh no, I missed a kill. I was too busy thinking about the pump faking out, guys. God damn. Oh, that's just sad. Like, he's just fucked. This guy gonna own this game? I don't know, guys, I don't know. I'm so intent on the Davai Lama and focus this little mind game here. I'm not even looking at the squishy kills. Power 
Nice, a little bit of magic damage, but here we go again. The swashbuckle connects, creeps. They got a little bit of cannon damage. TP across from the stroke. Can Luff finish him off here? Gets inside the Peyton ring with Cupe. Surely he goes down. Indeed, wait, he's still got to play though. In behind the tower, he's got some damage resistance. Pops off the stick. And he gets out alive. Fantastic. Fan Davy Dozy. Laughed gonna make it away as well. Yo, Gyro, you okay, bro? Gyro not in as good a position right now, I have to say. The God's rebuking is there. Coupe was gonna see if he could help him out, but in the end, he decided, you know what? He's 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 done. He's dusted. Uh they definitely have the clockwork, right? The PKB piercing to is gonna be good. Getting chased by Timbersaw isn't as much fun as you think it would be. Um, because even if he's not slowing you, he's still doing pure damage, right? Um, the Chronosphere, I kind of like it versus Juggernauts, honestly. Like, assuming you've got the damage to beat him down, yo, not like this. He actually got him, Missile. Yupe coming through with a nice little bash action. One right click, and toast. JM Vincento. And Shadow is moving through the trees here at the angle. Yupe going to take an extra few tower hits. Sorry guys, about the first few kills here, it's a little bit bloodier than we've been used to. Normally we get like six minutes, nobody's dead. It's caught me off guard a little bit, you know. You'll make best situation out of no situation. Kaito has the arcane booties finished up, very nice, very nice. Yuma. I think Phase Boots did never did finish up that um Wraith Banjo. Oh. Oh, that's a lot of damage on the stun with the silence. The ancient seal on top. The back line Cupe goes looking though. They ain't got enough damage to finish off left. And here comes the pain. Ah, they're just bullying the Skywrath Mage for now. As he gets a little bit of chonk with Zatos and stuff online. Going triple null talisman. He's in desperation mode right now. Jam Vincento. It's a double kill for QP. He's going to take the pain under the tower. TPing yeah, out. Yuma cannot find him before he completes. And you guys, I hope you're all not spoiling in chat, guys. And remember to check out NordVPN, promo code GeeVs.TV, 68% discount with one month free. Tactical timeout. Time for Jeeves to drink his tea. It's kind of cold as well. It's like it's just on the cusp of being drinkable. <sighs> no RR. No GGs. I know GGs. I know GGs, bro. Enough. No spoilers. Even spoilers in acrylic will be punished, sir. You don't drink iced tea? No, I drink regular hot tea. Nice, the gods rebuking in. Here we go, the ra ra ta ta. I do love, uh, I do love, wait, he goes for the chrono on this. I mean, he easily gets the kill with a couple of bashes. One more bash, ja, come on, come on, RNG says, okay. Focus, I'm giving it to you, bro. You could have had it. Alright, take the stroke on the way out. A little bit of a healing thing. Alex with the rotation over. Finds Spartan, hits him up with a stun. They got the stumble stun on top. Wait, he's gonna let him live. Interesting tactic. They will take the faceless void. Better target, of course. Okay. Wait, Pango's here. Wow, nice disarm. In from the side. Left ready with the clock blocking. Up to the high ground. Actually helpful for Nyx Assassin. In this case, they take out the silences. Come forward. Take him down. Now the rolling thunder prepped. He's going to go straight through the trees here. He goes looking. He goes hunting. Two squishy boys on the back lines here. They ain't got no BKB piercing stuff. Lieutenant Dang missile through, but they're going to have to back it up. Underneath that tower, just a little bit too scary. Or Brame right now. Oh my god. I want to see that. Give me the fight recap, guys. Give me the fight recap. What is this? He got... He got Omni-slashed? 
Okay, okay, let's, 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 I mean, I normally I wouldn't, right? Normally I wouldn't, but this bro... I thought he was out, I thought he was safe, right? I'm here, he's here and I'm like, this guy's totally safe, there's no way he dies. He's out, he's totally safe. This is where we left him. Oh, no way! Oh, jeez, are you blind? They're gonna under the tower, they drop down the arena. Wait, Spartans do some decent magical damage. He's just a distraction though, here comes the timber saw. Is he gonna complete the TP? He sure is. Loft is in there as well, they're dropping the full alt on top of him. He gets meltified, QP looks at least for the Mars. Can he find him? He's still alive, guys. Where's timber saw? Timber saw clean up, rip through HWA. Yuma still in amongst all of them here. Now a rolling thunder. They go looking for Divai Lama. Can they actually bring him down? Oh no, he jukes the other way. Not like this. He still got better roll in them. And they will take that kill. No teachers. All we missed was the start of the arena, guys. No one needs to see the start of the arena, right? That was whatever. You know, it's just an arena, guys. Just an arena. It takes like 0.3 seconds to form, you know, you know, so we basically just skip the animation. Uh, this is mid pango though, you have to you have to take that in, in, into consideration. Like if you want to see more mid pango, I believe Reshi D over on YouTube. I believe that guy, wait, am I allowed to, to promote his stream? I'm not sure, shit. Anyway, that guy over on YouTube, he plays uh, a mean pango, a mean pango here. Uh, the Yule Shepter. This is uh, this is common. It's pretty good versus Pango as well. They got the missile coming through. Very good versus missile juice indeed. Yeah, 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 yeah. Super early itemization. The spear coming through the gauntlet puke. They're gonna drop all the spell damage on top. We talk about them for a few seconds, and they blitz some beautiful four-man setup. Wait, they're kind of all low though. They're so kind of playing. Meanwhile, Juggernaut, he's like whatever, farming up over here, getting himself Maelstrom build. Maelstrom build. I guess it lets you prop into Chrono. It's pretty good versus Timber Saw. It's pretty good versus. I mean, so overall, it's pretty good. The map control at the moment very much in Brame's favor. They have a 2k net worth advantage only, but they own this much of the map. Look at this, look at this. They're they're bullying them out of mid lane. Davai Lama top catching a rocket on the backside. There is basically a missile. Jeez, it was, it was, but. Going in. Hook shot as well. Not much Alex can do. He does throw a beautiful stun for two. Nice. The Pango though making the play. Now the Omni Slash, but it's absorbed by three. The missile through. Laugh to fall. And he's in for the win on top of him. A little body blocking from Spartan to help him roll out. He will get the kill on Yuma though as a result. Uh, do I think Juggernaut will go Manta or, or wait? All right, never mind that. Jay Vincento dead. Will he go Manta or Santinyasha? I mean, I would definitely go Manta in this game. However, I imagine he goes Santinyasha. He goes Santinyasha. The reason being, uh, so it's the status resistance. So you are disarmed, yes, but with status resistance on top, maybe you get lucky as well with a Titan Sliver. And uh, the disarm doesn't last that long. See? Nice, Devai Lama catching the Timber Saw. The God Rebuke should be enough to finish him if he's got it. He doesn't have a Jeez, he already used it. Alright, the back line focus looks for Alex. Spartan running low on damage. The Chrono coming through, catching two. Not too shabby, actually. Gonna clean up. Double kill for Kaito. 5k net worth lead at the 13 minute mark, boys. Yep. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. What the Karan said. What the Karan said. But Sky's on his team. That's the. What are you talking about? Um, what should um, the Sky build? He's going to build Sanjin Yash as well. Probably get a Satanic. Vic. Vic Aron. I'm not the Karan. Oh. Karan with an O, dude. The Karan with an O. Not the car ran with an E. Uh, 
All right, there's a there's a a little box down here. But let's uh, let's do an iron run down while we're waiting, right? We've got uh, face boots as well as bracer building into his dual scepter. Oh no, they're back. Oh. Well, we tried, guys. Medallion coming out for Spartan 13 minutes in. He's pretty much got enough to buy out, right? So it's a German tournament, so they have to have three German players. So they have three German players and then two players from Brain, basically. My voice never go Battle Fury anymore. Um, PPD says Battle Fury is a meme item. Like the the choices are generally way better um, in other itemizations now because of the nerfs of Battle Fury. It's very situational that you go for one. Yeah, the hook shot through the back line catches the next assassin. They go for the call down. He's ready to stun up the gyrocopter. Gyro's not into that though. Now Yuma trying to close in for the double omni slash. He gets it off. He is bouncing. Then for the win, chasing into Spartan. Now looking for left as well. That'll be two. Thank you very much, Mr. Ice Frog. One, one more hit, sir. Just right clicking him. Right clicking him. There you go. Dupe arrives on the scene, the back lines, Kaito making a lot of space, brings down at least the Martian man, then two, that's the end of what, they killed the Juggernaut? Nice. Rolling thunder through, there's only the two cores, the two big boys, the mid and the off lane are alive, and they are cleaning house right now, he gets out alive, Jeeves, he wants that low sword so bad, I'll tell you what, I'll tell you what, Bobby, oh shit, Mars is back, QP. let's be a little bit cautious, 25 seconds before rolling thunder back up. Battle Fury feels too slow in this meta. Yeah, I mean, Diffusal or uh, Yasha into Sanji and Yasha are both uh, are both faster as f for Aji carries generally. Um, Sanji and Yasha also feels pretty good on most male uh, most strength carries as well. Wish is not here, sir. QPA is meant to do. Wish was only here for the first game. That's a, a pretty good pick, though. The Rolling Thunder, how long for Arena? Nine seconds, okay. They're chasing for more. They've got themselves a cheeky couple here. Ah, uh, this is a bit of a disaster. Coupe a bit of a pickup. Pops off the Yules, tries to make some spaces. He's got a Wanderer, and he can use to come back in. He has only a stick. They drop the Arena. Nice clock block and then Spartan drops in the alt as well. Now Alex getting a buzz cut. They do much about this. Throws down the stun, not too shabby. They do need to fall back though. They are over committed. And I like this play. This is good, this is good. If they can get out though, the Vendetta, oh no. There's a, oh, regenerating, who gets it guys? You give it to Pango, he juices on that, then he can juice up everyone else. Sounds good to me. No, what have you done left? All right, he tanks the gank, he didn't need to do that. I think he just thought it was just gonna be a one man army, right? But instead it's three of them waiting. Uh, Sanji and Yasha, the Maelstrom first. Fair enough. A Vailama, Kaj is like Spartan. It's an easy pick. Wait, Spartan's level 10, guys. Can we talk about that? A Vailama's level 9 and Spartan's level 10. It's about efficiency as well like it's about so battle fury is no longer as efficient um money wise as it was before nice so many slash the good shot coming through they're mostly avoiding it maelstrom procs pain in the ass that link neither roll forward you you got anything left to play here go spin for two seconds he'll be dead before he gets it and Bram, they are bringing the pain Oh my god, the sky out mostly handled by QP, but QP is still alive! 25 to 16, 9k net worth. What was that? 4 for 0? 4, 5 for 1, Juice. I mean, just set up and go for the roche, right? They're gonna take the tower first, Juice. You've got such excellent, excellent roche potential with the Pangolier. You've got the Timber Saw attack, you've got the Pangolier. Minus armor as well as disarm. Came here to watch the ad, then lurk while playing. That's really cool though. What ad?
Okay. Alright, we got a 10k net worth lead. They go into the Roche Jeeves 18 minutes into the game. 10k net worth lead at 18 minutes, guys. Is this a shellacking? Well, Kyle, or Kyle, he's there. He thinks 14% of a chance, guys. Nix is a greedy pit. Nix is a greedy pit. Okay, the glimmer kick gonna keep him alive for a few seconds. The missile comes through. They drop that arena, but guess what? Roche is already down. Yuma takes the Spartan kill plus one on love. That's HWA. That somebody gets that kill. Cupid dealing with Mars. Mars to fall. No, it's just unfair. Mm. Okay. Who has Aegis? Oh, Cupid has Aegis. Right, they got a 9k net worth lead, so I mean, they come out on top there. Even any kill they take right now is going to be a good kill, right? Clockwork is a bit of a shit kill, but other than that, any kill. <laughs> any kill they take is a good kill. He's level 11, jeez. Okay, the hook shot through the back line there. They do destroy that timber saw. That's a decent thing to do. Seven times wicked kill streak ending for Alex. HWA, he will fall. Luff now trying to get out of there. They only have a, a little iron, no real vessel. Now the chase forward can Coupe. Pops off the illusion here, trying to stop him with a bash. Ain't gonna be there, but they'll kill him anyway. Yeah, they, uh, they chunked through him. The timber saw kill was massive though. It's assassin, what's he got? He's he, I mean, he's got a spirit vessel. Ooh, he's got a spirit vessel. Oh, I see. He had. I, yeah. Okay. Okay. He was the. He were the one. With, what done it before? Jeez. Indeed. Okay. The chrono for Yuma. Rolling thunder in. Calm. Thinking. Got a bash. Got a bash. He's got a bash. Oh, the disaster. Unlucky. Unlucky. I mean, he was hitting him for a long time before that bash came through. Let's face it. The Iron Jeeves saved them, boys. The Iron Jeeves. Give them the Iron Jeeves. Wait, 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 wait. We're going to miss kills for this, but it's going to be worth it. Here we go. The hook shot in. The hook shot in. Scroll down, Jeeves. We're there. They're on top of Alex. They're doing it. They're doing it. Nice. Nice. All right, he's dead. I mean, there's also another whole fight going on over here, if you guys are interested. It's pretty good. They got the gyrocopter, but they lost two in the process. Now they look for plus one. That's an end to the Mars. Yeah, 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 they went 1-1 in their series. Both series they played, they went 1-1. So I'm expecting game two to be as fast and furious as this, if I'm honest. 43, 53 kills in 21 minutes. That's what I'm talking about, man. I've been talking smack on the European region all morning about how no kills. And yeah, even when we're doing the qualifiers, zero kills. This game, though. This game is our... Best of five, dude. Best of five. All right, they got the link um, to nothing. That's fine. <clears throat> Help them out. Yeah, that's what to do. That is what to do. Find one of your friends. Find one of your friends and get your link. Uh, get your link on. All right, the Lotus Orb actually mysteriously keeping them alive with the Glimmer Cape. He gets the clock blocking down as well. You were trying to chase forward into this. Can they look for the Chrono play? It's not up, Chief. It's not for 48 seconds. Coming bursting in here, Kaito. Trying to force them back, but this is an awful lot of bluster. They don't really have much to go with it, I have to say. Enough to take down Alex Jeeves? Apparently so. They do have the Rolling Thunder. Omni Slash going to get used with the Glimmer Clip, trying to shake him off. Not working out. Now the Lotus Orb do as well. Fall down, unfortunately. The spin for the win means he's completely magic immune. They go through that back line. Looking for Coupe here. Going to bring him down. That's the first life. Love. He pops off the clock blocking in. It's helpful. Focus. It's a... Uh... Oh, we'll be up in 18 seconds, yo. They just blitz so fast through you, Matt. He pops off the healing ward, gonna heal himself up on the high ground. Is that it? Are they forced back? 
kind of feels like it. Kind of feels like it. Creep wave going to come in now. Maybe they can slow siege a little bit. Remember, so how many charges he got? 22 charges. He can definitely tank it in. Is there not acceptor yet for Juggernaut? No. No, no, no. Omni slash only. Wow, it's looking for Blink Dogger, looking for Force stuff. Yeah, I knew I was gonna miss. I knew when I said I was gonna miss the kills. I knew. I knew when I did the Jeeves it was gonna be a kickoff to a fight. Memes, guys. Memes. Memes. Oh, Peppy Sad. They were like, "Let's gank them. We're gonna get one. We're gonna." Oh no. <laughs> Yeah, bye! Have a beautiful day! <laughs> and then Faceless Void is like, uh, warp speed, Mr. Sulu. <laughs> Engage. Alright, QP. He's got the Monkey King bar, he's got the fuse, he's got the Maelstrom, he's got the Orb of Corrosion. This man, otherwise known as the Proconing, right? A little bit of a smoke play. 17 minute I am still getting dished out there. That's only the third one. For the Radiant here. Oh, the illusion play. The Jubates. The great Jubates, mate. He's there. The hook shot through that back line. They're going to be like, no, is that the real guy? It must be an illusion. This one also an illusion. No fear, boys. It's all illusions. The Chrono, the spin for the win. Going to hold him in place. That BKB coming out with the perfect timing for focus. He looks for one more. The Omni Slash on Omni Slash action, though. They dance around, not doing anything to each other. Juggernaut taken to a wrong, horrible place by that. And they clean them all up. The GG is called before the fight even ends. The Omni Omni guys from the void. Yeah, they're... Um... No, it wasn't about that. It was about the fact that when you do Swashbuckle, you've got a chance to proc all those, those things, right? He was the proctologist, guys. He, uh... He did things to their bums, for sure, for sure. Uh, who was the MVP, though? I don't know, man. That was some uh, that was some beautiful stuff. Who was the lowest guy? Kaito is the MVP for me. He set up that beautiful Omni Omni. Era. That was so, so freaking cool, man. Are you going to Omni me? No. Are you going to Omni Jug? Are you going to Omni uh, Faces Fight? Wrong. Wrong. Time for lunch. Later, uh, Thakaron. We are... This is just game one, though, guys. Game one. Alright, so Brayton coming in pretty hot there. Coming in pretty hot. They were looking kind of flaky, kind of shaky. Maybe the other side of the bracket was just weaker, jeez. Maybe, maybe. We'll find out in game two, though, I think. I think that's going to give us a better indication of... You know what the actual Scooby is. Let me uh, let me pay the bets, guys. All right, we are ten out of ten in the lobby. Yes, remember NordVPN promo code Jeeves Data TV, eight percent discount, one month free. Yeah. Um, what are we doing? Paying the bets. Nobody bet. Not very encouraging.
The, you guys see the shuffle of um, between RNG and Elephant. They swap Red Panda for Super.
All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the EL Masterchef Spring 2021 ESL. I said that Prime versus Hehe United. <laughs> I am General Jukas, and this is game two, believe it or not, although it does not say on here. This is game two, Brain taking game one, kind of comfortably, I'd say, so... Coming into this with a little bit of a spring in their step. He he United definitely aware. Beware. They take out the Panga Lair. Also ancient operation kick to the curb, boys. Viper. I feel the dusha. I feel a need for screen. Yeah. Really work, does it? Feel the need uh, for a snack. Moron. Yeah, five seconds left now. Oh, they take out the Lena. Is will it be first pick Medusa? No, Timbersaw. All right, a little bit of a pain in there. Bottoms the previous game. Kaito playing a blinder on it. Kaito san. Medusa, Medusa, Brame, take the Medusa. Okay, I was expecting he he United to snap that bad boy up. Okay, snap daddy -o. Where is Wish? Where is Wish? Where is Wish? I don't know, QP is playing mid. SS Spartan, back in. So I think Wish played game series in the semi-finals, and now Spartan is in, Wish is out. Nix, 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 nix. Ooh, Radiant Team Fan! <clears throat> I'm dead. I'm dead. Dire Team Fan! Okay, Andy Mage. Tiny. Tiny. Well, because of Medusa, right? Makes sense. You probably want to get rid of PL as well. Medusa's all win? Question mark. Nyx Assassin's pretty good, right? It's a good start. Timber saw. Mm, not that great, but still okay. You got the Phantom Lancer. I was expected to get rid of the Wind Ranger because it eats through Timber saw. Scare Bear. Plus Medusa is kind of greedy though, right? I don't think you can go for that. Slardar is a pretty good can opener for the offlane that Brain could think about here. Elder Titan's got to be top of their list as well. Morphling ban though, I imagine, from Brain. Right, and then what does that leave you as a pain in your ass? The Monkey King, the Ursa, the Slard. I'm dead. Bet one, one five six T. I don't think whispers work, so fellas, skid. Let me check. I don't think they work. I think you need to do that like aloud. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You just need to do it without what you did, but without the bracket, it will work. Assuming you have one thousand five hundred and sixty G four. All right, they kick off the terror blade. They do pick up the elder titan as. <clears throat> Uh, expected juice. I think that works. I think that works so far. Let me see. No. Hmm. Do you know how much money do you have? Type swag to see your coins. Like swag. Like this. You, you really gotta pick a hero. You got 10 seconds left. Five seconds, Morty. It'll be fine. Right. Nice. 69. Nice. Um, yeah, so just do the bet one and then with the 696 instead. Winter Wyvern! Oh, I've read some of your stories. Yes, yes, very good, very good. I particularly like the cold embrace. Yes. What team is which? Uh, so 
<laughs> United is Michael Jackson. And uh, Brain is Pinky and the Brain. Pinky and the Brain. The Pinky and the Brain. It didn't work. I think it did. Uh, somebody bet on Brain. How much money do you have, Jizz? Jizz, 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 Jizz? I don't think you have enough money. Wait. Now I have to look again. Two people bet on Brahm successfully. Check your swag, dude. Yeah, yours worked, Sophilus kid. That's how you do it. You check your swag before you check your swag after. They picked up a puck. A puck while we were uh a pip 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 pick up a puck. Oh, we were waiting, guys. Okay, 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 okay. This can kick off early. This can secure early Roshan. Potential Winter Wyvern is a pretty good protector of Rosh. Elder Titan kind of says no to Rosh, though. Yeah, there you go, dude. You only have 770. There you go. That worked. Now check your swag again, and you'll see that all of your coins are gone, guys. I take the money up front. Hmm. Right, no. G, you go to North, no Mars. Lifestealer, I guess, gets a little bit of a bonding as well. I don't think so, though. I think Morphling is my biggest concern here. Like, Morphling's still in the pool, Condre. Dry, 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 dry with a Templar Assassin. Mm, Luna. Mm. You could just go for the... Ra you want somebody who, who builds, like, an armor enhancement for the boys, right? Get the Venom Monster. Wind Ranger's banned, mate. They already, uh, they already thought about that one. They already thought about that one. Let's, uh, let's have a think here. It'll be fine. Was it Morphling? Yeah, Ursa. Ursa's the other one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ursa's the best pick. To take out the troll. Troll would have been okay as well. But yeah, Ursa can go defuse a lot. I bet he still goes battle for you though. Like, he doesn't care too much about Elder Titan's stuff because of his Enrage. It's pretty good. Legitimate shard. He can go status resistance build with a Sanjin Yasha with the Enrages. Why did they let it through? Oh, yeah, man. It's worse. I normally cast it after my teeth are pulled. I cast a grand final and New Premier made some uh He made like a highlight video of it. But it was the it was like I still my face was all sore from the the dentist getting a wisdom tooth out. And my mouth was half paralyzed. Nice. If I had a tooth pulled no, every time I go to the dentist to get my teeth out, they're always wisdom teeth that are um no, my wisdom teeth. I've only had wisdom teeth pulled. And only when they're like ready get pulled out anyway. Like they're literally falling out. Alright, they do take the scare bear. I salute this. This is good. I mean, you already have early roast potential with the TA, right? We talked about that. We talked about defensibility with the Winter Wyvern and the Timber Saw. How it's a pain with the Elder Titan. But you've got the next Assassin as well, the Scout. And you've got the scare bear. You can just sneak in there and do it as soon as he gets Possessed Mask these days. Possessed Mask in a Diffusal Blade build up is a pretty sexy option. Rame, they need something spicy for the mid lane that's not too greedy. The dicks on Ursa and Templar Assassin. Hey, uh, maybe the Pugna again. The Pugna was pretty good last time, right? Razor? Mm, 
Okay, yeah, the damage drain on Templar Sass is a pain in the ass for me to deal with. Forces Ursa to have to move away from the fight when he wants to commit sometimes. Ten hours straight. One time I was having a play fight with my son and I headbutted his denim jacket and I chipped my front tooth and uh, I had to go and get like a, just a little a little bit of cement or whatever on top and a little cap thing for it. Not like a not like a metal cap, just a regular tooth thing. And uh, oh my god dude. That was so fucking sore because the nerve of the tooth was like every time I drink a cup of tea I'd like almost kill myself. Anyway. Let's break it down for game two, a best of three. Brame leading by the way for game two. They do have this Medusa on focus. Spartan picks up the snap. Daddy left on the Elder Titan. QP, QP, QP on the puck and Kaito on the razor. Kaito on the razor offlane, Jeeves. Interesting. Gonna take the fight directly to Yuma over on Hehe United on the Ursa. HWA on the Templar Assassin in the mid GM. Vincenzo, Winter Wyvern, Alex Nix Assassin, and Divine Lama on the Timber Saw. I am General Jeevicus. Let's get our Dota 2 on. Oh, okay, okay. So, um,. The chat is split 66% Brame, 33% Hee <laughs> Hee United. It's true, guys, it's true. Before Michael Jackson became a singer, he was a Jeevecoin millionaire. And when everyone found out he was a Jeevecoin millionaire, he's like, check out my album. They're like, of course. True story, guys. It's a true story. That is Slacks. Give me the fucking picture of this right now. Oh my god. Oh, I, I think I, I didn't get it in time. Did you see that shit? We're, we're, whoa, 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 never mind the normal introductions, guys. Never mind that, never mind that. We have a contender. We have a freaking contender. Right, please stop talking. Please stop talking. Please, 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 guys. Alright, we got it, boys, we got it. I don't know if you know the legend of Slacks and his ugly sets, guys. But he, Slacks, he loves an ugly set. Look at, look at this hideous monstrosity. Look at that. What is going on here? Actually looks a lot more a lot worse in the um in the pre-screen, right? I mean in this screen, look look at that, look at that. Like wow. Let's let's go, let's go. The rainbow shell. Let's insult the entire LGBTQAA. Community Jeeves? No! <laughs> Ultralisk Nyx? Ultralisk has two tusks at the front though, right? I guess he does have two tusks there. Kinda. These little tiny mandibles here. Do they have a horn on the Ultralisk now? I'm dead. No, they uh, messed up the in-game lobby. They're not doing in-game lobbies. They're doing separate lobbies. They're doing separate lobbies or something. Whoa, 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 Blackberry Bama now. Also looks like the new Brock. Yo, I had some of those mounts, man. I think I had a blue one and a purple one. I might be making this up now. A yellow one. There was like eight mounts for the shitty but for for AQ20 there was like eight mounts I think. <laughs> no, I think there was one mount for AQ40. You ever had a physical altercation with your father? Yes. Well, I had a mm, I have two dads. One time I was uh, I was mad at my dad because he disconnected my internet and caused me to die. Like think about someone deliberately giving you an abandoned and Dota 2 rant. 
when you're immortal level, right? So I went and I went and I gave my dad uh, verbal abuse, but he was cooking dinner at the time and he had a big chef's knife in his hand. So I was already berserk at that point. I have had problems with my temper as a young man. And uh, I went for him. And uh, <clears throat> yeah, he. Uh, my mum ended up grabbing the knife and got her, cut, her hand cut and stuff. It was it was pretty intense. Don't recommend. My uh, my dad was a notorious wind up merchant though. Like, I know that sounds sa <laughs> sounds kind of sad. One time my brother was annoying him, and he said, if you don't stop annoying me, I'm going to throw this log at your head. And my brother said, as if you would, and then the log hit him in the face. <laughs> this guy, this guy, talking about getting hit in the face with a log, this guy got just slapped for half his HP, guys. That's like uh, 350 HP. Those were Silithids. Anubrak was the big scarab dude. Ah, wait, what? I thought they were all the same. I thought they were all part of the same shit, honestly. I remember, I remember there was a Nubrak dudes underneath um, Naxxramas when they were on the Carrion fields in the Northrend region. There were also some in the plains, right? When Nachramas was originally in the Plague Lands. Alright, what's focus is play here? He goes straight for Yasha, geez. Nothing too exciting there. That mana will pay off eventually as well. 52 bonus damage. This could be something. Alright, before he's able to use it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember there was like a new Brock was an actual kingdom as well. But I thought the, um, I thought those, I thought those Scarab dudes were like the bosses everywhere. I thought they were in charge of the other place as well. It's been a long time though, man. I got, a, I got world first one time in uh, Uldar. Heroic Uldar. Hmm. 25 man or whatever it was. The ones in Northrend were undead. Where are they? I guess so. Where are they though? I thought they were just body done. Some of them were definitely undead, for sure, for sure. I, I'm pretty sure there was a couple of dudes who were not undead. We were all like, yo, bro, help my undead bros or something. Did you brain? I mean, it's one of those games, guys. Last game, what was it? 20 minutes, 56 kills. This game, 3 minutes, 0 kills. Maybe they just need a few levels to get going. What's Spartan building? I mean, he's got a stick. Mm, he's still got himself a fairy fire and a ball. But he's running low now. He's running out of regen. That's when four starters start to come through. When you're waiting on that courier with the supplies, maybe the courier doesn't make it, and things start to snowball. What is this talking of snowballing? Hello. Loved. That's not a good look, my friend. He's got overpower at level three. I know it's unusual. Panic should be your first option. Good, though. Those brown boots paying off. Oh, brown boots on the earth as well. Oh, no. Oh, no. The leap, he chases to the mid lane. It's getting more and more worse for you, Matt. Now he's actually going to have to commit for it, maybe. I don't know. He's like, I'll go back this way. He won't expect it. He eats through the tree. He looks for the angle. Oh, no, he's too healthy. He's too healthy. And that's an incredible amount of space created there. 11 and 4, Yuma. Feels bad, man. We saw it. We saw it. This guy was the first blood. It was 100% of the kills, 100% of the time. Can't deny, he was literally on the screen, guys. I mean, can we go back a bit? I want to see how this situation unfolds. So he's here and he's feeling great, right? Little Shredder, shotgun blast. No, just shotgun blast. Okay, then the snack, the snack! Guys, does level 2 snack do too much damage? An essay. 
Discuss. Medusa with rapier? Don't even need Medusa with rapier. Look at that. Medusa with level 2 snack. That's all you need. Yo, there's a lot of heavy combat music. Like, shit's about to go down any second now. Oh, I don't like this. I don't like this. Where's Mr. Blue? Mr. Blue's far back. Focus. They're trying to focus. Focus. Now the cookie away should be enough. No, the stun. Another timber chain. The mana shield. But there is... Warling Death. All right, I mean, that's one for one then, I guess. The chase is on. The Kiki was a save, it was a save, it was a save, but it didn't quite work out because Nyx was ready for that. He watched the Lego movie and he prepared himself psychologically beforehand. Nice, I like this, I like this. It opens with a shotgun. The little shredder surely is gonna be better versus Ah, uh, it's kinda of counterproductive though, right? Because every time he hits you with the little shredder shot, you get one more stock of reactive armor. So even though it minus your, your armor. Yeah, yeah, just stick to the shotgun. Brain won the first game. Should we have a thing somewhere maybe? Where it shows the score. I think until they have a few more scores on the scoreboards just now, though. It's a little bit confusing, right? But soon. Maybe if you put it to the left. Yeah, yeah. I know where I'm going to put it. Alright, Spartan. He's getting nibbled just a little bit here. They come rushing forward. Nix, Nix, Nix. He's got another stun. The cookie this time will be well timed. And uh, keep focus nice and uh, nice and healthy. No, it's actually 1-0. Can somebody type it in chat? I don't think you can hear the chat. The, it's 1-0 to Brain. Alright, nice kill. Someone else is fighting on the backside. No, pack with rotation. Oh no, Nyx Assassin surrounded. The coil though? I don't know about that one. How much damage does the coil do? That's crazy. What? 125? Are you out of your mind, Ice Frog? Yeah, 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 yeah. Tailing. Tailing. Can I, uh, two seconds, guys. Oh, shotgun. Okay, I'm mean, using amongst all this. The timber chain, though, the counterplay, the stun is there. Yeah, spike too much. Cookie forward. Get some with the carapace. Focus can get stunned up now as well. Chakram on top. Chakram on top. He's level 6, Jeeves. I mean, even still, the Mystic Snake doing incredible damage. Look at the stacking that's happening here. My god. Yo, never mind that. Left is, uh, left is hitting him with the old uh, Scepter of Power. Stomp. Can't quite catch him. Good effort, though. Good effort. Who takes these? Who takes these stacks? Medusa. Six snake level three. Okay. Fire off. That's gonna be a good one. Yep. Amazing. Actually, nice cookie play as well. Um, I want to do the scores at the top of the screen, but I'm not sure if I can get time to do it. Team one is no waiting, waiting for it. Come no. on, oh, guys. Is that good? It's too big. It's too big. It's not too big. It's too small. Yeah. No, the fight. It's okay. I got you, boys. I got you. 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 Don't worry. I got you. Right, nothing happened, nothing happened. Chill, chill. Switch it to net worth, switch it to net worth. Right, we're gonna follow this guy. Oh no, that didn't work. Okay, is it working? I don't know. I don't think so. If I do this, I think it's too big though, guys. It could be a little bit too big. Are you ready?
No, don't fight! Sons of bitches, we saw it, we saw it live, though, Jesus. We saw it live, even while you were fucking around. Did not see this kill, though. This kill was the alternative kill we'll get on replay. Oh, wait. Oh, he thought he was gonna be the killer, but actually, he was the one who was killed. Is that. It's a bit. It's a bit. Hang on. I can fix this a little bit, I think. But. Doesn't really help, dude. Honestly. Stop. Just stop fucking with it. I wanna move it up just a little bit there. Yes! Sort of. Scuffed. Good enough. No battle pass, guys. No battle pass, I'm afraid. <clears throat> there will be two summer events, though. Well, one summer event and one event just after summer. Right, focus. He's going for the Yasha. We knew this before. Spartan probably looking for Medallion next. Davai Lamai coming through looking for Hood. Tranquil Booties. QP. Uh, he goes for double Null Talismans. And, oh, wait, only one Null Tally this time? I guess he kind of got wrecked in mid, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is best of five. This is best of five, guys. Oh, this is what we talked about. The mana break. The cookie forward. He's already dead. Ooh, has he got the coil link? No, he doesn't need it. The silence? I think he does. He uses the coil on the end. He's tanky. He's tanky. He's dead, surely. He's getting away with it. Not like this, Jeeves. Oh, no. Brain. That is a disaster. They lose their Medusa and Spartan. Cupe used his ult and forced a retreat. Oh, no. The back line. They're going to get left for a plus one. Are you serious right now? Yes. There's no way he can juke out of this. Dun, 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 dun. Yeah, he's dead. Better this way with battle pass. I lost over 1k MMR with people doing stupid battle pass quests. I got my Aegis, boys. My Aegis is here. Dyer's middle tower's under attack. I went around my friend's house and he's got two he's got two eight no three Aegises and two Roshans. Like, under attack. He doesn't have the super scuffed roach though. Which ironically will probably be the most valuable Roshan as time goes on. I don't understand. You can just do your battle pass in turbo or on rank. Why would you do it in rank? That makes no sense. Stuck in the pit. Hmm. Okay, Kaito surrounded by three here gets stunned up. Nice play by Alex with a vendetta. A little leap, a little hop, a little skip, and Yuma. He cleans up the old Razor there. Oh, the counter play from Brain. They do need to do something. They're 1k down. Templar Assassin getting ridiculously out of hand, by the way. 7k, 7.2k net worth. Okay, Nick Saskarapis will play it. The stomping is there, though. Nice time. All right, all right, all right. Alex gets that kill. You up with a counterplay. Give him the shotgun to the face. Give him the shotgun. Anytime you're ready, buddy. Doing it. Okay. Spartan. Gonna cookie himself. Winter's curse. You was thinking about whether to commit, but with a razor close by, doesn't want to get in on that fight. He backs off for a TP to the bottom lane. Starting on farming. I mean, TA came in at the end of that fight, but mostly. Has been farming, bottled up Haystrun, ready to refresh her mana. And uh, applying pressure to the tier 1 in the mid tower. Sure. We talked about this, how the meta very much feels like holding the mid, uh, holding this mid line is the best. Yo, who died? Left. Alright, that's my bad. That's my bad. Like, holding this line is the best, right? So being able to break in here like this is kind of cool. But not unexpected these days. Yeah, I hate when uh, challenges and stuff in Dota Plus are totally like, do something you would never do in this hero. Razor 
razor with refresher. I think that was good for like one patch, right? Oh, no, no, no. Do X amount of damage with this thunderstorm so you end up having to get refresher just to make it work. There was one patch where refresher was really good on this, though, I swear. It was not the patch that it was in the uh, battle pass, though. I have, like, an incredible win rate on Ember Spirit, though. Because I had to do, like, X amount of damage or some shit with Ember Spirit. So I had to just keep winning games. I just kept, like, I had to keep playing them to get the challenge, right? So I kept just winning games and not achieving the challenge or whatever. And I'd be like, oh, okay. Yeah, see, Razor with Refresher was good. It's still good now, I think, if you get the Shard from Roche. Yeah, I remember when actually Razor used to be super sick versus buildings. Alright, Alex, what's he got? Still just running with the Tronco boots. He's got the shovel though, guys. I don't know, some people were talking shit about the shovel, but, you know, it's 150 HP, and you get free mangoes, and you get free salves, right? It's not to like. So you get bounty hunters, right? No bounty hunters, Oh, fuck that shit. You can't find a bounty hunter. Right, they're TPing for the fight here. He's pushing in. All right, it's Timber. It's HWA with the Desolator finished up. I like this. I don't know, he's going for the Hurricane Pike over the Blink and the BKB. Jeez, maybe not that good. The Plasma Field from the side. The Empire Assassin is getting Cremola foamed here. Will be brought low. Now Jane Vincento tries to run away after throwing out the Winter's Curse. But guess what? The Link, he's got some damage at least to chase him down. 66 stolen. The chase forward coming through from two angles at the same time. Alex getting caught out here. Does throw down the Carapace. Still alive somehow. Jane Vincento. I guess he Golden Brace himself while we weren't quite watching. Focus is there with the scream, forcing them away. Davai Lama can't come back in. Jane Vincento, he put back for this. What does he have available? Literally nothing. TP was up, I guess. So, you know, something. But overall, what did they lose, Jeeves? Like nothing? Two deaths? On a buyback? I mean, Brain trading up there for sure. Yeah, shrapnel would damage um, would damage buildings, so you could just literally just stack shrapnel. Like you didn't get charges of shrapnel, but you could just literally just you just shrapnel here, and it would damage. The <laughs> it would do the creeps, and it would damage the tower, and it would uh, it would really annoy whoever was mid. I mean, Sniper can still take the towers from outside of range, but it takes a little bit of setup now. Hmm, Davai Lama, he's got the hood, he's looking for this Yules, it's almost done guys, almost done. Get a little switcheroo here. Trying to phase Yules in hand, very nice by the way, Yules does not break the line. They're not going to try and smoke right here, are they? That seems impossible. All right, Plasma Field. They got a little bit of information. A little Timber Chain forward. He says, hello, Mr. Timber Saw. He's got Lotus Orb coming. No, you want to see Yule's first use. They do go for the smoke. This is kind of ballsy, given the fact there's a trap right there. Okay, Yuma. Has managed to get himself over here. The stomp goes out. Doesn't really catch too much. They get themselves what? A little poke, a little tug. And both the Ursa and the Timber Saw. Overall, they're just both uh, disengage. Next is saying, let's push bottom. All right. I mean, top is in a favorable position to be pushed by the Radiant. Do you want to do the old trade route? They want to try and snatch Roshan outside. Of the Ursa lineups reach. 
They do start to... Yuma's committing bottom. Look, he's committing bottom. They're coming back in for the fight right now. Unfortunately, he's out of position. Do they know, though, to take the advantage? Timbersaw ripping through. Now the silence. The plasma field. The damage drain. He's in the wrong place at the wrong time. Zipping forward a little bit. Now the coil. Even more damage stolen. Keep Kaito alive. He's going to have a rapier. He's dead. Jeez. Okay. Well, I mean, it was a plan. You are able to get into the fight on time. Cleans up with a double kill overall. Versus 10 kills secured by <laughs> United. Oh, shit. What? Wait, 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 wait. That one's on me. Um, well, it's kind of on QP, but it's also on me. So he escapes. I think he's gone. Oh, no, nah, that really is on me. Wait. Yeah, that's on me. That was on me. That was on me. I should have been able to. Uh, I should have been able to anticipate that. Easy Roche, by the way. Three guys down. And you've got Scare Bear. And you're going to kill two left now as well. You've got Catapult Wave pushing in on all the waves right now. Yuma up top, taking care of business there. Hey, Jingle Meister. What's up, my dude? Today we are in Germany, my friend. Yeah. It's all good. Yo, Davai Lama, are you okay, bro? He's trying to get away. Corpes there, giving him the old right clicking with the coil. Ooh, gets the shield up in time, backing it off. Davai Lama's timing just a little bit off there. They're going for the Medusa. She's all out of mana, running out of steam. Ouch, ouch, ouch. Down she goes. And that's a pretty big kill, I have to say. This Medusa getting handled. HWA's T8 definitely online. Link Dagger, the Dragonlance, and the Deadless as well. That's the Groovy Bow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She is nowhere near online enough. Yuma's ready to fight her with this Diffusal Blade. Hey, well called on the Diffusal Blade Arsa Chiefs. Didn't you say he'd probably build um, Battle Fury anyway, just to piss you off? I did, but he did not, so that's fine. How's everyone doing? What day is it? Saturday, right? Saturday night. I better not start singing Saturday night and it's like Friday or Sunday, boys. I'll be fucking raging. Or staff coming for Elder Titan. All right, Kaito looking for his BKB. His Blink Dagger. Mm, BKB is pretty big. Like the Fusil's definitely a pain in the bottom. Ursa 355 movement speed, 397 movement speed on Razor before his phase boots act. If you hit him with a Diffusal though, all of a sudden you can leap on his ass. Yeah. She needs her she needs her items, right? She has literally a butterfly and a manta. So she's got good farming potential for sure. But what's she gonna build into? The BKB, she's gonna build into Daedalus. She wants Ag, she wants Shard as well. Or are they gonna cast magically on her that she's gonna I mean for the Ag, she doesn't need that, right? You just throw the snack out. The problem is the scare bear, even if you do stone him, he can just pop off on rage, right? Once he gets shard. Is he going to get Shard Jeeves? I mean, guaranteed, <coughs> almost guaranteed the next Roche is theirs. Your Masters is killing you? What are you writing your Masters on, dude? Wait, I imagine we're talking about your Theses. As opposed to just the course in general. Sometimes for some of the stuff, depending on how they're, you know, depending on how it's marked, sometimes it's it's it's, it's okay just to forget what you you know and just to go with what they say. Data analytics, that's the easy stuff though. Or are you trying to make conclusions? Don't try to make conclusions, man. 
I just analyze the data. Don't try and make conclusions. Like, you can make conclusions that the data actually shows you right there and there, but you don't need to go. You don't, like, the level that you're trying to analyze it at, I think it's, you don't need to go that deep. That's what I'm trying to say. I know that sounds weird for masters, but it's, yeah. See what you, say what you see, and then write about what you see. And then conclude what it was, either that you started out with, or did not start out with. But you do not include anything there that is new at the end. That would be stupid. Remember, causation is not correlation. Correlation is not causation. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. What I'm saying is don't stress it too much. Don't overthink it. Does that make sense? Your masters and your theses, don't overthink it. Uh, for your PhD, 50% overthink it. Alright, what does the robot say? 69% hee <laughs> hee, that's pretty funny. Like honestly, it's not about 99% of what you're doing, it's not about the content. It's about the workload and managing the workload and being able to produce what they've asked for. You know, 99% of that. The only bit that's kind of different is the theses, but the only thing that's different there is the original content. You know, what you're doing it on. The rest of it is all stuff that you've already learned. Anyway, <laughs> that's a double kill. They will smash through them. 10k net worth. Are they too far ahead at this point? I want to see them go for like a, a high ground push though. Before these guys get the rest of their items online, the BKB is going to be real difficult for them to deal with, I think. What can I get with Jeeve coins? Not much, my friend. Not much. I use them for blackjack and hookers. You can buy Jeeve coins. That's that's what you can do with Jeeve coins. You can buy them. I mean, you can earn them by being in the channel as well, I guess, or following. There was a menu on the old computer, I think, of stuff you could buy with Jeeve coins. It was shit stuff. It was like, get your own voice, not like a voice, get your own sound command. Um, add Jeeves on Steam. Um, make an emote or some shit. I don't know. Well, yeah, when you get a million Jeeve coins, I send you a girlfriend for free. Or a boyfriend, depending on your preference. Please, uh, please ensure that if you're married, that you are either have told your wife or that your wife is cool with it. Once they're on the plane, they're your problem. Alright, I like this, I like this. Brain, they're feeling, they're suffering. 12k net worth behind. They go for the smoke play. Gonna run right past Davai Lava on the high ground here. Up past this trap. Don't do anything, QP. Oh my god. HWA, it's perfect. He blinks away though. Can they get anything here? The timber so Okay, better than nothing. A little cookie play forward. The stomping to hold them in place. But is Jules going to get him dodged up on that? No problemo. Now they blink in with the Winter's Curse. And oh my god, Puck annihilated by the right click of Focus. He is some mashing fools now that he's got Scadio on like slowing up Yuma. He starts to get poked back now as well. The bomb's getting dropped from downtown. Snapfire doing some work. Alex ready with the Carapace. Yo, there it is. He's going to stand them up inside the Chakram. Decent work, but Focus turns into a little bit of a raid boss as soon as he gets the Scadi online. He didn't even use the, uh, didn't even use the stone gaze. I take it they bought back on the puck. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So we, we spoke about this before, guys. We spoke about this before. It's shit. They lost, uh, they lost uh, two heroes and bought, bought back, but at the same time, they are significantly behind, so decent enough. 
What about migration papers? Migration papers? What, in the, for data? Migration papers and data? I mean, that just sounds like a function of what you're going to do, right? Oh, no, that's your problem. For that, that is your problem. Like I say, once she's on the plane, it's your problem. But, but Jeeves, that just seems like, um, like human trafficking with extra steps. Look, do you want a girlfriend or not? Who's downtown? It's Mr. Devai Lama. What's he got going? Oh, the bell of the current patch. Kaya and Sanj, guys. Kaya and Sanj. Very cool. It's very cool with the timber saw. Another smoke play from Brain this time. Maybe they find something juicy. I don't know. Alex, there's Yuma as well. And Vincento. Now, Cookie up. They go in. <laughs> they don't know. <laughs> they don't know. Can I show you Ursa and TA's build? Sure, man. Ursa, he's got Diffusal Blade, BKB, Blink going into Ska D. Got a cheeky um, Morbid Mask for doing Roshan. He didn't get the Possessed Mask, it's whatever, you know. Um, he will get Ska D at some point. TA, on the other hand, now has the MKB on top of the Blink BKB. Yeah, so. There we go. Ages and Cheese. They take the second Rosh as expected. It's so quick for them to do, right? You've got you've got the Roshan, uh, so you've got the Ursa to rip through with the uh, Fury Swipes. You've got TA for the Mind's Armor. And you've got Timber Saw, Nyx Assassin, and Winter Wyvern to keep people out of the pit. Oh, I like this as well. The Enchanted Quiver. Extra range on the first hit. Be pretty devastating actually for the uh, the bounce. Do so 1v9. Here we go. Let's see this uh let's see the side blade bounce. I mean that was nowhere near as cool as I thought it was gonna be. Alright, left with the four stuff, the bull whip looking for Acceptor. Our boy, Kaito. He's looking for Halberd BKB. BKB stuns you, so he's looking for Halberd blink dagger. Is this it though? Now that he has BKB online, can they actually take a fight? Like, I feel like Razor can't initiate properly because, like, Alex can just pop Carapace, right? And then it's like, ha ha. Not he he, it's ha ha. It would be he he, Juice, he's on, on, Alex is on he he. I, mean, I guess, okay, anyway. I'm down, I, I'm down for it to be he he, guys. Uh, one in chat for he he, two in chat for ha ha. When you Carapace the plasma field. You make best situation out of no situation. I'm dead. I agree, you are. I agree. Mana boy. I agree. I agree. Oh, dude, mana boy. He does have baby crit in hand, building into Daedalus now. Damon Edge, only 700 gold away. Two. You want haha? -ha? Lolly14 wants haha, -ha, guys. These two items. I don't know if you know, but um, this is physical damage. The mana break uh, element is physical damage. Uh, so when you combine it with orb of destruction with minus armor capabilities as well, you do even more damage. Very cool, Jeeves. Tell us more. Dropping the bombs downtown. Alex, he goes for the stun up. That will stop Granny. But you still got an extra two blasts in. Kaito in there with the BKB draining the damage. You might need to get in on top of him. Oh, oh my god. Even after all that damage stolen, minus 157 still brings him down. Easy peasy. Spartan in a bit of a pickle. That's a Yuma on top of him. Now the scream. Creates a little bit of space. Forces them back. The tier two's down. The tier three. Now the siege. Wait, never mind the siege. Devai Lama, he's in here. He's got the flamethrower roasting out through this mana shield. Trying to beat, beat down. Cookie forward, not too helpful. Focus down. 80 seconds. He's going to buy back now. Trying to fight back into it. It's a triple kill up for HWA. Melting through this turret. Now the fortification. The snack goes downtown. 
He's gonna get stunned up for it as well. Alex was ready with the car, but Spartan on top of him. The ice, uh, cold embrace, gonna keep him safe. As WA tries to commit, but Davai Lama will with the flamethrower on the chakram and melts who focus forces him back. They're there, Yuma on top of him. Yuma still got the edges. He, he feels indestructible right now. Does he say that? He does die. All right. The damage strain, the stomping, holding them in place with the cold embrace. Kind of cool, actually. Haito getting a decent amount of damage, ripping through 215 damage turn, try, nope, he's toast. That's a buyback, mid tower, mid rocks are already down, do you want to keep fighting? They're still there, they're still knocking on the door, they've only lost their Nyx Assassin. Under Aegis I guess, the buyback of the Razor, that's enough though, they start to back it out. Brame, their base is in Tatars, guys. They've, I mean, they've had a redecoration here in the front area. I mean, it's really opened up for activities over here. No more tower. Yeah. 30k net worth advantage going to <laughs> United. I don't know, the second cold embrace was a little bit like, yikes, you know, because <laughs> it gets like 200 damage already, but they're able to shut him down. Whoa, 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 whoa. All right, all right, all right. Sort of dangling downtown here. And Focus says, I'm taking your tower, bro. Fight me. Yeah, so much room for activities, guys. Okay, okay. Does he have the Winter's Curse, though? I don't know. Yuma might be able to throw down a little bit of a slap, I think. Dabai Lama again with the flamethrower, he closes in here. This is their play for this every time. The scream going out, he's trying to get the angle. He does freeze up for TA. Even with that BKB up, she gets absolutely mangled here. Now Yuma trying to finish him off. It's working. Four stop, Glimmer Cape, everything on focus. They focus, focus, save. I guess they do keep pumping out the damage. It's a double kill though for HWA. Now Yuma looking for him. He eats up the cheese. He goes down 110 seconds on the sideline. The GG is called game two goes the way of <laughs> United. Well, they tried, guys. They tried, but the draw from Hehe <laughs> United was just way too fast. Frame were not able to uh, charge W Padge. Quite funny. Quite funny. Um... That's the, oh, I mean, it's all on this guy, though, right? It's all on Coupe. Was that Coupe? The TA Master. Rip. That was Coupe on the other team. Geez. Oh, sorry. It's on this guy. Carlo Agathian. What was his name in game? Unknown, jeez. Anyway, TA 8, 1, and 10. I mean, yeah, Devai Lama had 10, 2, and 12. Yeah, Yuma had 8, 0, and 6. But this guy, the early the early Desolator plus the early um, Dragon Lance, it really allowed him to command the game, I think. First game, you bet you lose all your money. Don't worry, you'll have earned money just from watching the show. Don't worry, I've got you, bro. All right, one one, Jeeves. As as predicted, boom! There is he he United coming in hot. What does the robot say about the next game, Jeeves? It says ten minutes. Oh no, a best of five. Are we gonna be here all night? If you have ten minute gap every time. Okay. Right, let's pay the bets, Jeeves. Pay the bets. Oh, you know what I need to do before we pay the bets, guys. Got a little. Oh, I don't know. Yeah, we got a little. We got a little thing here. Check this out. Check this out. You ready for a laugh? This is quite funny. Mostly memes. Quite hilarious. I'm here to tell you about the great deal from NordVPN using promo code GeeksDoTV. That's right, guys. You know it. 68% discount. One month free. Let's go. We can go all over the world with NordVPN. They have servers in America, in France, in the UK, in India, in Singapore, all the way 
all the way around the world, you can go no problemos with NordVPN. Remember promo code Jeeves TV. Jeeves, I hear you say, what use is a Nord? What use is a VPN to me? What even is a VPN? Why, it's a virtual private network. Your voice all over the world with a secret tunnel network. But with this, you can use it for streaming and unblocking content, protecting your identity and personal information, anonymous commenting and publishing. Reddit, you know what I'm talking about. Yes, prevent throttling and the speed of your internet. Hmm, you've been, you've been tracking your IP and you've been downloading too much stuff. Not anymore, not with no VPN. The problem, the GDPR, you can't get into that juicy article. Not with no VPN, we can get you right in there. You can save money on travel. Do you know that depending on where you order your holiday from, depends on the price. What? Yes, indeed. Jeeves, what was the code? I've forgotten already. It was Jeeves. Promo code Jeeves, do to TV. Yes, get over there for a 68% discount. Alright, Sofa looks good. Alright, Sofa looks good. I'll see you later, buddy. Alright, we're 9 out of 10 in the lobby, guys. We're 9 out of 10. Do you want to develop an app?
Take care. Production delay, guys. It's going to be at least five minutes. Don't, don't freak out.
All right, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, a welcome back to the SL Meisterschaft Spring 2021. It's <laughs> United versus Brahma. Game three, best of five, by the way, best of five, Jeeves, indeed, indeed. Is it this one? Negatory, it's this one, Jeeves. Okay. It's now 1-1. One, one. All right, all right. We are racing through the bands here. Get rid of Pango, Timber, Medusa, and Lena, and pick up the Ancient Apparition. Okay, you don't want to build around Medusa this time. was a little bit on the loud side, gentlemen, a little bit on the loud side. Grande. Okay, Mars could be a thing. Phoenix. They're not going to pick Phoenix. They might pick Phoenix on Hee Hee United. But against Ancient Operation Jeeves, yeah. You, you really gotta pick a hero. You gotta so they want the cookie to get people out of the cold feet situation, right? Um, you, All right. You better pick your hero. Five seconds. Come on, Dire Team. Pick it, pick it good. Faceless Void. This is good and bad. Faces Void plus Snapfire combo beautifully together in regards to nuking people, uh, you know, and groups of people while they're in Chrono. Very cool. But Ancient Operation one was an easy target for the AA alt. Oh man, Rick, there's only 10 seconds left to pick a hero. Yeah, th 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 there's five seconds left now. Oh, you guys, do we have game oh, signs? Wraith King. King. We do. We, we do. Excellent. All right. Wraith King, Ancient Wraith Apparition. King. You don't really care about Chrono too much. Oh no, I'm dead. Don't worry, I'll be back in five seconds. It's three seconds, James. Sure, it's not five. I'm pretty sure it's five. Uh, ten seconds to pick you get the TA. Yeah, th th to get the TA. Yeah, they want to be able to do things into Chrono now as well. Like you've got the Wraith King, he probably goes for like a Radiance build in this game. Armlet Radiance, Jeeves, probably. <laughs> Centaur, get on the ass for Faceless Elaine versus, take out the Queen of Pain. Well, they want Disco Stew or some shit, right? They want Disco Stew or Invoker or... Uh, they want a squishy... Zero. Uh, magic boy mid. Who will be able to lane and get powerful before Faces Void is online. Elder Titonus, kick to the curb. This is fine. I don't think Brahma we're going to pick it though. I think they need something a bit more active like the Lion Shadow Shaman. I want to see some disables. I, Shadow Shaman feels okay here, right? For Brahma? Brahm, Jeeves. Oh, for Brahm. It feels okay for Brahm. What makes you say that, Jeeves? Well, Five it's lockdown and shit that you can do in, in, in Chrono, right? Same with Lion, I guess. Could go for that Gyrocopter five from before. Uh, no, I think this is the four they're looking for. I think Ancient Operation is five, right? I think as well between Skelly Boys, Ancient Operation, uh, Cold Feet. On the Wraith Fire Blast, you can probably get kills, right, in that lane. You, you, you really gotta pick a hero. You got ten seconds left. Yeah, th 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 five seconds left now. Radiant team pick. 
Shiny. Not coming in. Alright, I would love to see, like, the Skywrath Mage. Very squishy, Jeeves. It is squishy. Dark Willow, but then you've got... What about Chrono Damage? You could get a Disco left. Stew of their own. Disco Stew, very powerful versus Wraith King with a shard. Alright, they are taking a fair amount of time to think about this one, boys. Alright, what can we get The jumps on Ancient Apparition? What about Clockwork? Shadow Demon. Shadow Demon. It's actually super good. They get the lion, Jeeves. They get the lion. They were listening. They were listening good and proper. There's two reasons for getting the lion here. Um, over the shadow shaman specifically, the lion's right-click damage is lower. So when shadow da demon gets lion illusions early, they're not worth taking. Where shadow shaman illusions are probably pimp as hell, man. Also, um, so with the Shadow Demon, the uh, you can throw poison into the Chrono, but I think the big play is the the Soul Catcher, right? Taking that thirty percent HP off is going to be a big a big help for early Chrono kills. Rude, mama. I mean, Wraith King was already building the few uh, building Radiance anyway, right? Lion, I guess it forces him towards being a bit greedier. You really wish you had Shadow Shaman now, though, don't you, bro? Uh, ten seconds to pick your hero, you moron. I wouldn't mind. Um, you, you, you better pick your hero. Fudge. I was gonna say Legion Commander, but that's terrible, right? Because the Shadow Demon is just gonna screw you over. What about um, Uber Lord? Bit annoying for Faceless Void to deal with in the lane, right? And you have the roots. You've got the you got the firestorm. You build a glide near glide near's ass on Uberlord though, Jeeps. It's not bad. What about Bloodseeker then? Not optimal versus Faceless Void. It's kind of good versus Brood though. Especially if you go glide near glide near. Nah, it's, I just, I'm not sold on Gleipnir versus Breedmother, honestly. Because what does he do these days? He builds like a hood, right? And into a pipe, so this, the babies don't care. You can't go for like a Battle Fury type solution. I, what about Kunkka? Just get Kunkka. Kunkka. Kunkka! Kunkka! I like Kunkka here. I think Kunkka is the most deep broody hero now. Mars. Yeah, Mars is alright as well, actually. God's Rebuke. Arena. So, what is the build then? Crimson Guard and... No, Solar Crest, maybe? No. Crimson Guard and BKB. Kunkka... I know Kunga, um, Kunga loses. Kunga loses, Jez. Kunga loses. Where is the Brood going? Brood is going to be offline for sure, right? Need a mid hero for hee <laughs> hee. Radiant team fan. Wait. They get rid of Puck, they get rid of Death Prophet. Okay. Puck. 
Puck, 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 puck. Is very good at catching brood, right? Because of the coil. I think he he have got a pretty significant lineup here, boys. You, you really gotta pick a hero. You got ten seconds left. They could still get Kunka on Brahma. Um, you, you, you I think it's good. I think you can throw damage with torrent and shit. You can disrupt Chrono with torrent. You can throw boat in to help your bros out. You can X brood mama. You can slap her crap out. I don't know if I like the support combination for all that physicals. No save for Chrono so far. Hmm. Radiant team ban. Save for Chrono on a court. Like OD? OD? They're kind of dumb on He United. Seconds, What's the back code for Brahmi as one, right? Obviously. Pinky on the brain. Pinky on the brain. One is a genius. The other's insane. They take out the Tide Hunter. Tide Hunter is pretty good versus Brute. Wait, why would you take out Brute? What? The... Is... Doom. 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 You mid. Alright. But that scorched earth, Luke, right? Oh man, Rick, there's only 10 seconds left to pick a hero. Yeah, there's five seconds left now. Alright, what are we looking for here? A nice mid hero. Not too bothered by Doom. So I'm thinking Disco Stew is pretty sexy. It gives them the extra push and also Dragon Knight. SD overrides any hero with saves in Chrono. No, OD. He could save him with OD. Axe, what? Alright, of course. The classic axe mid. What now? Are they gonna switch up lanes? Maybe. I'm dead. I mean, Jeeve coins does it cost for you to play a pub with me? Well, you'd have to be friends with me first, so that's 500,000 Jeeve coins. And then actually get me to play a pub with you? You probably would need at least a Jeeve coin balance of 2 million. But it wouldn't cost you anything to play a pub game. Alrighty, this is game three of the ESL Meisterschaft Spring 2021 for He He United. JM Vincento on the Snapfire, Yuma on the Faceless Void, Alex on the Shadow Demon, Devai Lama on the Broodmother, and HWA on the Axe. Oh, brain. It's Spartan ancient apparition. Focus on the skeleton king. Luft lion. Cupe Marge. Kaito on the Doom. Is this mid Marsh? I am um, General Jeevigus. Let's get our Dota 2 on. All right, all right, all right. <laughs> I should make two teams from chat. I don't think we've ever had that much interest from chat. We do have a Discord where there's all these Discords of games that we could play together, but nobody ever wants to play any of the games. Two points draft advantage to Hee Hee Jeeves. Indeed, indeed. Is it mango flavored? Eh, no. Yep, there are discords, gentlemen. Join the discord. Play games. SD saves from Doom, sure does. Alright, 
right, we're good to go. Let's camera action. Oh. Saj. All right, close the bats. Close the bats. Did not close the bats. Oh, that is cool. Wait. I can't even draw on the map. What is this? Oh, I can't. He's got the thing where if you hold your button, you can do like a long streak like you get if you're doing coaching. Right, said Fred, here's what we'll do. Who are you, Ma? He's got six tangos, Jeeves. Yes, and a quelling blade. Going to build himself a wraith then. Very nice. Three iron branches. <gasps> Maybe this. Maybe this one. Maybe this guy. Alright. Alright. No mangoes, though. No mangoes. That's a pretty cool spider. The malevolent mother back. <laughs> you make best situation out of no situation. Alright, Chado Demon making a move over here. He doesn't need smoke or anything like that, you know, he could just walk on up there. Yuma, trying to make the same play here. That'll be a nice big smoke play coming through underneath the outpost. Vision gonna get given. Hello, it is I, J.M. Vincento. Yikes. Oh, the cookie away, the spear. Mm, a little bit of a Blake spear under the tower. That's going to be that. You make best situation out of no situation. You got a homeless shatter of hey, hey, loses, bro. Never ever bet more than you can afford. If you ever feel like yourself, you're in a situation where you feel like you're going to bet more than you can afford, give the money to Jeeves instead. You know, the name is Jeeves. No well, Wait, no, that's not right. Either way, Alex gets himself a cheeky bounty rune here. Going to back off. Kaito got one on the other side of the map. So 50, 50, right? Yeah. Nothing too exciting. So we got this mid axe, guys. The mid axe. Are we believers in the mid axe versus the mid, uh, the mid Mars? He's like, oh, oh no. Surely this can't be good. Okay, Mr. CS feels bad, man. Okay, nice one. Nice, nice. Yes, a deny as well. Okay, okay. Why does it not seem good, Jeeves? Well, I mean, they've put the um, they've put the Martian versus the Axe, right? And Mars is not exactly known for the amount of right clicks that he does to you. Right? I think they were expecting maybe um, no, maybe the Doom. I don't know even. What I mean, why would you? I mean, he probably doesn't lose that lane, right? Oh, there's a stun to start things off. We talked about the cold feet potential. It's a little bit late in arriving, though. It's a... Uh... Get him out alive, pop off the salve. Doesn't get the deny. Feels bad, man. That was a CS he missed, Jeez. That's even worse. Oh, nice pull through. The Divai Llama. The positioning here is very nice, by the way. He's saving a skill point right now. He stole his mana up. No stuns left, unfortunately. Deny. Ok. 
Okay. A little bit of web action. It's fine. It's fine. The mid lane. What's happening here? 10 and 2 versus 9 and 0. Yep. He has a few deny advantage for sure. No, 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 no. Yeah, I know what you mean. I know what you mean. I was thinking the same thing, right? I think uh, Mars definitely wanted the spider for sure. Because. Like, with the passive. Even a couple of points in passive, the spider is not really... Spider's a pain in the ass early, right? Because of the damage she can do physically to you. Wait, you get Bola when? Alright, 100 damage at level 1. That's not at all broken, Ice Troll. Make it AT, please. Thank you. Rescale damage. Yes, perfect. Oh, rat -ta -ta. Ooh, Kaito a little bit deep there, Brosif. What did he devour up? Nothing of interest yet, jeez. Oh, okay. He does have a solve ready to go. Do your snipe from left. Is it possible? Is it the dream? He can't quite find the angle. Wait, if he goes back for it though, maybe. Where did that courier go? Oh, he's, he's hiding in the trees. He's hiding in the trees. He's trying to bait him. He's trying to bait him. Just thinking about it. Nice. Yes, there we go. The courier is making a break for it. Left. He doesn't know, guys. He doesn't know. Courier will get out successfully. Game okay, Vincento. He's got the uh, the old Blightstone there. Is that a Blightstone or a Dire Stone? It's a Blightstone. Uh, do you like more Ricky or Slark to carry you? All, already pressing the report button if either of those two heroes are my carry. Yo! First, first blood we saw it. On second blood. Not quite. The body blocks are there. Ooh, could you get crept? No, he's fine. He's fine. Um, at super high skill levels, though, I think probably Slark, honestly. I mean, Ricky's cool. I don't really rate either Kari. I'm a big Bloodseeker player, though, so Slarks don't impress me much. Silken Bola doing a decent amount of damage, forces out the salve. Doesn't have any mana left to work with. I'd probably suicide at this point. This is a bit scary from Focus. He needs that stun to keep himself in action. He does have 15 stick charges, though. That's pretty relevant. Pretty relevant. And his wave is not exactly in a comfortable position, I'll tell you what, Bobby. Okay, now with the cold feet to start things off, the stun there to open it up. He popped off that stick. Nice, this should be enough. One more hit. Oh no, the save from Alex. Alright, top middle or bottom, guys. He picked right the first time. One more, he gets it. Spartan with the right click. Wow. Wow. Actually, three poison stacks on these spiders nibbling at his heels. He needs to be very careful. The stick goes off. Back time. Never mind. Oh, oh, oh. Damn, Jeeves. We missed a, we missed a left kill. You want to see the left kill, guys? Fair enough. It was happening at the same time. I, I thought, you know... They don't get Kaito, though, right? Kaito gets out. Kaito survives. Okay, Jam Vincento. He pops the solve. Oh! That was well worth watching the replay of, guys. I don't want to hear no complaints. That was amazing. Did you see that? Oh, you got like two seconds of salvation. Enough to keep him in the fight. Usually it's Spartan dying. Dude, he self played that. That was, that was super cool. Wait, Spartan did die. Jim Vincento was the, was the player. No illusion micro made it clear who the brood player was. Um, I don't know. He was on him immediately. Like, I think he guessed and he just guessed right with the first one. You know what I mean? But yeah, that's what Alex was saying sorry for. Because like if he makes a better play there with the illusions, maybe uh, he doesn't get spotted so easily. Hardcore spikes. Oh. Uh, Luft is dying tiny. He's got the tranquil booties, boys. He's got the tranquil booties. Yuma going for Mask of Madness into Power Treads. Phase Boots into Fool 1 for Doom. Axe. Phase Boots, I guess, into Vanguard. I, it's real weird to see this mid axe, huh? He's got a ball. Interesting. Ours of the bottle as well, of course. Of course. Of course. 
See, I don't know, like, so the whole idea of the bottle on Mars, like, obviously the bottle on the mid is to secure the mid rooms. Like, fair enough. Makes sense. The bottle on Mars is like a trade-off you make, right? Do you want a bottle or do you want a soul ring? And I see sometimes offlaners with the bottle instead of the soul ring, and I'm just kind of like... But why? You know? Soul ring is a very sexy item. Its power is uh, only exceeded by its mystery. I mean, let's look at it. Let's take a little breakdown of the soul ring here. Right? Look at this bad boy. Look at this shit. Plus six strength, so you're a strength hero, right? So you're doing you're doing plus six damage. It gives plus two armor, and then you can swap 170 health for 150 mana every 10 seconds. Well, not every 10 seconds. You've got like a cooldown of 25 seconds, so its uptime is 15 seconds. You know, 150 mana. What does that do for you as a Mars? Well, gives you a spear, or a god's rebuke, or an arena. Pretty good, that's pretty good. Was that a continuum transfunctional reference? Yeah, I think it was. I think it definitely was. 100%. I know the one you're talking about. It's mystery and power? Yeah, that was absolutely that. Yo. Have you ever played, um, yeah, have you ever played uh, Faster Than Light? Ryan Oak, have you ever played uh, Faster Than, FTL it's called, have you ever played that? Ever seen any real toxicity in pro, oh no, okay. There's a species of aliens in Faster Than Light. There's like a there's a race called the Zoltan. And every time I see that species or I'm in that ship, every time I see the word Zoltan, I just hear this this um, funky music, uh, you know, electrical music playing, you know, for Zoltan coming in. <laughs> I wanted to know if uh, if anyone else had that same problem. If anyone would have, I thought it would be you. Zoltan. Yeah, every time you see them. This goes to show you the old sense, memory, perception, recall does work, guys. Does work. Okay. Alex gonna scoop up the arcane rune. It's one to two. Yo, Brood, are you okay? Windows update, oh yeah, for shizzles, that's what you said, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. Well guys, you should use Linux, because you know what happens with Windows, right? When you open Windows, you let the bugs in. Yeah, oh, JM Vincento, a little cookie back in the way. They thought they were the ones getting on him. They are kind of the ones getting on him, if we're honest here. They they murdered him. They 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 brutalized that poor old, old lady. That was a war crime. Okay, nice call, nice call. Wow, nice dunk on top. Very nice, very tasty. War crimes. He's yeah, Mars. He's the god of war, right? Real gamers write their own kernels. Exactly, exactly. What is this? Game Spy. We don't need that looking into our internals. Right, Divai Lama. Level 5, about to get level 6. That's when the pain starts with the Brood Mama lane. Focus is in here. He's level 6. He's trying to bring down Mr. Shadow Demon. Is it working? He is dead, Jeeves. So, mission accomplished. HWA, though, looks for Luft on the backside. He wants a Dunkaroo. It's a little bit more. A few more hits. One more. No, it's on that, actually. He's got such little HP. And he gets a 
barn kill from the blood rage. <laughs> uh, that happened to me the other day, guys. I was running around in the mid lane, and I killed like three guys. Like we we had been getting really punished. I mean, not me. I was in the jungle, obviously. We've been getting really punished, and I killed like three guys on the comeback here. And I was like running down, running back the way, and it's like you have killed life stealer. And so I got like an, a, a mega kill, and I was like, wait, what? Life stealer was like over here. And my scaly boys had run up to him and during the team fight and just like giving him the final slap. <laughs> oh no. Ah, he throws the arena, he throws the spear, gives him the god tribute, dang. And that uh, scene. Perfect. HWA now going back for the Vanguard. Gonna give him a little bit of initiation station. Yeah, I know, I know, I know, I know. And then he's like, shh, shh, shh. Enough. Okay, the stun now. Give him the old Infernal Blade, dude. Oh, yeah. Ronnie's slain again. But once again, you know, it's 10 minutes in. People turning up to the tier one tower bomb. It's all about holding the line, guys. Holding the line. I mean, this line has been there. I mean, they have very much owned that side of the map now, dudes. Yup, yup, yup. Rude will completely contaminate the top lane, though. Arcane Rune, very cool, very cool. Wait, Arcane Rune on Mars. Okay. okay. And a bottle up. I was thinking it was Doom. I was like, oh yeah. Rude net worth. Yeah, any second now she's gonna start dominating this lane, guys. Any second. Any second now, Divai Lama. He's getting the hood build, Jeeves. You did comment on this. There's a nice arena opening up. Shadow Demon. Mm, not quite Shadow Demon yet. Not quite Shadow Demon. Yuma, he does have Arena. Arena, I mean, he has um, Chronosphere. The Doom is ready to roll with Doom. Mm hmm. It's level 1 Doom, though, so it's not really that threatening, you know? It's like, eh, eh, I do maybe level 1 Doom. Oh, it's like a, you know, instead of getting the flu, it's like getting the cold, getting the cold you know? Ah, eh. How'd you feel? Eh, I'm a wee bit doomed, you know? As opposed to, we're all doomed. Right, he has the Vanguard, he has the phase booties, he's got the Libresor. Davai Lama up with the arcane booties. Building mech, I, is he building a mech? No. This feels like such a shitty lane from a go to no matter what, right? Yo, talking about shitty. HWA trying to run away. The save is on though. Alex, the turn around. Damn, hits him up with the uh, soul catcher, did he? I think so. No, he doesn't even have Soul Catcher. What the hell killed his energy? Did he just use his armor? He did. Okay, never mind. Ignore me, gentlemen. Jungle, jungle, jungle. I'm thinking about spamming Brood for a bit, guys. Mm. Mm. I was drinking my tea, guys. I was drinking my tea. Don't worry, I got you. I got you. That was pretty good. I could have sworn I heard this dude though. I did, he was just pushing the tower at the same time. Okay, they're ready to turn on this. HWA looking for the angle, rushing ahead of him. The Wraith Fire Blast says no, the call quite a little bit out of range and after the TP, I'm gonna help a bro out. I don't think he TP'd, he's got the rage on him for some reason. And meanwhile, by the way, while that's happening, Brood is chunking away here. Coupe pushing him back. More stun, more tower action, armlet action again. Okay, what's happening up top? Okay, cool.
Armal and Radiance Jeeves. Yeah, 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 yeah. I mean, I wouldn't mind seeing a Shiva's Guard as well coming in. Wait. I mean, that's on me. That's on me. He keeps getting him like this. Like, how does he. Oh. A little help from Spartan. It's easy peasy. Okay, okay. They're going in, by the way. Yeah, best of five, best of five. Nice illusions. Look at this ripping through focus. He pop, go, pops off the armlet. Toggle turns back in, trying to fight his own illusions here. The rest of the boys helping him out. A little suckening from lines. Good thing. Bit of one of them instantly. They don't drop any bodies. I mean, Faceless Void was down during out that fight, though. I'm gonna apply some pressure back in here. Double damage on the river. Yo, focus. Oh, QP is gonna ball up. Okay, okay. Got any scaly boys? He's got three boys ready to go. Right, he's, he's coming in here. Take the tower down. A little bit of poison damage. It's real difficult to push into a Shadow Demon though, especially when he's got plenty of mana. Uh, which illusions are stronger? Darkseer, Wall Illusions, Grimstroke Portrait, or Shadow Demon Illusions? I think it's Grimstroke Portrait, right? I think Grimstroke Portrait. It could be Darkseer though. The thing about darks here is you have the potential to have um, 20 illusion heroes that are all doing hero damage. You know what I mean? Well, with the darks here, the portrait just does like straight up 100% damage. The portrait deals 150%. Yeah, but there's only one of them. Do you know what I mean? Whereas if you got the Darkseer wall with Refresher on the Talon, that's like four walls, man. Alright, they go for the Chrono, they will catch out the Mars, dropping the damage in down time, but he's not overly concerned by this, I have to say. Now he is, though, the Dunkaroo gonna hold him in place, now they look for plus one, they find Kaito, start to force him back, Cookie in. Axe is there, ready, he doesn't have a call, I think he does have one in a second. Two dunks for the double kill. Now the blink forward. He goes for Wraith Daddy, pulling him back towards the fight. Remember, he's got armlet. He's got uh, resurrection. He can come back. He can come back. Tower's time, though. And Brood Mama. I mean, he's definitely building a mechanism, slowly but surely. I like the components he's got up here, though. He gets the buckler for plus two armor. He gets the headdress regeneration for the HP. It's cool, man. It's cool. It's like a little budget kind of... Uh, a little budget setup for his, his, his spider babes. Pushing the pipe. But well, this is super good if the enemy are going to be coming at you with magic based clearance. So in this case, the, the Rape King is building Rape here. So the pipe all of a sudden doesn't feel so good. Um, but the God's Rebuke will still be pretty painful for the spiders. Yo, are they, what are they doing? They're having an arena battle downtown. The save is there, QP ready with the arrow. Granny is toast. Back up here, Spider-Man, focus. Did toggle at the right time, so was able to absorb the damage there. Yo, Axmid is doing work, guys. Axmid is doing work. And I think this is just about the Brood, right? Because Brood actually prefers it if you just leave her alone. Like, she's scary and all, but it, she wants you just to go and do other stuff. So if Ax is in there and he's messing with other people, it's a good time. Alright, HWA, he's got himself the Vanguard, he's got the Blink, he's got Manta style, very cool. Somebody just picked up Van Braces. I don't know who got them. Did you guys see? Was it Wraith King? Yeah, Wraith King got it, okay. Van Braces are pretty great, I am alright, honestly. I wish it was an item you could buy. Do you, Jeeves, what would you build? I mean, you could build it from like Null Tallies or something. Wraith, Wraith Mans. Two wraith bands and a recipe or something. I don't know. 
But then we'd have to take up another slot. Like where it is at the moment, you kind of... It's kind of a good place. Is this a neutral item? What if you got three neutral item slots? Is that too powerful? Uh, okay. That's the worst possible scenario, right? They're going into the pit right now. Is that, I mean, the, most of the AOE damage from Roche is the clapping, right? So the pipe totally protects the spiders, I guess. I mean, the Solar Crest, so it gives them super early Roche potential. The Call with Axe to tank it with big armor. Yeah, this is great. They don't even know. Do they do use one. They only have one purge as well. Okay. Alright, they chase forward. They have an Aegis up on Yuma. Yuma ready. Now the spear from downtown. The stinky pinky as well. Bam! Okay, he goes through the chrono on the back line. Line is going to be the one that he wants, but the Doom going to come out a little bit early. Remember, he has the Aegis. Even though they take down the first life here. Oh, he's toast. He dodged it? No, he got kicked away. Nice, la. Nah, he's going to survive the Doom as well. He didn't even break the Aegis. Jeez, what nonsense is this? That kooky man! Hey Wishful, what's up? How you doing? We are doing some ESL Meister Shift Shaft. Is it Jawmons? A bit of damage. All right, we do have the Radiance finished up, building into Blink Dagger. Eight Vampiric Skeleton. The Skeleton Charge is ready to push a wave, Jeeves. I think you push top, right? You get a freebie. Push back into the Spider Queen. Yeah, 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 yeah. I think this is my only stream this weekend, so um, I'm pretty happy. I'm pretty happy. Yeah, I know, but I like to have the I like to have the double brace or double wraith band with the uh, with the van brace. That's what I'm saying. So like making it take up a slot. Eh, actually, if it just takes one slot, then you're already getting an extra slot, I guess. All right, they're charging forward here. Chrono Boy committing for this. The spiders railing on left. He is toast now. They go for a little play out on KTO here. Pops off the BKB, the stomping. Scorched Earth. It's not going to be enough as they do bring him down in the end. Uh oh, uh oh. They go looking for focus. They're focusing. Focus, jeez. Maybe, maybe. He looks for the Blink Dagger still. Vi Lama, though, all over the place. Look at the slow from the Silken Bola. How is this balanced? Hi, Yuma, still with the Aegis. One, two and a half minutes left on it. Goblin through that mid tower, now beating down the Skelly Boys. Spiders versus Skeletons. It's a great new tower defense game. One of you will play as the undead, the other will play as the Spider Queen. It is best of five. It is best of five. We have at least, what, two more series after this? Is that right? Yes. No, one more. One more series after this. Yeah. At least. That's the two. All right, all right, all right. Davai Lama, he's got the Lotus Orb. He's got the Pipe of Insight. He's building another Lotus Orb. No, I don't think he is, Jeeves. I think he's building Guardian Greaves. Wait, is he though? Maybe he builds Travels. Hmm. Hmm, Solar Crest for Snap Daddy. 
QP, blink, beak, B, desolator, phase booties, pretty normal stuff. Focus going for Sanj and Yasha. I kind of want a Shiva's guard or an AC or something here. Okay, you was smoked up, ready for some action here. His Aegis only has 30 seconds, there's 20 seconds left on it, so. Are you sure about that? It says best of three on Liquipedia. I'm 50% sure. 50% sure. 68%, I'm 68% sure. Will they fight until they drop, Jeeves? Yes, best of 25, let's go. This Dasso was a bit flashier. It's cool as hell. Like, you mean melee Dasso? Yeah, and I know what you mean. Like, range Dasso was cool as hell, right? But melee Dasso? I have Dasso. You know. Oh, you think just the item in good name? No, the item's awesome, honestly. Feels underwhelming versus Aji Cores. It's not for Aji Cores. It's for early Roche. It's for uh, tower taking potential. It's for a little bit of AC on the enemy. You know? Or unless you go all in on minus armor, of course. But yeah, it's not, that's not what it's for. You don't build it for that. Skelly boys running through here. They go in on top of Axe. This is pretty sweet. Gets the BKB off, but guess what? You're already a little bit frostbitten, my friend. Trying to bring him down to that threshold. Not gonna work. They drop the bombs. They get a little bit confused. Now the arena coming downtown. Ah, and Mars saved at the last second. Chrono Boy can't get in to the arena. <laughs> Uh, probably took more damage from the Radiance now. This is happening, happening. The Doom comes out. He ain't gonna get out unless he gets cooked up to the high ground, which should come through. No, the finger of fun from Mr. Luft says otherwise. Yeah, like, so, like, if you go, like, a Monkey King bar, Mjolnir, or Monkey King bar, plus any other ramp your damage, like, you basically want the magic damage versus Saji Course, right? But you want the MKB, so their armor just doesn't mar. Their evasion, who cares? Radiance feels really good in that situation as well. The thing is as well, if you can guarantee that you're going to hit them and potentially stun them, then just building an incredible amount of damage plus crits is enough to fuck uh, RG heroes. You know, if you can guarantee that you're going to hit them with an the MKB or whatever, crits are the way you go. Cause let's look at Void, he has 2.8k HP, that's not bad, that's not bad, that's like 5 hits, right? 6 hits, maybe 4 with crits. Double damage on the river here. Axe is the one that gets it, okay. Wait, they blink up to the high ground? Um, okay, they take the kill, but focus, now what you gonna do? He's gonna blink down in three seconds time guys. Okay, he's coming down. He's down Charge down the lane 14 to 15 5k net worth Like all of this action from Brame, right? It's been forcing bro forcing broodmother away from playing up here, right? Which is what she needs to be doing Does he have travels? Mm, he's going for the AC. He's going for the AC. Going for the AC. For the extra damage on the skeletons or what? Helpful as well, I guess. Versus God's rebuke on Mars. Okay. Okay. I mean, I, I can see. Yeah, I can see reasonings. Taking back the outpost. The swing must be looking pretty good. Uh, yeah. I mean, 84. I mean. It, 
Jesus, I actually thought he he were ahead for a fair amount of the game there. Brood is prepared for uh, team fights. But AC almost done. I'd like to see some travels. I honestly feel like you could be making more pressure on the map. But maybe that's not your job in this game. Maybe this is initiation, you know. Get information, get vision. Oh, a golden shower for Coupe there. What does that get him? What does that get him, guys? Maybe a salve? Building an AC of his own already with the plate mail in hand. I mean, this Broodmother already has 36 armor. What's the roast situation? Aegis, Cheese, and Shard? You want to get a pick off before you try this. Did somebody just smoke? I don't know, I don't know. Oh, the illusions. All right, okay, okay. They send the spiders in to have a little sneaky peeky. You know, the Skeleton King is in there. Send in some Axe illusions. These are cool illusions, though. Oh. Spider babies. Send in another wave of them. Okay, okay. I mean, the Radiance allows you to mess around just a little bit with the Spider Babies. Oh no, the Spider Babies. They just keep God's rebuking them. He keeps giving them 20 or 30 gold. They're 9 gold each, Jeeves. There was 5 of them. That's 35 gold. Yeah, okay. The call. Talking about giving gold here. Focus. Nice time to toggle, bro. As he eats some Spider Damage. Turning back into it. The first life dunk down. Alright, here comes the arena. Faceless Void gets bubble saved just in time. They drop in the snap fire bombs down time. They go looking for the chrono. Who do they find on the back line? It's Mr. Doom. I'm gonna bring him down in time. Negatory, sir. BKB out. Popped it up. Turning it back the other way. QP for some reason was uh, feeling the wrath, but I'm sure you want to right click that guy in the face, honestly. Alright, the call did some serious work, but they take down Faceless Void. Is he dead? Axe, 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 he's alive! Okay, cool. Uh, shotgun blast plus one, QP trying to survive. Axe came back and gets an AA blast to the face. Can they get the spider mom as well? They do. What even happened there? What the fuck, only one guy died? That makes no sense. That makes no sense. Show me the fight recap, guys. There. He bought back, right? The Doom bought back? I thought AA died for sure. Alright, they go in. They throw down the fortification. What's the situation, Jeeves? You go buy box on Axe, buy box on Brood Mama. First one comes to remember. This is a mid Axe. They back off, go back looking for Roshan. Sounds perfect to me, especially give the Doom the Aegis, man. I mean, 77 seconds until Doom's off cooldown. So I don't know about that. Maybe not. Wraith King with a Sansa Jasha. What is he building to next? Does he get shard from this? He does get shard from this. But does he need shard? No, shard goes to Mars. Oh, for the speeding of the two plus units and the fire, the flaming trail is pretty good. Actually, it gives them some extra AOE versus the Spider Queen. Okay, that was uh, that was interesting. Yep, this is good. I like the fire here. Oh, Lux immediately gets his thingamajig, Paul Perude. Can't finger while the Aeon disc is up, right? Or he doesn't do any damage. Arena will be used, takes the spider out of the equation for 94 seconds. Brame on the high ground, dropping the whole spider baby load. That's only plus eight though, Jeeves. True, true. Quickly dealing with their illusions. Skelly Boy is going to work, gonna take down this set of rocks. Meanwhile, Yuma, he's found two bounty rooms. Excellent, excellent. Not enough for first buyback, his buybacks will cool down, I believe. Yes, Jeeves, six and a half minutes. Radiance top barracks. Oh, Radiance top barracks. Oh, okay. Alright, they're gonna take one of his lives. Here comes Yuma, drops the chrono. That's a lot of spell damage, a lot of magic damage goes in, does a little doom and 
Does he have another life? He's gonna try and get out of here. It's working. Okay, love through that backside, dealing with the granny. They melt through axe. Now they turn around to Stinky Pinky is off cooldown. Three down, four down, GG. That's just it. Game over. Good effort. They threw everything in the kitchen sink, guys. And it did not, uh. It did not work out. Alright, alright, alright. Let me check, let me check, just to see, to see. Wait. You know what? Maybe it was a best of three. Oh no. So Brain wins? Is that right? Oh no. Liquipedia said it was a best of three. Let me, uh, let me update the score for Brain. Really? Oh no, I really wanted to see like five more matches of this back and forth. Are you shitting me? Did they just launch straight into the next game? Like, okay. No, Monica. No! The best of three? I fucking knew it. it made me change. Oh, why listen to Twitch chat, man? Are they offline? Did, is that, did they already leave? What about their winners and their shit? No, they're still alive, they're still alive. Let me see, let me see the German stream. It is best of three, you idiots. No. All right, whatever. Saj. Lapo Lapo guys. Lapo Lapo. Alright, well, I mean that was fun. I uh, Honestly I would have preferred if it went to the best of five. I think uh he he I think he he United definitely had more to show us, and I think Brain got through that one by the skin of their teeth. Honestly. I think uh definitely would be down for a best of five here. Anyway guys, multiple sages, I know, I know. Lepo Lepo, team is ending. Subs today, feels bad, man. Right. Who were the winners? Brain, well done, guys, well done. Well done. Are we gonna raid anyone? No, 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 no. 200 people, oh. Everyone that bet on Brain has been rewarded. That was Kanchi with 8,000 and Thek Aron. Thanks guys for joining me, by the way. I know it's not my usual stuff. And uh, it was just, uh, we thought we'd give an English perspective to the Meister, Meisterschaft Spring 2021 final days there. Much love. Hopefully back with some Chinese soda soon. We'll see, we'll see. Red Star Cup for the win. The win. 